Hey everybody, it's Sandwich. Welcome Ow. to the Sand Stream. I guess I'm calling it that now. Uh, is that a shard of You should call it the hand? Sand Trap, dude. Come on. The Sand oh, Trap. That's really good. I like trap music, you know. Uh, We're in the cut here on Sandwich Stream. Welcome everybody. I hope you're excited because, uh, yeah, this is the Boomer Shooter Stream. It's a really stupid title for a genre but i think it's kind of hilarious uh basically it's gonna be a retro shooter stream we're gonna you know i got a few uh you know old ass games on the docket here some build engine stuff ion fury i'm probably gonna start with uh nice got, nice yeah yeah dusk is probably lined up maybe some duke 3d um hello lady mist what's up maybe some hexen, hello. hexen nope that's not happening. Doom three, Hard. absolutely not. Um, yeah, but, yeah. <laughs> System Shock two, maybe. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you know, in, if you play System Shock two, you can use the the cranium blade. Oh, <laughs> the brain sword. <laughs> you, is there a joke about? What was that? Is there a joke about sand hating Hexen that I haven't heard yet? I you know what I don't think I've ever played Hex and I just hear enough about it that I that the progression is just stupid that I it, don't it is a game I'm, though. Heretic and Hexen were amazing resource packs for Doom levels and that's about all they were. <laughs> yeah, uh, like a turn yeah. Doom for one. Yeah, exactly. So uh, same with Daggerfall. Although Daggerfall has a little bit of value as its own game as well, not much, but you know. It's I, yeah, but in that one you made, I felt like, like the uh, the Daggerfall happening. stuff was just kind of clashing with the sci-fi. I didn't really know what you were going for there, you know. <laughs> so you call yourself okay, a comedian, huh? Bobby, <laughs> yeah. When you don't need that, right? Yes, we do. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Um, yeah, so I was testing out a few of these games uh, earlier just to make sure. Things working and uh, Iron yeah, Fury was pretty fun for the little I was playing of it. Uh, hey Francis, uh, I'm pretty good. How are you, Doom guy? What's up, Diego? Baxter That's Bunny. Basket case. Don't forget, Doom guy. Uh, casket Crusher. Yeah. Um. And uh, I'm sorry, Baxter Bunny. Is that? Is that someone? Are you new, or is that the other bun bunny person? No, Baxter Bunny has been in many Doom comment sections for at least a year now, so they're definitely cool. not new. Uh, to my stream, though. To, uh, I'm not sure about your exact house on this driveway or like on this street, but they've been on this street. Okay, because like I've got I've got a bunny in my in my. You're server, thinking of Bunny but, Bun, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. It's not bunny bunny. Is it? That's a different bunny. There's many doom bunnies out there. We are we are pro bunny here. Uh, furry neutral. Pro bono. Pro bunny. Pro, we are. <laughs> we are pro, pro you too. Oh. Pro bono. You too. Uh, Francis, I am absolutely <laughs> loving hello, Lost Civ. Hello. It should be pretty Ooh. obvious by my by my videos that I'm absolutely loving Lost Civilization. Um, that map I that I played that you weren't a big fan. Honestly. Yeah, that okay. la map four that I played, Chukum actually said that was his favorite in the wild. So it may have peaked early, but map four of Lost Civilization River Valley is uh, a magnum opus of the highest regard. It is like the biggest, most detailed, most fun map that I've played in a while. It just never it never ends, and yet it never like overstays its welcome. There's just so much to it. I, How many maps are there all up in the one? It's like twenty-two, but they're some of them are huge. Twenty-two? Um, For some reason, I forgot it was that long. Well, I mean, map four is like would be like five maps for some other wads. Like, it's uh, yeah. Francis says it's a masterpiece. I might have to do a deep dive video on that, even though nobody liked my Ancient Aliens one. But I might have to do one on that one. <laughs> yeah, I mean, good video. Hey, McPain. Sorry, I mean. Uh... Hey guys, Peter Griff. Hey guys, Peter Griffin here. <laughs> oh hi. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> oh wait, that was something I wanted to say um to you guys. Uh, I yeah, I think I got frozen in like I was envious of um Snacks's like youthful mapping energy, and I was like looking in the mirror today at how I've got so much gray hair, and I was like, 
I'm just this disheveled old man. And I was oh, like, yeah. I think I was born in 1982, not 1992. That's the conclusion I came to. Uh, I was trying, I mapped for three hours last night. I got half a level done. I was like, man, Snacks would have had like three maps out at this point. You've got old bones. <clears throat> I do. Send us your old damn bones. Yeah, Doom Kid, when you said you had like an old man story, I thought it was gonna be like like a funny, quirky old but that was just depressing. <laughs> yeah, that, that was. <laughs> you could have you could have kept that to yourself. I would have been in a better mood for it. <laughs> hey Doom Kid, that's really interesting, but next time keep it to yourself, please. True. <laughs> True. Oh, <laughs> 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 that was funny. Alrighty, um, I'm gonna load up some Ion Fury oh, soon. Let me just get Sam, I have like a here. three second delay. I'm not actually trying to talk over you when I do that. I'm sorry. Uh, that's okay. You're Australian. It's uh, par for the course, I guess. There's so many times where I like on my end, I start saying one word, but then Sand started. But I know he actually started a few seconds earlier. I don't know no, why. No, no, that's just and cutting you off intentionally every single time. <laughs> I was gonna say. Um, don't tell him that. Yeah, he's not supposed to know. Uh, um, Wilster, you're you're a fairly young man, aren't you? He's um, okay. that depends how you yeah. define these things. Well, anything under uh, twenty-five is young. I'm, I'm under twenty-five. I'm, I'm twenty-five. So you're, you're middle-aged. Middle you're middle. -aged. I was just saying, I Wilster is too young to have slowed down as much as he has. All right, streaming the Discord now, and I'm streaming live. Iron Fury, the titles, the oh, hot yeah. new title screen. Uh, this is uh, this game is so hot, Wilster can't run it on his computer, but that's why I'm about to play it for you. What a pack, I actually never played with a graphic setting, so I might be able to. It might have just been set to like ultra without my knowledge. I don't know if there's an ultra setting on this. I don't think Build Engine has a... Yeah, this is a new Build Engine game. It's not like the exact same version of the engine they put Duke 3D I think it's pretty on. close. Is this, is well, this yeah. lame Duke.exe? What? Yes. I don't know. The original Build Engine, dude. The OG. I mean, I, I noticed that when you load it up, it gives you like a really old school looking like, you know, do you want to run this full screen in OpenGL and just like... It seems pretty old school, but I don't. Oh well, yeah, it's the build engine, but I'm like, I'm pretty sure that they've probably done something to it since the In 90s. The same way, GZ Doom is quote unquote the Doom engine, but there's a ton of extra shit. Uh, I don't yeah. quite to that extent. It's probably more like comparable to like the difference between like Boom and the original Doom engine or something. That's my thing. Oh, okay. That's my, that's, this is all just completely wild guessing. I have no evidence to back this up. That's just my assumption because I've seen some of the stuff they pull off in this right, game. Right, but I'm just saying, like, if you look in display, there's really, you can, you can, um, you know, you can do software rendering, I guess. Uh, okay. But there's not really much here. This title screen is so 90s first person shooter, it's insane. I love it. Like, software rendering is an option. I uh, should pick yeah. that. Next I time. think so. Okay. Wait, let me. That might help. Cl oh, there's Whoever's classic. Holding the Whoever's know. holding the camera for this uh, title screen should straighten up, you know. Yeah, the they part of it. No, it's the, it's the Dutch works. angle, you know, you gotta have that. What, what's oh, that about Dutch oven? It's the Dutch du oven. The Dutch <laughs> angle. What? Everything has to be cockeyed just a little bit. It's this thing in movies, that, or what they call, I think it's the Dutch angle. It's like a yeah, it's slightly right. skewed. Uh, it's, which the, it's the battlefield some people Earth off. angle. <laughs> oh no. Wait, Dutch angle? What about Urgle? <laughs> Dark Ball says Earth. cameraman needs to just sit down and chill out. <laughs> All right, guys, let's. Uh, I played a bit of the first level um, just to test things out and. Uh, it's pretty fun, and I, I find in Build Engine, I don't actually want to enable Always Run. It's kind of, I don't know, they're like super detailed. It makes sense to like not run all the time, I find, but... Um, just like well, in I'm just going to play on, on your normal difficulty level, because, you know, I'm not, a, I'm, I haven't played this a lot, so Wanton Carnage. Do you play, wanton Carnage. It sounds delicious. I love wontons. Oh, yeah, no. Me too. 
Oh, we got a cool like opening and everything. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Have you? Oh no, cyborgs. Oh no. Ladies. Not the cy ladies. Not the cyborgs. Bring it on. Holy crap. Wow. I've got a little the comic self -insert book. self-insert character look, right here. Look, it's a gun. It's a revolver with way okay. too many... Way too many, uh... Shots Chamber. in it. Chambers. Yeah, yeah. It's the 26 chambers. Whoa! Hey, asshole! Oh, this really does look wow. a lot like Duke Nukem. Jerk. This might be all Gazenith. Not just, just looking just at it for a second. Just about to say! Now, I, I should say here, here, there is a bit of a story in the near future. I, I might as well see this. The streets of Neo DC are wrought with crime. You are Corporal Shelley Bombshell Harrison, leader of the GDF's domestic task force and the baddest bitch, bringing it to augmented criminals that dare to defy the long-standing order of permanent martial law. You've earned your nickname uh, through proficiency with explosives and kept it with your femme fatale looks. DC is your town and you aren't going to let cracked out cyborg punks drag it any further down the drain without a fight. Though it's only been six months since you assumed the position, you're already the longest serving head of the unit, a dubious That's honor, <laughs> as all your predecessors were killed in the line of duty. As you fruitlessly uh, attempt to get slosh after another horrible day in urban hell, an explosion rings out and your overpriced watered-down drink becomes one with the ground. It's time to get furious! Hey, look, and there's some this tips. Is this, is this uh, story text in like an old retro FPS triggering you hard right now, Sandwedge? Uh, like, who would waste their time on a story in a... In, well, I was going to call it a Doom mod, but... It's pretty fucked up. Let me just make sure. <laughs> oh. But yeah, I it's on the car bus too, and I was just calling it Doom once several times. So th these, there. this game definitely rewards like exploration, uh, just like Duke. Um, so like I played oh, cool. a bit of this level. Um, and you Duke. Actually, yeah. Let me check this. How does the control and handling feel compared to Duke? Sandwich. It looks pretty similar at a glance. It's pretty yeah. similar. I just played a bit of Duke, and it's it's pretty much feels like pretty close. Um, jump, jump. The one thing that always bothered me in Duke Nukem was how the jumping is like this weird moon jump effect to it. That feels no, it good. It's so weird. Oh, you can hold right trigger and just headshot fools. Like, you just load oh, nice. up a couple and just blam, blam. It's kind of like, blood movement is really floaty too. I think that's just a build engine thing. It's floaty in a good way though. It's consistent. Yeah, like it's not loaded. bad, but I remember I was playing like Quake for like four hours straight one time, and then I decided to take a break and play some Blood, and it was so jarring, like just like wow, what the fuck? Oh, you got Quake this thing. So like rigid, and like you start moving yeah. instantly, and you stop on a oh, dime, and then you like this is really cool. Blood, and you just you hold the right trigger, and you just go shazam, and you just like stun lock like fucking electric baton fools. Nice. Uh, you can also do a combo attack by clicking, um, or just hold it down. We got voxels everywhere, you know, blood style. Epic voxels. On the, um, on the note that Wilster mentioned just then about going between um, um, blood and uh, and quake, from let's say if you started as Doom from a starting point, the movement of Duke Nukem and blood in that almost feels like it goes a totally like it takes the opposite direction that Quake took, like. Quake feels this really rigid, like, locked-in feel almost, whereas Duke and Blood just have this, like, like a, a balloon sort of floating around. <laughs> like, I don't know if anyone else feels that way, but uh, Quake actually felt it. a little... Oh, no, that's exactly how, like, the building nice. games feel. I won! You got a gun. I got a... I oh, by the way, check this out. I'm getting some chips, right? Holy fucking shit! Oh, I got stuck! <laughs> oh, God. I, I wish there was like a one in a hundred uh, chance that actually happened. That'd be great. You got Blake Stone, Biomenace. The fuck is a Blake Stone? Striker, Monster Bash. Monster a weird Bash. mod for Wolfenstein that was There's the released key card. Yeah, we get this. You're asking that joke me, Stein, this is funny. this this SMG is pretty cool because it fires like basically like fiery fletchets, I think. So it just sets guys on fire too. Pretty sick. Nice. That was a joke. Uh, we got Sorry, the uh, I'm, I'm so terrible here. at perceiving jokes, forgive me. It's a reference to Civvy stuff, because I don't have original humor. 
It's like you think you you think you have issues? Some armor. Yeah. Ah. I Hello. think you have issues too. No. Oh wow, our nice <laughs> air spike. There. Wasn't right. someone like pissed off calling this game woke because you play as a girl or some shit? I swear wait, to God, probably. Wait, can you look at the bathroom walls uh, again. You hear that was pretty much the, the, the green ones. When next time you go down, if you go down. I think woke is the worst word in the English language. <sighs> yeah, it's, it's been. I think there are like, worse. You could you could argue that you could argue that. Just when it referred to like waking up though, like yeah. rather than this weird it, current use. Yeah, it, it, at a glance, the hit. the marble reminds me of Otex, so I was. Oh, this marble. I was thrown off. Yeah. Actually, it does kind of look like Otex. That and marble. Arsa. I used that same texture as a background on a GeoCities website I made back in the day. Like it looked, it was green and everything. So nostalgic. Yes, you can dual wield these if you find another SMG correct. It's pretty sick. Oh, nice. Um, but yeah, they, they, I find myself wandering around quite a bit because this first level is very like open. Um, I think there's actually uh, uh, auto saves here. I got the key, but like you can wander around so much. Wait, so there was um, I you know what? I'll just I'll just open this. I like that all the um, textures and sprites are like double resolution compared to Duke. It, it makes everything look very crisp. Oh really? Yeah, I didn't nice. even realize. Yeah, very smooth. But not like too ridiculous to smooth where it just looks uncanny. By the way, this scientist, this is the mad scientist that's uh... Oh shit. He looks like that Half-Life... I thought gonna... He looks like the Half-Life 1 guy, um, the guy, the mad scientist. Um, oh yeah. Yeah. I like these voxel trash cans too, you know? Find stuff in there. Hey, can you. If we find a voxel. Oh no, all the players would be sprites, won't they? Or uh, enemies. And yeah, stuff. I think so. There might be. I don't know. Maybe there's like a mech or something. I don't remember. Doubt. Um. There's, so, hey, it looks, uh, like a, it looks like there's a Duke Nukem reference on the wall over there. When and then, like. Yeah, Nukem I would how, is that Nukem all. Yeah. Is that bacon perfume they're advertising? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh door to police to pork. I didn't even notice that. That's great. <laughs> that's that. a really cool, that's like, so spaceport, like, looking thing. There's so Sam much Ledge detail everywhere. That, though. Like, he's like, how dare they make fun of me and my fellow boys in blue? I'm not. I'd rather have a gasoline scented perfume. We've been over that. My body, though. I would just want a little Wait cup a of it so I can sniff it periodically. Uh, there are headshots. Yeah, this what? Uh, uh, good. This game is really pretty. Oh yeah, the gameplay is uh, pretty fantastic as well. This game ripped up Augur Zenith. True, true. Tell him. Actually, tell him. It did. It did. Uh, there's a radar and like a radar pickup thing, but you have to press like N. It's oh. kind of weird that you can't just like. Oh, so yeah, you can just set fools on fire. My fire looks good. Did you just refer to them as fools? He's done that like five times already. I said fools. Well, three actually. Wait, what has he done three times? He keeps calling the enemies fools. I pity I those fools. Fool. You're definitely a cop. I pity the fool. There's like this area, which I didn't figure out how to get to last time, but we've got creamy stick. Creamy stick? What a name! Older. What a name! Oblong's not rur <laughs> fatter <laughs> society. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this game like legitimately funnier than Duke Nukem 3D already? This is uh, this is like. Why is this like 50 times funnier than Mach 2? Which <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, it is 50, 50 times funnier than Mach 2. Oh God! <laughs> yeah, it's not. It's not just a shit post. This is the best part of the level yet. I'm gonna have to give it an A plus. This honestly might be the best one so far. <laughs> oh, nice! Yeah, watch I yourself. Was... You're gonna get shaped. I can hear ladies. I was ladies triggered. Okay. I was already. triggered. You this one get... may just be the best one. Oh my so god, far. dude! The first one, you crazy people. Illuminati. <laughs> That's pretty good. I like the loop and naughty. That's there's really so many, cute. like, I honestly didn't even notice this when I played, but there's so many, like, just, like, cool signs and shit, and just, like, funny shit around. Oh. Nice. Um, oh. 
Okay. No, Flat no music in the chat saying aside from like the woke, you know, business. The voice <laughs> acting in this one is a lot cheesier than the '90s build game. So I'm curious. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll keep an ear out. That's yeah. A, that, I mean, my audio is maybe you might have to turn it up a bit, but no, it's easy if it's better. It's oh, by the way, better. you've got these like bowling ball grenades that actually home in, which I didn't even realize. Like on my actual playthrough. I played for a while, didn't realize they can home in if you charge them up, which makes them like 20 times better. Better. Ooh, that's a portable med kit. Nice. Nice. Um, I'll show you the radar, I guess. Um, probably not going to find everything in this. Um, but, you know, you can you can wander around quite a bit and just look for cool stuff. That bacon perfume is absolutely hilarious. I love that. What is, uh, I, I love what is it. up here? Oh, just a fucking, just a drink. A purple Coke? Is that yeah, like a drink it's all purple Coke. So who here has played? Have any of oh you played God. this? I haven't. I, I played I have. it. Yeah, I've played it. First thing Maybe. I thought of when I saw that purple Coke bottle was like fizzy, like uh, cough syrup. You know what I mean? Like. Oh, have, I didn't did, like the over. I didn't like the the amount of hit scans this game has. Did you? Oh, I guess I, you know. I, I seem to be good with hit scans more than some people. What but difficulty did you, are you playing? Did you beat on? it? Just the standard. You can I, drink the cokes and get health back, according to um, basket You can pressure. what? You can what? You can I, do coke and get health. I didn't. Uh, uh, the coke. The coke cans. I don't think the. Uh, or maybe you can press use on the cups. So I'm not sure. I didn't oh, beat it. I played it on a higher difficulty, and then I started slowly grinding through the game because I There's kept the problem. getting melted. There's the problem. I played it on well, the I mean... hardest difficulty, and I couldn't beat it, and I was like, <laughs> No, not the hardest. I don't think it was the no, hardest. I'm, that I'm, I'm, I'm bragging on these snacks. Yeah, I know. I oh, know, I you, you get this sick... Uh, this looks like almost a grenade too. launcher, but yeah, it, it looks pretty sick. It's this might have been shotgun. before I played through Blood on the highest reasonable difficulty. So and which one is that? Right. Your... It's the one what? that's not a co-op difficulty. Oh, so well done? Yeah. Okay, I only ever played on Lightly Broiled because while I do hate myself, it's not quite to that extreme yet. It is, it is uh, like pulling teeth. Well, see, but I always play actually... these different games on the default level because like Ultravines, I always, or like, you know, the Ultravines equivalent always feels like, hey, I know the game a bit. I know the mechanics. Like, I feel like it's balanced for default usually very well. Well, Doom is a bit different though. Like, the Iowa's originally were super easy. I mean, probably hard, like definitely a lot harder back when the game first came and people aren't used to that sort of control. But, um, well, yeah, like Doom. generally if you're playing something in Ultraviolence for Doom, like all skill level, I wouldn't say all skill levels, but a lot can handle just the Iowa's and Ultraviolence. It's not that hard if you use saves, especially if you do continuous. But I've kind of always felt like, um, Doom, like, I don't know if they knew that the developers knew this or it was just a happy accident, but it was almost like training wheels for like the FPS genre as a whole, like difficulty wise. Check yeah. this out. That's true. Like, oh, that, it's funny. That's... There's moments in Doom 2 I thought it was so hard on Ultravance as a kid, and, uh, and you know, now it's like the beginners beat them on UV fairly easily. But from Final Doom and like all Megawads onward, though, I see Hurt Me Plenty as like the, the median difficulty. Oh. As it should be. Yeah, I. I mean, oh, wait. a lot of yeah. mappers. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Sam, what were you going to say? No, uh, for a second I was like. I actually have to hit crouch to go down. Oh, I think as kind, I feel like Doom being so easy kind of led to the result of everyone treating, everyone in the community treating auto violence as the default difficulty. Well, I mean, I know you said that like quite a few mappers do at least consider the easy ones, but like a lot of people just use auto violence. Well, just the fact that it's, it's, it's such an old default. game, so like any new modern yeah. games are going to be better. Like they're going to be a lot harder on the ultra violence. Yeah. Not to mention AI in Doom is just it's practically oh. non-existent. It come at oh. you and it basically shoot. I it's like uh, games that actually incorporate AI. Wait, can I get up? Oh Maybe shit! Are, I didn't old find games, this old games aren't necessarily easier back then in general though. Um, yeah, I've got yeah, there's loads of hard old games. Well, yeah, no, I just I mean know. it was it was easy because like most people were playing keyboard and nobody had really played an FPS like that. I mean like Wolf 3D was sort of fairly basic in comparison. Mm. The thing that's funny is um, with Wolf 3D, 
there's only four difficulties so there's not really a middle difficulty but uh it was pretty like you know i think everyone played it on the third one out of the four there's also the fact it's that they the accidentally only uh balanced it for pistol start and didn't think of continuous so it's easier for that reason because they're boneheads for wolf 3d no uh doom one what how would you balance 30 levels for continuous? That's like they fucking they impossible. considered it for Doom 2, but for oh, Doom yeah. 1, like you just BFG the Spider Master around, you're like, okay, I'm done. Yeah, yeah. Limbo, Limbo literally has a BFG. Um, like, um, Sandy, I, well, I forget who it was who, who said that in an interview that they, they made that mistake. Yeah, it was that was Sandy. Yeah. Well, he said that they intentionally did on pistol starts only so that if a player dies halfway through the map, they don't have to get fucked essentially that's what i heard too yeah. no that it was it was an interview with one of them and he just said it was like what are your regrets for doom and like one of them he said we didn't we didn't uh test well, for continuous enough the map i made I and it made it. and it made the bosses like a non-factor because you just have that you know they didn't test it with the bfg or whatever but then maybe in Doom 2, they're like, okay, let's try to make a boss that even if you have all the weapons, is still yeah. hard. And everyone yeah, they like, figured, they learned their lesson, right. I guess, is the idea. The Icon of Sin is underrated. Wow, Snacks, I'm, I'm, I'm proud of you. <laughs> that, uh, just, that, the I, Washington I Foreskins! What? Washington <laughs> Foreskins? Like, Circumcision. Uh, is that a 30. play on the Washington oh, Redskins? <laughs> yes. This is I the dumbest. That. This is literally the dumbest and the most amazing shit I've ever seen. It's pretty good. It's was, pretty good. Yeah. You know what? It's funny. This aesthetic. Um. Well, actually, we were mentioning Augur Zenith, which I do like a lot. Uh, generally speaking, um, in Doom too many like colors and things on screen at once kind of bothers me but with this level of detail it really works like it's not just a chunky mess of pixels it's i can actually see what things are i remember i was watching um i was watching bob ross paint painting one time and he was using all these like blue colors and it was looking real nice and he put a giant green tree in there and he just fucking ruined that painting he had this whole monochromatic thing going on that you just got this stupid green patch in the middle I, I remember watching a Bob Ross, like, uh, one of those, like, 24-hour live streams of his stuff, and I remember people in the chat just going, like, okay, here he goes, he's about to fucking ruin it. Oh, there it is. And he would just, like, he would, like, do one of those things where he peels out the edges and so it's a circle, and they're just like, you just fucking ruined it, Bob. What'd you do? It's funny, because, like, at first... You see him to this giant streak through the middle and you go, oh my god, he ruined that beautiful painting. Then he turns the giant streak even prettier than the original thing was. It's fucking amazing. And he doesn't that. even listen to criticism anymore. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Okay. He got, he got yeah, plane baited. He's in his he own made, world. He hasn't recorded a single new episode since that 24-hour live stream. Yeah, he once Bob Ross got forward. swatted, we just didn't hear much from him. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, it's not me. I would love, I, I would love the idea of watching Bob Ross with like a full audience Get and everyone just getting so mad. Whoa, what was happening when there? He, when some he does some weird like texture that. stuff going on there. For you, yeah, imagine if they put like the, the live studio audience from fucking Big Bang Theory in with uh, Bob Ross painting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Imagine putting that, that into excellent. anything. Just like, he's just painting and it's like, it's just the constant like laughter every time he picks up a brush. Like that's not a joke, you fucking in race. <laughs> you fucking this, mouth This uh, breather. this like double tap like that. lock on is pretty fucking, pretty fucking deadly. Uh, it's almost OP. Well, it's not, I mean, it is like at the beginning it sort of is, but. Maybe the beginning of the game is supposed to be easier. Wow. Uh, yeah, it's, it just, it's like you don't have to aim, it just like locks on for you. That's an interesting fairy, Snacks. Yeah. Yeah, thanks. Because, and then the, the game would then get harder as it goes, eh? That, that, that's, that's pushing it a bit, that's pushing it a bit. Let's, uh, let's uh, put some power in here. No tasers. Right. 
It, it specifically says no tasers. That's not a taser, it's a baton. Why? It's a taser baton. Sorry, I'm not, uh, I'm, I'm not talking to the chat a lot just because I'm really absorbing this. I'm absolutely loving it, but... Uh, what, are you guys, what are you guys talking about in this chat? If you guys want to... I don't know. If you see something in the chat that's interesting, you can let me know. Oh, or wait. Try. Can you turn the voxels off in this game? Yeah. That's what was tanking my frame rate. I didn't even think of that. Okay, of yeah. Course. Forgot about that. Oh, I'm going to download this immediately. Oh, we got two now. Oh, get burnt. Oh shit, flying, uh, we got a drones with skulls on them. Those are dots. They're dots. Oh jeez, oh, they fly into you and they fucking... Sorry guys, that was my dog. That was my gardener and my cleaner and my dog. Oh guys, that's really insensitive. My dog also died after being shot while flying a drone and shooting He's at people. He's just playing, why'd you shoot him? Whoa! Why would you do that to your mom? Oh, I just kicked his skull off. You can kick heads around, you know, blood. Classic sort of build stuff. I like that. This gun is called the Lover Boy. Is it an 80s uh, rock musician? Uh, no. You know. Oh, by the way, so here's the radar. You got a radar there now. You hit N Very nice. when you get that pickup. I played this game for three minutes uh, over two years ago, apparently. Sit down, girl. This is your <laughs> final warning. Uh oh. Dude, this bitch is crazy. You gotta kill him. Oh no. What did girl say? Uh oh. I love build explosions. You're right, Platinum Music. Girl said, I love build explosions. Oh shit. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. That Spiders! Was I swear the main character who's na is her name Ion? Uh no, it's um it's in here. Bombshell Betty? Oh Corporal no. Corporal Shelly Bombshell Harrison. Oh, I swear look at that. They finished downloading Ion Fury. Uh Ion Shelly. Fury from the Ion Fury from the hit game Ion Fury. Get that? Ion is my favorite character. True. Eh, doesn't afraid of anything. Yeah, Whoa, that guy fucking jumped. You can get up there, I just can't remember how. Pretty sure you can get up there. Remember in this game got a lawsuit? It got a lawsuit. For the yeah, from Iron, Iron Maiden? Yeah. Dude, from, it's so stupid, it's not even Iron. An Iron Maiden is an actual device that existed before the band did. They can't yeah. fucking copyright that. They have no... Yeah. I think I can what push that lawyer? trash can over and I just fucked it up. Yeah, they're still trying to sue whoever invented that. Oh, wait a minute. That. Wait a minute. Oh. Like, <clears throat> trying to sue, man. like, the estate of some 1500s dude. dude. Did you guys... You guys saw when I, when I posted that Dr. Dre <clears throat> got sued by a gynecologist named Dr. Dry, D-R-A-I, and won? A, a gynecologist what? named Dr. Dry? Yes. Dr. This is Dr. look on the Wikipedia Dry. page. Did you know Dr. Dre's not a real doctor? Well, he's not. I mean, ask Dr. Dry. He didn't. Maybe it's pronounced Dre, and he was just like, "This is taking business away from my gynecology clinic." Clearly, gynecologist named Dr. Dre. That's like a plumist named Doc, like Mr. Leaky or something. Like. What the fuck? <laughs> Oh god, or Dr. Dre, yeah, Cox. Dr. I just got that by the way, I didn't know what you were talking about, and now I, that's fucking good. Virtual reality treatment for the mentally deficient, called Dr. Angelo. 999 not dumb. Huh. Dr. Angelo, is he, <laughs> did he go did, to the same practice as Dr. Dre, or? He did, yes. I, I would know, I was Dr. If Dre it, or Dr. Dry? If it is called, pronounced Dr. Dry, that is... Hilarious. Dr. Try, the gynecologist. <laughs> uh, I guess these guys are, some of these guys aren't hit scanners, but their stuff goes so fast that it's almost equivalent. And I think your Pentium 2 Windows 95 is struggling with those uh, voxelized trash cans. Uh, why? Oh, okay. There we go. You mean the Discord stream? Oh, it was just the stream lagging. Yeah, never mind. Oh, the actual stream? 
No, no, no. Not the YouTube one's fine, for sure. The Discord one is just finicky and it's probably more to do with Discord servers than anything else. For some no. reason, as soon as you hit that can and it broke, it just like locked up for a second. By the I, and I did change my. Uh, I was actually streaming through uh, CPU, uh, and I finally fixed that because Dark Pulse pointed out that like, yo, uh, I was using the wrong. You could stream with your graphics card basically, um, so it should be smoother overall. What graphics card do you use? It's a GTX 1660, so it has NVIDIA NVENC technology, which allows you to encode video and stream with your, your graphics card as opposed to your CPU. That's why I was having issues with Halo that one time, because it was running off CPU. Because oh. it's like 400 years old. Uh, whenever uh, my CPU, my oh, CPU isn't that, that old. You just said 1660. That's, that's like a <laughs> mid-range card from a few years ago. That Are you sure? Yeah. Six gigabyte, 1660. It's not that old. Oh, um, I just, not, I just sand. Are you sand's being deliberately obtuse, Snacks, I think. Those guys are shooting, uh... <laughs> okay. There's actually, a, a, like, a super armor up there, but I don't remember how to get that. I got the blue key, though. Not sure what else I'd expect. Sixteen sixties ass says Gogar. He just got a new computer, so I guess he's just. Uh... It's great for 1080p gaming with a lot of modern stuff. I got it a few years ago, and it was somewhat mid to low range at the time, but very affordable. So uh, I don't know. It's not ass, consider especially considering the average computer of the Doom community. It's All quite you good. need is three hundred and twenty by two hundred. 6 gigabyte yeah. 1660 is a reliable graphics card for 1080p at 60 FPS. Yeah, I don't, like I, play... I play modern games fairly well, so uh, uh, you know, PC Master Race are gonna, gonna have their takes, I guess. I'm using the onboard oh. um, Intel oh. chip Goodbye. for my graphics cards, and it worked, and it hasn't, like even when I'm recording Doom, it doesn't lag at all, so. Oh yeah, you can play new Doom very high set. Yeah, that's not an issue. Uh, the only issue I had last stream was it was going on my CPU, which is not, not you know, amazing. Uh, but especially if you're trying to do the game and stream and record on your CPU, that's... Uh... Or if you uh, play intensive cheesy a... doom mods. Uh, you're gonna, are you, when you play those hardcore GZ Doom mods, everything... Like, you know what's funny? For the longest time, Just there poorly were optimized, mods for yeah. Doom. That's... Uh, let me focus. Uh, Shut the fuck Are you saying Doom Kid? I was just saying, there was a long time where um, oh. mod, there were some mods for Doom that actually couldn't be played by most people. Like, they weren't. Oh, <laughs> the ports were not actually optimized enough to run some of them properly. Oh, damn. That's, like, what, I, that's would... what I feel like I'm experiencing. Are you, uh, on, a, are you on just a fairly basic computer, Snacks? Or, no, no, um... no, no, no. I mean. Because of the Dune community having relatively uh, basic computers a lot of the time, when I made anti-mortem maps, a lot of people wanted to play it but couldn't because... There's a workaround for that. Yeah, there's like yeah, almost 2,000 dynamic lights in there. Over yeah, you, they're optional. But no, no. Oh, yeah. They're necessary for the vibe. I, I relied Even on these dynamic switches lighting are for all of the lighting. It's got cool like... Very cool. Uh, I was, uh, yeah, the with that um, snacks, it, it's it sucks because you know, it's one of those situations where like, did you hear of R Lumine or whatever it was called last year? The one yeah. by um, I I couldn't play that on my old computer. I got like ten frames per second. It was just too choppy for me to enjoy. I have to grab my dinner. I'll be back in like thirty seconds. Okay. Needed to kill He's everybody. He's upgraded from snacks a lot to dinner a lot. <laughs> Nice. Boo. Epic. Boo. You know, epic pun. Yeah. Sand, how do you feel? I mean, I've heard. I've heard you come out with worse than that, Sand. Okay. I've you, heard you have. Worse oh shit! Vile. I forgot. The fucking shotgun actually doubles as a grenade launcher. That's why it looks so cool. Oh, that's really slick. And if you actually press the button for the next one, it actually. That's really sick. Yeah. Okay. I gotta keep that in mind, actually. Uh, 
So does every gun have an alt fire or, or of some sort? Or oddly enough, they. Well, I think no, not all of them. I mean, the the SMG is just um, it allows you to like take put your uh, other one away. I don't have ammo for it right now, but it allows you to put one away. Uh, yeah, not all of them do though. The shotgun doesn't. Oh, you can oh you can right click to actually do that. That's actually awesome. I didn't realize. That. Oh shit. Oh, hey, Kami Jojo. I was just... They PM'd me earlier today oh, about... Oh, I need to find that Doom Builder option. It's time to make a splash. I'm missing nine secrets in this area. Wow. I'm not going to find, find them. them. No. Why not? Okay, you can come out this way. There's definitely that arm, that like mega armor or something up there, but uh, more than I would like to backtrack with. Yes, the the SMG does um, eat ammo when you're dual wielding. Is there um option for the swim thing? Cause like it's kind of weird. I don't think so. That's your favorite noise, isn't it? Yeah, pretty much. Made some oh, did you not do that? What? What did you not do that? that? <laughs> Who was that, Will? <laughs> oh, Cami Jojo, thanks for uh, subbing. Appreciate it. <laughs> Sorry for whatever the fuck that was. Wilfer going wonkles on us. Could you please not come live on stream? Thanks. That was not coming. That was just throwing Sandwich. a bag in me. That was, uh, it was a bit of a self-report. Yeah, that's a bit. That's a bit that's sussy. That's his. That's his. Everyone's got their noise, you know. Who the fuck is? Snacks or her noises for for sandits. No, for sandits, shut the fuck up. I mean, in that case, yes, <laughs> yes, I agree. Uh, there is a uh... oh shit. Everyone has an amazing noise. But uh, yeah, I don't know that that drone I made. I, I, that was uh, not that funny, Snacks. I don't know why you were laughing so hard at that. The, the noise it wasn't made. funny. It was just fucking loud. I think it was a laugh of like, oh god, what's just happened? Five. Not a laugh of comedic genius. I see. Yeah, god, comedic genius like walks you the speed of smart. Nice. Speed of smart. Yeah. See, he replaced, he replaced stupid with smart there. Did you see what he did there? This one may just be the best one so far. Mach 1. Did anyone think about creating a Mach 1? A prequel? I mean, wasn't wasn't that kind of a Mach 1? There was just one stupid bad map. Yeah, isn't that just mockery.wad? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, cool mockery. Is that the one that has the caco with the giant dick? Oh, wait. Is I this... think so. Oh, okay, there's some stuff here. I'm scared if I ever find a ward where I, get to, where I have to say, this is the best one so far, like five times now. Why would you have to, though? I don't hey, know. You could maybe... always not. Yeah. That's a very distinct... Maybe, uh, maybe, there's a, maybe there's just a ward where there's like five maps that are the best ones so far. Right. Yeah. No. Okay, so you've discovered the concept of the top 10 list. Yes, I have. Stretch, <laughs> stretched view in visual modes. Is that what it is? Uh, no. Can you tell me what's the option when you got a like line def selected that's tagged and it draws a line to the sector that's tagged so you can get like a visual reference? Oh, um, I, uh, fuck, I accidentally turned oh. that off at some point, and then I found out, uh, where is it? There's, like, a little button on screen 
Oh, it's right. Are you in Doom Builder? Like GZ Doom Builder or Ultimate Doom Builder? Nice. And, yeah. <clears throat> Doom Kid? Yeah, yeah, I am. Okay, so right next to the play button when you want to test the map, it's like just to the left of that. There's a little eye with a line underneath it. Just toggle that on. Thank you. Show event lines. Yeah, because I accidentally. So I missed the play button one time and turned that off and it was off for weeks and I was so like I I, I couldn't map it was trash because I couldn't tell where anything was going there were Thank you, lines. especially when you have like a ton of tags like when you get like past 200 and they all like reference various stuff, it's Where just. Where did that come from? I don't know how. It'd be impossible, I swear. It sucks, yeah. Ooh. The disperser is the grenade launcher, okay. Yeah, it disperses people's limbs. Yeah, pretty yeah, much. Oh Max, shit, do you like, check this do you out. like my lighting? Oh, I love your lighting. Your lighting is so fucking good. Oh my god. Uh, it, look at look at the way that the ceiling and the floor have oh. different uh, different light levels. Oh, oh, some oh shit. How? I thought that popped out of his head, but actually they just came out of the vents. Um, I've actually improved it since the version that I shared with you guys. It's it's um, slightly smoother now, and it's the old version. There was it would uh, prevent enemies from being able to traverse that area just because of the way it's set up but now enemies can, can go there because it's, the dip in the floor is only 24 units I need to get started on that you can you can pull some real voodoo and it'll, it'll look real nice but your viz planes are going to go up real fast oh you guys are doing a vanilla wad is it vanilla? I guess it is. It has to be. I'm yeah. making mine vanilla. Uh, should I... Should I... Uh, I don't know, mention what you guys are doing or is it a top secret? Uh, it's not barely in the plain stage, I think. I mean, they can say much anymore. I'm just wondering if they wanted people to know that they're starting on... I think we've talked about it on stream multiple times. So it's a bit... Bill a little bit sucky. Yeah, so you, so Snacks, Wilster, and Doom Kid are at least starting on to uh, collaborate for something. Uh, so uh, that's pretty exciting, and uh, I'm sure a lot of people will be looking forward to what you guys cook up there. They fucking better. Yeah, <laughs> they fucking better. <laughs> that's the spirit. Oh yeah. shit! They're sleeping. <laughs> oh, we're at here in this stream, Snacks. You can compete with me for being mean as a What I do? Top oh, shit. Nothing. Talk sure shit, talk get now. shot. Uh, yeah, sandwich. I don't appreciate that kind of talk to you. I will ask you to, like, stop threatening. I, that's what the lady in the game said. Yeah, so you can, like, uh, you can yeah, hit that and they, go they roll and out. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and ignore your contacts. I don't care. Uh, does this get stuck what again? What does the thing on the left say on the vending machine? Salt and fat snack company. Yep. Fuck. What does this say? Addi this says addictive soda. Yeah, because it is. It's, they shove so much caffeine in soda, it's addictive. It's a thing. Hmm. Good thing I don't drink soda. Proud right. of you. Diet oh, soda isn't much better. I don't drink diet soda either. Yeah, aspartame is evil. Says the person called snacks a lot. Thanks for your advice. Yeah, but the drink is not a snack. It's a yeah. Drink. Uh, okay. <clears throat> yeah, get your facts straight. Genius. Check your privilege, please. Genius. So, because my name is snacks a lot, I have to drink soda all the time? I'm just saying, I actually drink diet, a little language. bit of diet soda because I find it helps me not have bit, other yeah. sweet stuff. Because it, it's like I get a sweet okay, fix. Okay, it's a little bit, it's just a little bit, mom. Having to consume 
tons of calories. I mean, I do that best. to avoid alcohol. Yeah, I find it's, it's I think it, I think it's a good you know it's not amazing, but it, I think it's a good replacement for worse stuff. To be honest, Zork what is? A diet to soda. Oh, oh okay. hamburger. Mm. Except for the aspartame. Yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't know if I don't think Coke Zero has that or it has a different mix of stuff. But. Yeah. It compensates by being gross. I like it. I don't know if you can hear her sick uh one liners. Uh you just say damn those alien bastards are gonna pay for shooting at my ride. I do like the uh they you know, it's funny. I think Solaco does the same thing. They have the fear style. I mean, it reminds me of fear. It's not like fear is the only one to do it, but you know, the like hostiles. Pigs are cops. Okay. That's a hot pig. Agreed. What the fuck? Never heard that one before. I like the uh, bacon O to police one a little bit more than that one. There's a reason why people don't do drug deals in front of pigs. Is that what? 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 Oh, I never went in here. Do you need to? What was Folks, that one? Is that a blue doe fish you Dark Pulse asks, asks? I don't know. Folks in the chat, have you played this game? Have you beaten it? What, what are your thoughts? Because uh, I beat this game and absolutely loved it, but I haven't really returned to it in a fair while. Um, and uh, I'm glad I did here. It's a radar. Oh, I found Dick's secret stash. There's... Dick has... Uh, oh, this says... Wait. Steam, Steam letting... Co... Is this a... For a second, I was wondering if this was ripping on Battle.net and Steam. <laughs> I was like, wait. What's going on here? Oh, if you wait a while, she flips a coin, which is... Cute. Uh, yeah. Sean McLeod, you uh, beat it. Yeah. Let me just get a swig of my Coke Zero. That is. Uh, we got a Bob bomb. Okay. I think we want to go up here. I thought you were a Pepsi individual. Uh, did I say Wait, Coke? I meant Pepsi. Disgusting. <sighs> it's all the same, really. The shitty sugar water that has fucking up. You know, pretty much. Yeah. They're pretty distinct in their their marketing. Back in the day, yeah. Pepsi was strictly advertised towards black people. For some reason. Uh, yeah, I don't. I never understood that. <laughs> yeah, I thought they always of... they always tried to have like this more hip urban bent to it. I don't know if that like is like <clears throat> part of the. History well, they were vying for wow. like they were trying to like beat each other out. So Pepsi was probably like, if we target it towards this demographic, maybe we'll we'll get one up on Coke. Oh, what's the Coke? Hell? You're going the wrong way. They don't have, yeah. It's literally the exact same tactics that politicians use when running political ads, just for shitty fucking soda water that kills you instead. We, if we get this demographic, then we can uh, we'll, we'll be ahead in the polls. Whoa, they... uh, that if you like that stuff, you'll love that show, The Boys, because it's basically superheroes that are always like watching their poll numbers and just like, what, what do I do to get more popular? Oh, okay. I think I want that to come back down and then hit this. Oh, um, Kami Jojo, did you end up hearing what Wilster said a few minutes ago about the um? The way that tags versus sectors work in Doom Builder, like it's it's there's a small I called show event lines. That's what the actual command is called. The boys has the Reaper from Doom 2005 movie. Yeah, Carl Urban. Uh, I, I, I like him a default? lot. I think it is on by default, but it's whenever you like because the way I accidentally turned it off was just by trying to press the play button to test the map, and I missed it. I guess because it's right next to it. And I just accidentally turned it off for like two weeks and didn't know what I At least with highlight, it's reasonable. When it's like, oh, I can't find anything, and it's H for highlight. Oh, with event lines, it's just I? Why? And like almost I every events. button... They were almost ambushing. every button in that program does something. Yeah. 
if you're a keyboard like you know i just have a tendency to to mash key like not aggressively like i just accidentally mistype and shit a bunch yeah and uh whenever i do that i end up activating and deactivating a whole bunch of shit and i'm like no i just want to draw lines damn it Do you have a Damn. shortcut to realign the grid when you want to work off of a specific angle of line depth? I need to try this, uh... I didn't know you could rotate nice. the grid until a few months ago. I I didn't know that for the first few years I was mapping, and then I found out about it, and it's like this... Because what I used to do was, like, design an entire area, and then rotate it afterwards and slap it into the map. So that would, like, cause issues sometimes. It is a lot less useful if you're using uh, older formats that don't let yeah. you adjust flats, just because... Yeah, just it, it, and... Sorry, Wilson, you go ahead. Uh, it's just, it's also that, like, um, in, like, UDMF, there's, it's a lot more precise with where it places vertices, whereas, oh, like, shit. vanilla compatible, it rounds off vertice locations to the pixel. Oh, so shit. there's always a little bit of uh, inaccuracy with it. <clears throat> I was gonna say the diagonal grid doesn't sound useful at all. Like I've never once thought I need a diagonal grid right now, but that's because I'm usually mapping in vanilla format. I use it a lot, even when I'm doing vanilla. Like with um, the 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 way I work lighting out is that you just go, you trace a line from the light source to the point of the thing the light's hitting, and then you realign the grid by that line and you shoot it to the wall, and then that way you know ah. that you can project it. Heavy armor. It's a really easy way to do it. I usually mainly use it for decorating uh, walls that are diagonal. All right, I've got it's the still yellow. Fun. I just, I just wing it. There's, there's so many things. Snacks, like no one would ever notice. Oh, it's, you sent me a DM. Let's see. You don't need to rotate it. Like, I made almost all of my anti mortem maps without knowing I could rotate the grid, and that, that, would, that would turn out looking okay. Whoa. Gotta watch those things. Whoa! Alright, let's try to use this fucking thing. Oh, shit. shit. Let's see. Let's use this Dude, thing. This looks so weird. Ah! Oh, that's good. Don't get too excited. Oh, don't worry, I won't pull oh, the poster. Ah! Are you using GZ Doom Builder or Ultimate Doom Builder, Kami? They just sent me their, like, bar at the top, and it's missing the friggin' eye with the, like... It's oh. missing the event line button. That's, uh, that's unfortunate. I don't know what to do about that, then. Uh, switch to Ultimate Doom Builder, because it's the best one, like, by far. I use GZ Doom Builder. What? I use GZ yeah. Doom Builder as what? well. What? I no. installed GZ... No, because listen, what? I installed no. GZ Doom Builder four years ago, and I haven't updated it like since. Maybe once or twice, that was it. Like, Ultimate Doom Builder uh, automatically lets you know when there's an update. Okay. Oh, yeah. What Ultimate other Doom Builder is literally just the like updated and continued version of GZ. But... I've been, I'm the same way with my editors. I update once every like eight years, maybe, so. Oh, you're missing out. Oh, what am I missing out on? What are the What are the great features that will help me make <laughs> vanilla compatible maps and that I can't do in GZ Doom Builder? Uh, I'd have to fucking cross compare because I, I don't the use hell? anything else. So I'd have to figure out what features are new in it and which ones you don't have. Just dragonfly that, knowing that he had been mapping for like 15 years. That's, I, you know, this was five years ago. I was like, I don't want to upgrade from Doom Builder 1. I'm so used to Doom Builder 1, which I was using all the way up till 2017. Oh. And uh, it was like, you can draw sectors through each other and it won't become a glitched mess. And I'm like, okay, that's enough to that's enough to convert me. But what, what more could you ask for at that point, you know? That was all Doom Builder 1 was missing, was the ability to just draw lines all over top of each other and it separates them into sectors on its own, you know what I mean? Uh... Like, like when you drew them, it wouldn't automatically split the line depth at the intersection? Oh no, it would just create this glitched, like you had to oh. do literally everything by hand in Doom Builder 1. It was... That only happens if you're copying and pasting in GZ Doom Builder. I think Ultimate Doom Builder fixed even that, like now you can copy and paste shit on top of each other and it'll read 
you know, reconfigure it all to work, you know what I mean? Power this thing say up. The difference between Doom Builder 1 <laughs> and GZ Doom Builder, and the difference between GZ and Ultimate has to be much smaller. Like GZ Doom Builder, I can tolerate. Doom Builder 2 is where I draw the line, though. Well, you should. You should. Doom Builder 1 was made in 2003, and Doom Builder 2 was made in 2007, and they reflect, they reflect the year they were made in, you know what I mean? Yeah. Whoa! They're not bad, it's just, it's so outdated, and there's a lot of... That, there's actually a distinct amount of features. With GZ Doom Builder, I just looked into it. The main thing is, um, if you are making UDMF maps, the dynamic light rendering is, like, actually correct and reliable. But overall, oh. it's just, uh better performance, loads faster, doesn't crash as often. I did think of something in, that as Ultimate Doom Builder has over GZ. It can read <laughs> a dehacked lump that's inside of a wad and display the correct sprites. I don't think that, GZ Doom Builder can do that. Oh, that no, head is doesn't. forever floating now. Can you at least like load a dehacked as a resource? Only if the source port does that automatically. What? Like, like GZ Doom Builder, you cannot get it to display D hacked sprites just full no. stop. That that sounds awful to deal yeah, with. Yeah, it's it, it's I'm used to it because I was making D hacked mods way before like 3D mode was a thing, but it still blows. Like any mapper who started this side of fucking 2010, I would not want them to. Uh, I would I'd recommend them. Well, oh jeez, these guys. Doom Builder. Well, that takes care of them pretty quickly. It's basically giant metal caterpillar things that you have to like... I think if you shoot the head, it kills them, but... Yeah, that usually kills things when you... Yeah. Think things... You, you kill things when they die. Yeah. Oh, is there... Die. Tommy Jojo's yeah. using Doom Builder too. Oh, goodness. That would I be your... Sorry for your loss. Oh dearie me! Oh me! Oh my! Oh! It's funny. I missed Doom Builder. Too. It's so funny, Doom. I always, to this day, I have people asking oh, me questions. Oh, I have to jump Doom there. Shit. Shit! People are so hesitant to switch too. Um, when it's GZ Doom Builder, it's usually because there aren't a huge amount of features. But with Doom Builder Two, it's like it's so, it's so much easier to use because they're used to it. But it's like you're fucking living in the past. No. It's it's not like. Trust me, I, I. It's funny. I missed Doom Builder Two entirely. I went from Doom Builder One to GZ, and like, Doom Builder Two is is really you know it falls in the ass crack between the two. It's slightly better oh. than Doom Builder One, but that's it. Yeah. This isn't really the type of. I've only ever used GZ Doom Builder. That was uh, I think that was like the most advanced one when I started, and I, I never progressed. Yeah. Whoa. Really Honestly, I, I mean, thinking about the um, the hacked enemies is oh, making me consider trying out the latest UD. When I when do Ultimate Doom Builder first came out, I tried it and it lagged a bunch and crashed in like two minutes. And I was like, well, I guess I'm sticking with GZ. But that was like a very early build. <clears throat> Wait a minute. That's I do get push. crashes from time to time, but depending what it is, sometimes I can just ignore it and then undo whatever I did that caused a crash, and then just, I'm good. That's the same with GZ Doom Builder for me. Like, it'll I've be like, never... hey, we didn't, we, the program did not like what you just did. And it's some, most of the time it'll just, like, be like, okay, I'll not do that and just undo it, and then it works fine. Does it save backups automatically, too? Yeah. Awesome. The, the first Doom Builder, though, was smart enough to do that. Like, oh. Um, it's funny because going from Wad Author, which was like the last of like the old style editors, like we're talking about how clunky the old Doom Builders are, but Doom Builder 1 was like space age tech compared to the old map editors. It's so funny. <laughs> like the ability to just draw the line depths, most editors couldn't do that. Like you had to spawn a square sector and then like add vertices in oh, and then drag those to where you yeah. wanted. Them. Yeah, doesn't that sound fucking miserable? I have wanted to try really old editors to try and capture that 90s spirit for maps, but I haven't done that yet. It's yeah, 10 times the work for one tenth the output. Like, it's not yeah. worth it at all. I, re I remember those days firsthand, and believe me, we don't want to go back to them. 
Well, for like a short term thing, it'd be nice to be potentially need to try, but not didn't, um, the go to. Didn't Cliffy try that and he just threw his hands up in the air and said, fuck this eventually? Cliffy would be the I wrong know. man to try hold that. He couldn't figure out Doom Online. It was too, like, technological for him. Cliffy's just a. He's, he's, Cliffy he uses an old version, I think. Happen. Yeah, he uses Doom Builder too. He's a technically minded individual, though, to get this distinct impression. And I can't like, cut him on Switch. You don't click it and open it? Oh, this is too much. I actually recently saw him editing, like looking through a map when he got lost, and I'm like, wait, the event lines are off. And Ooh. I'm just thinking, like, has he has he survived this entire time by using the <laughs> search function instead of the event lines? Because <laughs> that's what he did, because he's like, oh, this thing is attached to sector 255 or whatever. So oh. he searched for that sector. Oh, oh no! Oh, I don't know. I don't understand anything you guys are talking about, but it sounds cool. Do you know how line depths and sectors work in Doom, or what they Barely. are? Barely. No, not really. So a sector is basically a space, and a line depth is a wall or a line yeah. in the map that you can walk over. Yeah. So, <clears throat> uh, line depths have specials, like you switch this, and then a door opens. You switch yeah. this, floor raises, all that sort of stuff. Um, and that is like reference to a sector so it ends up like it stores what like there's a value attached so if you tag like a sector with 25 and you have that activator with 25 it links to those two um an event line uh connects the line depth in the sector so you know if a switch pulls something exactly where it is instead of just highlighting it so you have a line every time you for just everything that uses a feature or a special so you can oh, easily tell where everything is zoom mapping. Sorry, if that makes sense. I'm having this on Fury Stream. Uh, oh. Sam, Sam, you should become a mapper so you can speak our language. Yeah, uh, yeah, there. I'll get right on it. I ch I tried to put that in a way you'd understand, oh, and you're just like, well, I'm half listening. Thanks, well, sandwich. I'm trying to play I'm a game for a stream. Let me let me put it in like one sentence. The the ultra simplified version. When you make a switch in the editor, there's a line that attaches that switch to like the room it affects. And turning that line off makes finding what does what hell. Is that simple enough? I don't know. Sand is just completely zoned at this point. Yeah. Too much diet. Say that again. Oh. It's the aspartame. Say that again. Turn around. Did I just hear a dog bark? Oh, oh shit. Oh. No, that was me. Uh, what's the difference? Uh, I might, uh, after this level, maybe I'll check out uh, another game for a bit, maybe Dusk. Kind of show yeah, this. I didn't get very far into Dusk. Oh shit. I can run I'll Dusk probably, better um... than Ion Fury, but I only made it to, like, thrill to the point where they introduced those invisible enemies or, or some shit. The Wendigos? Sure, yeah, that's that's what they call them. So the Winnebago. Winnebago. Oh, I love that game. I really like- I, I might have to play more of this for a stream or something, like, just dedicated to this, because... I'm not sure you how like to do it. so far, Sam? What? Are you liking it so far, Sam? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, well, it's interesting, because, like, I played this before Ooh, I got heavy into Doom, yeah. and I wondered if I'd still like it if I came back, and it turns out, no, it's- I still love this. Awful. You're out of 10. It's not Doom. Uh, yeah, this is the worst game I've ever played. You should play Hexen. Yeah, I have a laugh. <laughs> okay, yeah, you can you blow stuff up with that, yeah. Or I can I can use Hexen. the um, I can use the grenade launcher, I guess. Hexen is actually a good game if you get past the awful progression. What do you, you guys feel like? Hexen. Do you want me to play defeat people want me to play more of this, or do you want to check out something else? Hexen. Go play you Hexen. Play Hexen, but play it with like the original Doom One version of the oh, engine, so it can't run no, any of the scripts, Hexen. and you're just like stuck. <laughs> you can't do anything. No. <laughs> Is it even possible to load? I don't know. It's an idea. Try that. Spend the next three hours trying to get that working. I'm never playing Hexen. Why? <laughs> That's a bold statement. If you ever play Hexen, you owe me three okay. trillion dollars. Well, unless dollars I have a walkthrough and know exactly how to get through like the first level, it's supposed to just be 
cryptic as fuck. It's not that's... that cryptic. People are over over hyped how cryptic it is. Well, there, it is fairly cryptic in some parts, but mainly they give you the most cryptic progression in the first hub. And then it gets way simpler after that. It's so stupid how they did that. I kind of like how in Dai Katana, the first area is the worst thing ever, and then just... everything after that's nowhere near as bad. I mean, if somebody knows exactly how to get through it and tells me how, that's one thing. Oddly shaped veggies. Oh, what kind you of pair is that? I, you didn't look at the pair long enough for me to determine its identity. <laughs> Vegan meats, oh no. Like, I don't know if it's a, a Bartlett pair, if it's a Jumbo Green Angie pair, I don't, I don't know. Hey, Sandwich, that's your favorite restaurant. Yep. Going for Bartlett. The oiled rat. Hello? It's definitely not a Bosque pair, though. Or an Asian pair. Someone joined just then. Oh, oh, how's it going, Bio? Bio? Bio, if you're in trouble, blink twice. 69% off. Shit, he needs her help. Hi, nice. guys. Hello. Hey. Are you blinking? 666. Six, six. That song was in Guitar Hero 3. It was. Yes. I get all of my music recommendations from Guitar Hero 3. Does this hurt? Is that some good song? Does this does uh, not hurt me. Bullshit. Oh, that hurt. Guitar Hero 3 had Cliffs of Dover. That's true, it did. I was pretty good at that one. I have played too much Guitar Hero in my time. I'm... And, uh... Way I'm... back in, like, 2007 and 8, I could play on Expert, but it's been a long time. I, I, I play more yeah, of the yeah. actual guitar than I do Guitar Hero these days. Uh, I, it's probably equal. I played it a lot as a kid. <clears throat> I remember when I was in university, there was like the, the TV in the lounge and somebody had a Wii hooked up to it with Guitar Hero 3 on it. And uh, they were playing, they're like doing it on Expert on like the easier songs. And I'm like, oh, can I play it? It's like, yeah, yeah, sure, you can hop on on. And then I like, I picked Expert. My one friend looked at me, he's like, are you, are you serious right now? I was like, yeah, it's, I might be a little rusty. I haven't played this game in months. And he looked at me like, wait, months? And I just kicked his ass so hard. <laughs> What is it? snacks and Worcester? Maybe you guys can help me think of some. I've got a, Hello. I've got a wide open ledge, and then 124, 128 units below. There's like a little, there's like a bowl. Think of it that way. And now I'm, I want something other than crates to stack on the high ledge for the player to hide behind. Oh shit. Because. Uh, I don't know. What else can I use other than crates in this situation? I'd have to look at the texture. Yeah, I'd have to see a picture of it. I have I'd have to use the brain sword. It's down. Okay, I'm hold on. Let me, um... <laughs> if I broadcast for, like, two seconds, that won't fuck with Sans at all, will it? No, we, it's, it's optional on what people are looking at. Okay. Two people can stream in the same thing. <laughs> What, what what theme are you going for, like? This is just like a um <laughs> I wanna say a classic Doom map, but it's not like Doom 1 or Doom 2 all that much. It's like a classic P1 oh. map. No, well, I mean like like tech, oh. bourbon, hell. Or tech slime base going on. Oh, no, that was the wrong wait, is that the wrong one? There's two sandwich oh okay, I'm on the right one. The one where you see the crates there. Yeah, I see it. I see it. We have to get across um, this bridge here, I believe. If I remember. You Half could green make green, a that's okay. custom Half. barrels. Like with... Circles. Toxic barrels. Yeah, yeah, but not like actual barrels. You like like decoration ones that you draw the sectors. Oh, I need the red... Sector oh, barrels. I have the red yeah. key. Like hexagonal, like... Uh, Professor McGonagall style. Uh -huh. yeah, that's, that's what I said. Yeah. <laughs> Did you say hexagonal? Okay. You see, hexagonal. by the way, this is a. Uh, this hexagonal? is a. Hexagonal. Um, 
Viz yeah. plane saving trick here. See how the it's all one sector, but I've kind of. Oh, this is. You could also potentially have like a support beam that connects to something else. Oh yeah, like a support that comes across the sky and then goes down, sort of yeah. like. Yeah. That's a good. Okay. All right. I'm trying to get at least one fully map, <laughs> fully functional map made by the end of today. So. Not if I do that first. Oh, there we go. No tasers. It's good. Hey, if we, have, if we have multiple maps made by the, us by the end of the day, I'm, I'll be freaking happy. Okay, well then I'm not going to do it. Yeah. I'll Whoa! be pissed as fuck if you finish your map soon. Sorry, me. guys. The Fletchit uh, SMG is pretty satisfying the way it just like... Duh. I agree. What does it do, Sandman? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I, was like, I like that description a lot. I guess there is a bit of a range limit. Ooh, jeez. Ah. <laughs> SMG go. <laughs> uh. Print money with this thing. Salt and Fat well, Snack yeah, Company. <laughs> every single time, every single time it gets caught. Fucking assholes. What gets caught in your asshole? <laughs> you got little voxel Oops. cans everywhere, that's always fun. Depends on the day. I like how in the cyber future, um, all the, uh... All the snack machines are just gonna be completely honest, it's just salt, fat, lard. Yeah. Sure. Every everybody. Oh shit! Thy flesh consumed. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, in the future, everybody is just like you guys know by now. You just you're gonna drink it anyway, you fucking slob. That's right, you fucking pig. Get a hamburger here. Coffee. Bio, have you played this before? Ion Fury. Yes, I have. How do you feel about it? No remorse. God damn. I didn't finish it though. Breath? I think you... I got- I think I remember I got yeah, stuck yeah, on a yeah, part. Yeah, yeah. I got stuck on a part and um... And I got frustrated with it and then I let- I left it. <laughs> yeah. But from what I did play, it's- it's pretty awesome, honestly. I should give it a second chance at some Whoa. point if I can stop playing Doom for even a minute. I know, right? I, I, you know, it's funny. I, I did this stream because I was, I kept wanting to return to this, but I, like, I felt like if I don't do it for like a YouTube thing, I'm just never gonna do it. Whoa! Hmm. Oh shit! Oh come on! I like that Wilster called his map Doom Kid is furry. Dot wad. I forgot to put <laughs> a like the Doom letter Kid a. a furry? I forgot. <clears throat> so it's just an adjective, it's not a noun. It was supposed to be Doom Kid is a furry dot wide, but I fucked it up. <laughs> Have you, uh, because <clears throat> the Max oh. was quite impressed by the lighting, and I think I did a. I think I might have went a little overboard. Like, it's something, like, I don't usually make levels look that good in vanilla at all. Your maps usually look perfectly fine. What are you talking about? Whoa! Oh, I see. Oh, look how much easier the sea snacks prove. Turtle Rama. Oh, did Let's you get the latest three store pack snacks? I fixed the ugly ass green shotgun guy. To hey, Wilster, it's better. your favorite store. Uh. What's that? Um, maybe. What's nope. the name of the store? I don't know. Look. I'm predisposed. Turtle Rama. Why would that be my favorite store? Because it's all of your stories. No, they're not. I thought uh, I was thinking my stories. There's a gold toilet in here. Okay. What's your point? Oh, sh oh shit! It's the fucking you toilet chair. Turtle Rama. Sixty-nine percent off. Oh, it's a lazy boy. Out of, that, out of that Turtle Rama store. The, this is the ultra lazy boy. Mm -hmm. That's... Saul Goodman's Oh, toilet. no! Oh, no, the security went off. 
Uh, in the finale, we, or one of the later episodes, we get a tour of Saul Goodman's mansion, and he really does have a golden toilet. Did Donald oh, Trump have one of those? I forget. I'd, I'd imagine not. he would, considering imagine. everything in his tower is literally gaudy gold-plated. Yeah. Because the man has no taste. Well, he also yeah. doesn't have that money. I just That's why how people know I'm rich. Doom Kid's well, beard is furry, says Dark Pulse. Is your beard a furry? He actually doesn't have that much money because, like, in liquid assets, because he just does shit like that. So when he owes money, it doesn't happen. It just nothing happens. If you're if you're yeah. rich enough, you don't need liquid money. It's just all like loans it, it, and debt. No, it, and... it helps. It helps. I'm sure it does, so but oh, like I, a... I don't th I don't think things are going good for him right now. Well, yeah, for he's, multiple he's, reasons. He's, he's like under multiple FBI investigations and like a handful of lawsuits to go through. Some of them are even his own. Like, well, the lawsuits remember... are pretty typical. Yeah, and um, I remember, like, didn't he want to sue Twitter, like, two years ago? What's happening with that? <laughs> That's probably on the back burner. Because <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure he's under the investigation by the FBI for, like, five different things, at least. Oh, yes. There's a, it's not just flushing a bunch of documents down the toilet, although that is one of the many things. Wait, the president's <laughs> not allowed to do that? <laughs> Yeah, what kind of commie dystopia oh. have we entered where the president can't flush documents on the toilet anymore? I just love how we have him on tape trying to commit voter fraud, but apparently that wasn't much to get him impeached. <laughs> You're allowed to get away with pretty much anything in that position. Uh, well, he hasn't fucked. shot anyone on Fifth Avenue yet. He's definitely oh. thought about it, but he hasn't gone through it yet. Yeah. Playbot. Oh. Playbot. Oh, it can drink whiskey. Nice. <laughs> oh, this is this area. I, f I remember now. Oh, oh he's right behind me. I love the fire. The build engine fire and explosions and stuff. Yeah, like I, I was saying earlier, like if build engine had been like released to open source and we had it was as easy to make i'd probably like build more than doom <laughs> like for for community wads it is it what what is it that really sells you is it the janky ass collision physics wow or is it the <laughs> big build fan huh well yeah jankier than doom one's engine and doom one's pretty jank to you quite see me uh, the build engine is held together with um, duct tape and clown 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 I just yeah. like the uh, amount of detail, I think. It's, the main it's thing. so consistently like floaty, though, that it works. Moving in blood is great. <laughs> like, my favorite Doom maps kind of ape some of the, the high-level detail and, you know, intricacy of these. Like, DBP50 has some stuff that kind of feels like But this. then you play mods, like, and then you're like, oh, I like Classic more. Vanilla's better. I like the classic yep. feeling gameplay, but I like the detail of build, if that makes sense. It does uh, understand why you Although, need to um, I don't know, th this feels this feels fairly good. There's something about the Doom feel with free look that I don't like as much as build. I don't know why. Well, Doom doesn't need it. Yeah. Because, like, I'm playing Lost Civilization, which has, like, you know, highly detailed maps, but I'm playing it with, you know, no, no free look. Hyper-realistic? No. Hyper realistic. Hyper realistic. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Yeah, I was playing Lost you know, Civilization and then, like, Mario started then Doom, bleeding Doom hyper realistic guy started, blood. Doom guy had hyper realistic eyes and he started bleeding hyper realistically. And it was really scary. And I got oh. to call my mom and tell her then, that I wanted to leave the party. And then do you run into hyper realistic drugs? To a good song. I don't think I'll ever be able to go back to modern games uh, for modern FPSs after um, so much Doom and the retro uh, renaissance because they're so much slower in comparison to yeah. the movement. Well, I was replaying Metro and I'm like, oh my god, it feels like I'm walking through molasses. This is awful. <laughs> Fortunately, yeah. Metro is more about being stealthy and uh, just yeah. wandering around scavenging for stuff. It's so a bit it's slower paced. Bad. I, I mean, but I remember it, enjoying Far Cry quite feeling, a bit. The feeling is just, it's just, ugh, it's so much slower. I mean, even, even yeah. new Doom is like, slower. Yeah, he's slow as fuck. 
Like, <laughs> I, I remember I, I turned it on. I was like, how do you turn always run on? I was like, oh, that is, it is on. <laughs> yeah. I, I couldn't handle that when I was playing at first. So like, I, it felt painful with how slow I was. But like for a modern game, it is it a shooter. It is fast is the thing. It's like they tried to split the difference a little bit, but, you know. Yeah. I should have adjusted the running speed to make him as zippy as he is in, in classic, but, well. Like, people seem to love it regardless, so. Yeah, what are you going to do about it? I liked it when I played I mean, it. Nothing. I, I'm, I'm happy New Doom is successful. Yeah, that's, that's what we thought. Yeah. How does that make you feel? <laughs> I feel good. <laughs> you better. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, anything that, like, it brings more popularity to the Doom scene is great. Yeah, yeah. Brutal Doom is amazing. No, it's trash. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Sorry. I stand corrected. Uh, <laughs> I'm still gonna make a. I'm still thinking of making a Doom Deathmatch is trash video based on that blueprint. <laughs> Just to fuck with people. We'll ream you. Please do. I'm definitely gonna make call sure it Doom Kid multiple times. Say my name, yeah. Doom Kid. Make sure to sure use. Make sure to sure use uh, Bean Sprout's um, level of argumentation where you say things like it's trash or it's really bad, oh, but absolutely. you don't elaborate. Make sure you don't elaborate at all on why. Or make so, sure your explanations are so fucking childishly simple. It's bad because you don't like it. It's bad because it don't make sense, but you don't explain why it doesn't make sense. Well, it might be okay, hard for me to so, willingly do that. I'll probably accidentally be like way more. Well, you see, Brutal Doom isn't all bad. The parts that are bad are bad, and the good things are good, but that goes for like anything. Really. Also, like and subscribe. <laughs> also, have you considered subscribing to my channel? Also, you can sub Remember. to my channel below. Don't forget to buy my shitty T-shirt from a from a free press I use. That uses a copyrighted image of Doomguy's face. That actually, mm. that video actually got recommended to me. And then as soon as he said, "Well, good things are good and bad things are bad," that's how things work. I just, I actually just stopped watching. Uh... <laughs> and the thing is, like, I don't believe he's an idiot. I do believe like he does that bullshit on purpose just I to don't. piss people off. To get I might it have to put that exact line in. Yeah. <laughs> Good things are good and bad things are bad. Is that so, about the nostalgia critic or something? Was that Bob Dylan? I, who said that originally? I walked Bob Dylan up on stage. Good things are good and bad <laughs> things are bad, man. You had an I artist. walked Bob Dylan on stage back in 19... whatever, whatever. What are you? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> You're no artist. I have a true artist. degree in art from New York University. I'm trained classically. I'm trained contemporaneously. You can't hold a note. Don't show me your horned lip. You got nothing. You're, You're nothing. You're me. You're a piece of shit. Get off the no street. You can't play. You're no artist. A true artist respects the silence of the foundation that creativity. Respect Get out with your spite of disrespect. Oh. Smart as <laughs> I I want to know this guy's life story. Like I want to know what he does. I want to know like what led him to that point. I still I think feel he, like he's, he's the... laid out his life story pretty well. Yeah, yeah. He walked Bob Dylan up on stage. I don't, I don't think that's true. I watched Bob Dylan in 1963. Who are you? <laughs> Justin Wang's done an entire Wait, video on that guy. <laughs> Wait, what did he say he did with Bob Dylan in 1963? No, I just made up the date, dude. Stage. Calm down. Okay. No, oh, I, uh, 1963 was actually not the year that that calm happened. Calm down. It couldn't have because in 1963, calm Bob Dylan down. Band. He was just doing folk music. It would have to be like 65 onwards. Where he started calm down, like Wilster. I love that you fact check all of his jokes. It's fucking hilarious. Calm the fuck down. It's just a, it's just a true statement. Like starting with bringing I'm just it all sitting back here home. chilling, dude. You know, when he I'm like just, started doing songs like I'm just sitting here, I'm just blue, sitting here telling jokes like, hey, and chilling. That's all I'm. That's all I'm doing. Up until people, that point, it was just him guitar and a harmonica. You know, nobody cares. I care. Nope. You know, just nobody. Nobody was playing with Bob Dylan in 1963. It was just Bob Dylan masturbating on stage, pretty much. But did you know that he, <laughs> he walked could, that, off he, the... Yeah, but he could have seen him then. Like, uh, what's your point? Walk him up on stage, though. No. No. It just it couldn't happen. Baxter Bunny, how do you like hack X sandwich? What? What's that? Hack, hack X. 
It's, a, it's like a Doom mod that was commercialized at some point. I, think. I don't it's know if so I've heard of it. Uh, it's sort of, it was sort of commercial, but also not really. But it was a, it's a really old title conversion. I don't think I've ever played it or heard of it. I tried it and I didn't really, it's, I didn't finish not, the first level. It's not particularly well, well regarded or anything. It's just kind of there. I've heard a kind lot of, of a, people like really kind of a, don't know. Yeah, why. I'm sure it has some fans, but it like it's very, it's rather obscure. It, it, it's a bit of a, it's a novelty, more a, a curiosity, more or less. I respect the style, yeah. but I don't like it. Version. Hey, Protostar, what's up? Dark Pulse is actually uh, was heading off. Oh. I'll uh, I'll see you soon. Always a pleasure. Bye, Pulse. Who is Dark? Oh, okay. See you, Dark Pulse. I'm good. I said I was gonna try another game, but I'm loving this so much. It's kind of hard to stop, to be honest. So you're not gonna play Hexen? Well, I'm not playing Hexen. Game. Let's all do a sandwich until he changes the game. No. <laughs> Let's all roast how bad he is at Iron <laughs> Fury. Don't don't do that. You're stinky. Yeah. Be, you want me, Wilson? Why is he doing this? I don't know. He's got a problems. It's a medical condition. Is there a reason why Knights is muted? Knights uh, is self muted, aren't they? He's self muted. Like, he was muted the last time as he was just sitting there the entire time being muted. Like, he's hello, just, are you alive? sitting there chilling. Maybe he got tired of saying the same joke a hundred times. <laughs> I think that's gonna... Hmm. Oh, that didn't work? Seems like someone's a little behind on the bills. <laughs> also, ladies muted too. Where is everybody? What are you doing? I left earlier so I could get food for my oven. They were here until you got here, Bio. No, I'm In case you wanted to know. I'm always interested to know what you're doing, Snacky. Thanks. The <laughs> oven is now off. Always. The oven's always. Off. She yeah. lives a fascinating little life. <laughs> <laughs> like one time I accidentally a little to, life. <laughs> to move to Canada and peep the kid wouldn't stop calling me. Uh, you wanted to move to Canada? To it was an accident. Well, wait a minute. Isn't there a way to get? Where's the yellow? That's what they all say. I also did try to join a cult in Canada, but that didn't work out. Which uh -huh. cult? I don't know. The, the whole name. country. It was some sort of commune. Oh, you wrote there. It was a cult of personality. You know what I mean? To Canada, Canada, Canada. That's the song. Oh shit! That's a three. That's a, really good that's a that ladder. One. Oh! I, 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 I think fell in love with that song through the game. Obviously. I got the Ion Bow secret. Uh, yeah, that's the first place I ever heard it. I really liked it as a kid, and then I kind of outgrew it, but, you know. And then it cropped up, because I, I, I didn't play GTA San Andreas until like a decade after it released, and then okay, it, so you it can... showed up on the radio and that, and I was like, whoa, they got the Guitar Hero music in here? You can, you can, um, charge up a wide shot with the Ion bow, which is cool. Uh, however, I can't remember where the yellow. I have to turn something on for the skull thing. And what, are you straight tripping? Uh, this <laughs> level has right about now has me straight tripping. Boo! Oh wait a minute, is this? There's one I need. Oh, there's one I need to turn. On. Oh geez, that actually visibly dented. That's not good. Whoa, I actually visible. missed a fucking... Ah, oh, shit. Uh... I, I, let me look back at this game for a moment. It looked really good. I've been mapping the last 20 minutes or so. I need to start doing that. Wait a minute. There's something here. I, I'm, I'm getting my... Uh, ah. Figuring out what I'm gonna do. Then I'm gonna... Do the... Thing. Uh -huh. Please elaborate. Uh, out Dark, Dark do, Pulse says Bio's a it. cool dude. Whoa. You guys know uh, each other? From, be from before he came here? Whoa. Is he, uh... Is, is Bio cool? just walk around with sunglasses and a leather jacket constantly? <laughs> I feel like, I mean, like... Cool dude. 
Some people have asked to get on voice chat. I just feel like there's a lot of people and I, I'm just hesitant to add anybody, but you know. We're special. You're not. <laughs> I, what? Oh my god, I've been told that my entire life. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I thought that people would be telling you that you're special your whole life. Yeah, they do. Okay, okay. Just make sure we're on the same page. Yeah. <laughs> you're that, uh, you're the wears a bicycle helmet to bed kind of special. Okay, so actually, Whoa! when I was younger, I used to fall out of my bed every morning. Jesus. Like, and not what wake up. Yeah, so... <laughs> every, every morning you would just n not wake up. How do I get... Okay, oh, I get no, 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 I'd, I'd still be sleeping after I fell out of the bed in the morning. So... <laughs> my oh, shit! Would just be oh, yeah! Up by, like, Secret a really stash. loud thud. And then be concerned for my safety, and my mom was like, Nah, she's fine. I, uh, this only happened once, but I was in like first grade and I just uh, apparently in my sleep screamed at the top of my lungs the words SpongeBob SquarePants. Uh huh. Woke up my parents with that one. That was last week, Wilster. Quit lying. <laughs> yeah, that was on stream. Mm. Mm. Okay, this is good because it has very long range, which I thought I did. That pistol was not very long range, so this is actually, uh,. Quite a nice secret weapon to find here. Yes, cord. <laughs> um. However, oh, I blow up that whole fucking area. Yeah, there's just like a ton of variety even within like the later levels have their own look. I guess this first episode is more of this Neon City feel. We got action. We got thrills. We got comedy. We got talent. I've got five ninety nine yeah. on sale for three dollars. <laughs> Premium <laughs> prices. I got five eighty eight. Right. More like premium prices. I mean, come on, you know, Eric's he's a con he's a, he's a chronic masturbator. He just can't stop whacking up. Don't go to his store. <laughs> Who wants to pay a premium for prices? Look at these. Look at Tim's cheap prices. There's no meat on it. Throw it back. I'm not giving you to my family. Find European prices. I'm gonna watch this again. Fuck me. The prices video. I love that one so much. Premium prices. I remember it being a real good one. Premium prices. That one and the, uh, we have a home for, oh, what's his name? Some random fucking name. We're like, it's a home for you. This video is only for, fuck, I wish I could remember his name. Free real estate. You have that one. Protostar just beat Entropy ah. Zero Two on hard. Apparently it's a mod for Half-Life 2. I've never heard of it. Um, this Sounds I'm playing. Right. This is Ion Fury, a, a, a modern build engine game. Uh, there's actually a, an expansion that's supposed to be coming, I think, this year called Aftershock. Um, I think it was delayed, that's maybe, true. or something. But. The old GDF Academy is nearby. There's a Remember weird half life. Oh, go ahead, Bile. Well, it's a, this is a highly modified version of build. It's, you know, the ED yeah. engine. This would die if it tried running on the original build engine. Yeah, I don't know yeah. how modified, but it's... It's you know, very modified. Very, very, very modified. It's, yeah. Very, 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 very modified. It, it's, oh, okay. the G, it, it's the GZ Doom of, of, of build, basically. All right, I think that's going to do for Ion Fury. I think I might try some Dusk now. Um, build was good, but not that good. Yeah, that was a lot of fun, though. Uh, you're wondering what this is about, Protostar? I guess I just explained it, or they just helped as well. Um, yeah, it's, yeah like a, it's like a cyberpunk, you know, kind of GZ build almost version <laughs> of Duke. Um, it's, like, it's got some fun... You know, has, some of the gameplay is a little different. It's got, like, headshots in it, but they're tremendously detailed... It's a lot of fun. I think they're a bit hit skate yeah, heavy like for some people, but uh Listen, I know classic games. This is tremendous. It's huge. I've never seen another <laughs> game like this before. 
Hello. <laughs> everyone Mario. Say, everyone tells me. I know what thing We love the retro game. games, don't we, Pim? Who the hell is that supposed them. to be? Me and my brother Luigi, we like to play video games. And we can tell you a thing or two about this, yeah. This is a good game. Would you agree with me, Luigi? Yes, Mario, even though I'm Stop dying of stage. Stop. <laughs> Uh, you see, what so in you the bloody it, hell are you two talking about? I've Luigi. never heard Luigi sound so sultry. This is uncalled for. It works. Luigi's gotten healthier since their last check-in, but Mario is still quite sick. Luigi's <laughs> <laughs> back to his normal sultry self once again. <laughs> Luigi, actually, Sandwich is Luigi. I forgot about that. He's, he's literally playing Luigi in the upcoming live-action Super Mario Bros. 2. Who's replacing Bob? You guys have heard about that stupid fucking movie, I assume, right? With Chris Pratt, yeah. It's not live-action, yeah. but... Uh, you know. Oh, oh, it's okay. Thank fuck. It's animated, yeah. And it's not a sequel to the first movie. Okay, because that movie was a piece of fucking unmitigated it's, it's shit. Its own, it's its own thing. Oh boy, that first movie, man. I've heard some people watched it clearly like, I watched it as a kid too, and as a kid I was like, wow, this sucks. There's a guy who, um, that movie, like, this guy has a weird obsession with Mario, and um, when he watched that movie and found out through that movie that Mario is not from Brooklyn, it legitimately broke his heart, and like, <laughs> <laughs> and he, he like disavowed it from the canon. Like, this is a guy who wrote an entire book. He wrote an entire book about the experience of playing Super Mario Brothers three, and like confesses that he would like stay out, stay at work late just so he could come home when everyone was asleep so he could uh, use the computer to play wait, Mario that, Brothers is that, I'm back, is what that, did I miss? Is that from Movie Bob's book? Yeah, that's the Movie yes, Bob. Yes, yes, I knew it, I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen his uh, his views on um, eugenics? Oh my no. god. No! He's, he's, he's pro Don't want to hear about it. Don't want to <laughs> hear like, about legit, it. He's like legit, like I'm Certain sure he's very legit. Easily. Too legit to quit. Well, <laughs> he's too legit to quit. You did It's not. It's not all bad, but it's not. It's not a good idea. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna load up Dusk here. We've got a fake DOS six point six six activated, which is. Are you? Are you, are you legit? I can't say it. Holy fuck! I literally can't say it. Are you? Legit eugenicist or just one of those casuals? Okay. <laughs> yeah, let me. I gotta fucking find because he has like specific like key phrases he uses every time. Like I think he uses the phrase "superior future" a lot. Oh god, <laughs> there's such a Hitler-esque tinge to that. Yeah. And he like he like talks about I don't know. It's, he lives in his mom's basement still. <laughs> Sounds like the type of person who would talk about uh supremacy and stuff to be honest so have you guys played yeah. dusk yes i've yes. actually beaten this it's very good i have not i've got i got through half of it i think it has very good atmosphere i um, got stuck somewhere in episode three yeah um what do you how do you episode guys like to play really enjoyable how do you guys like to i i actually have a little bit of <clears throat> there's some options here for like palette and stuff i have um Keep Retro palette on, and I've got a little bit of pixelization, but not a lot. Uh huh. But it's actually quite, you know, you can dusk boy color. You can go. Grandpa's... Kind of weird yeah, keep the bloom off. The bloom the is terrible. Out. Like, like it look is. at it's yeah, it's bilinear filtering as well. Terrible. Yeah, you don't want that. Uh, but yeah, I have retro palette, which I think is kind of cool. Um, for the Grandpa's same 386. For the sake of streaming, I recommend not having it very pixelated. I have it just a little bit here. As and... much as I love Doom in a low resolution, it's awful for making videos. You guys will, this is before your time, but bilinear filtering used to be a very controversial issue. Shut up. Oh, yeah, very controversial in back in the old days. <laughs> People love it now. <laughs> <sighs> well, back then it was straight linear filtering or go home, but... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Doom guy. 
All these okay, kids these so days, all they know how to do is eat hot chips and use bilinear filtering. Protostar sure filtering works on some on graphics, but not not on retro stuff. It so, just um, looks more Protostar has only heard Dusk right. mentioned, but from Civi, whoever that is. Uh, I'm gonna, is from uh, I'm from kidding. Movie Bob's book. There's a couple of choice uh, things he brings <laughs> up on page. Oh, on the introduction, he includes Shigeru Miyamoto in the dedications for saving his life more times than he knows. <laughs> on page 26, he oh. identifies with Mario because they were both born in the same year and he can't remember a world without him. <laughs> on, pa on page 41, he compares the 90s console wars to the Vietnam War. <laughs> <laughs> on page on page 30, he says he carried a Super Mario Bros. 2 Mario figurine as a good luck charm throughout grade school. Uh, does, he, does he not 40, have a cross between Mario and something else? On page 40, does he have not Sauna Mario himself, or something? Just on page 40, he forced himself Mario to like too. the 1993 Mario film because he needed it to be good because Mario is his friend. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm gonna try this on medium difficulty. I can take now, it. I fucking was obsessed with Mario when I was young. How old is this guy? Oh, he's in his um, 40s now. Yeah, he's in it. He's oh. uh, he's in his 40s. He has type 2 diabetes, okay. and he lives in his mom's basement. Like I don't, think, oh, I don't know, man. On page 33, this is one of my favorites. On page 33, he compares the significance of Head him cheese. being the first known footage of Super Mario Bros. 3 to that of the JFK assassination and 9-11. <laughs> I think I'm sensing a pattern here. This, is this guy like a, uh, you know, is he uh, playing a character? For no. Nope. No. No, this man's that's completely that's legitimate. Like, um, on page 42 to 44, he says that Yoshi's Island broke his brain because it's <laughs> revealed flash retcons that Mario and Luigi grew up in the Mushroom Kingdom and not Brooklyn. This happened while he was a fucking high school senior. Well, to be fair, I think it broke a lot of people's brain. Just that baby crying all the time. I mean, it's funny because Super Mario World 2 nowadays is regarded as a classic, but man. And, and I can play it as an adult and appreciate it, but as a kid, it just felt very inferior to the Mario series up to that point. I, I imagine it would have been quite a shock for anyone uh, during that time because the gameplay is so remarkably different because, you know, it was it was supposed to be a different original game and then they just slapped Mario skins on it. Oh, I think uh, I think the visuals look pretty straight. good with the settings I have. It's funny yeah. when you reload, it just flips your guns around. Like, there's no reloading in this, you fucking idiot. He compares the story, the plot to Super Mario Brothers 3. He compares it to to, uh, to uh, War and Peace. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, he's totally literally right, right? just comparing every single Mario thing to, uh, what's a major historical event? It's not that Yeah, it's like great. he was just pulling, pulling them out of his ass. I, I doubt he's even... That I, is surprisingly common. I doubt Movie Bob has actually read Tolstoy. I really doubt it too. Actually, usually it's the opposite. Like some, something will happen. Someone will be like, "This is just like in a Marvel movie." <laughs> I hate that. Every cause, like somebody actually on Twitter once called out Movie Bob for only understanding the world through the lens of movie references, and Movie Bob replied by like, "Oh, you're just Tyler from Fight Club." <laughs> <laughs> Quaff beer. That was, that was his response. Like, okay, yeah, all right. Yeah, oh, really shit. Cool for you. What is this? Clippy? Is that a Dorito this head guy? Uh, yeah, that's this? a Dorito man. Hey, Are you fitting a Dorito? Mario? That's a Nacho man. Remember that commercial? Nacho, Nacho man. What a masker. I have a what question. Map is this? What was that, sorry? What this is the not a Doom map. For when you're loading resources and uh, GZ didn't build there, are you are there config files so they're sorted by type? <laughs> oh, so like, like the... base, brick, oh, so... computer, doors, that sort of thing. All of my custom oh, stuff so... will just be like lumped in. Well, as, I could uh... I could make one that's organized. Um... GZ didn't. Builders I believe there is a, oh, no. I believe there is an okay. Easter egg where this bar of soap kills d things instantly. It, it kills everything in one hit. Is it if, it, oh, if you throw it at them, I guess. Yeah. yeah. 
it compensates us with that by being really hard to use and pull off properly. That's pretty funny. Is there like, there's gotta be like an all soap run at this point, right? Probably. Yeah, there is. Like, there's an achievement you can get if you carry, manage to carry the soap up all the way to the end of the game. <laughs> yeah, don't drop oh, it. Oh yeah, here it is. Uh, Clippy, this is Dusk. This is a retro shooter that came out, uh, I don't know, years ago. Years ago. Years ago. Oh, but, yeah. It's, it's kind of like quake, fun. quake like, style. It's like four years old or something at this point, I think. Yeah. Bio, how are you doing, Clippy. buddy? I haven't talked for so long, man. Remember? <laughs> remember? Okay. You remember so bio? here's um. I remember? think I found it. Uh, you can slide if you crouch, which is cool. You can slide into their DMs if you crouch. You slide into Dusk DMs, basically. And actually, like... That's not gonna work. Oh, wait. I'm patting two cats at once right now. Oh, uh, that's dream. my dream. We got Conky and Quinny in the house. If I was a millionaire, Ooh. I'd pet two cats at once. If I were a rich man... <laughs> I like how Discord cut you off there. <laughs> oh no, I was dust done. I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna do the whole thing. It sounded like you said you were dusk done. Doom Kid, how you doing, dusk bud? Done. Cliffy, it's been so long. How are you, man? Oh, buddy. It's been so long. Didn't you guys do a video together like two days ago? No, no. <laughs> Voxel Doom Max Maps, yeah. I was a cat today. Yeah, you beat it. Here we you, are. You were um, a cat today? I did the stray cat mod. Oh, how was that? Where? Where? That's like two minutes of fun and that's it. It looked like pretty much just a gimmick that is designed to sell PC gamer subscriptions <laughs> or something. That's the first thing I thought when I saw it. I just had to see it. It's kind of cute. That's the end of that. noise when someone gets injured. Oh yeah, I should look. There's uh, there's no auto map from what I can see, but you can see the number of kills and secrets in the top right if you hit tab. I'm probably... fairly certain the game does have an auto map. Uh, I haven't seen it anywhere. Um, Check your settings. Look harder. I did. I did when I when I tested this earlier, and uh, there's uh, customized bindings. You're in the wrong section. You're in the wrong section. Customized bindings. You're in the wrong section. What's the right <laughs> section? It would be in look. Look is the graphics. You know, like you look at the graphics. Feel is the, the input touch. bindings. And uh, are you two it, gonna get a divorce? <laughs> and uh, I used that same joke on you and uh, Sand before Snap. There's there's no auto me. map. Um, tab just brings up uh, this in the top left. Right. But, you know, the maps aren't... Uh, it's almost like the way they designed the maps was like to not really get lost that much. It's just interesting. Did Quake have an auto map? There are some maps in this that can be confusing. Did Quake remember. have an auto map? I don't remember. I think it did. Didn't I? I think so. I, I don't know. I haven't played Quake in a while. Oh, well. When he's batting at the phone, I think he thinks he's I, trying to. I don't. I game. don't think Quake has an auto map. I've never used it, at least. Yeah, yeah. I think this yeah, might be moron. taking cues from that. Then. Also, you get this basically berserk sickle, super fast mode, which is pretty fun. <laughs> oh, good luck. We have to build a superior future where everybody worships Mario. Oh. <laughs> I, I, I wish <laughs> I was a farmer in the 1800s. I just Why? think this is called down on the farm this level. If you were a farmer in the eighteen hundreds, you'd have like the best life. That is no, wouldn't you be fucking <laughs> miserable. You'd be poor all the time. No, you wouldn't yeah. know about like all the worst stuff going on, you'd just be like happily milking yeah, your cow. Yeah, until the, until your own life military. would be terrible. You the horrors would be, be your own life where you get tuberculosis and die. No, no, <laughs> yeah. it's Cliffy, you wouldn't know about anything happening in the world until the government decided we're going to war with somebody and they just like roll up and it's like, yeah, we're taking all of your males over 18 and we're shipping you off tomorrow. 
Uh, in this, there isn't, there isn't there is an idealistic version of it, but it's not what was real, you know. You wouldn't also, want to be a farmer at any point in time. You're just fucking miserable. Hey, <laughs> oh, dude, my grandpa's not miserable. He's lived a good life. He's kind of miserable out. now, but you'd be miserable if you were 80, no matter what. I feel like you can flip your guns around, which is fun. You have like 15 kids run the farm for you. Oh shit, double fucking shotguns. Also, these scarecrows Great look kind of creepy. I really well. hope they don't come alive or something like that. That would be crazy. <laughs> that happened. Oh yeah. Great, like great, great grandparents. Is this Dark Souls? I just lit that fire. No. Is this Dark Souls? You can cook the meat better than it. And it gives oh. you more health. Oh, devour cooked viscera. I didn't know that. Oh, that's yep. 25%. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's Good lots tip. of cool little interactive elements like that in this game. You guys now, like who, fire? Who made this one again? Uh, this was made by David Zamansky. What's the they company make, uh, that he made it They made there? Evil as well? Blood. Alright, uh, New Blood, what, isn't it? No, they, no, what are they called? Uh, something Blood? New Blood is, uh, is it Studios? New Blood, or... that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. New Blood published it, and Dave's a Dave's a I see. Okay, yeah, New Blood is the publisher that's doing all these retro FPSs. Yeah. yeah, like a lot of them. And like, I think their CEO is just an absolute shitlord. Like, he's constantly just buying domains with the dumbest possible names. Like, yeah, fuck he... it, not why not is one of the domains he bought. Fuck it, dot why not. Yeah, like, yeah. like um, uh, like a. Uh, uh, New Blood's like website. The actual URL is wehatemoney.com because like because they love to, they, you know they they never want to sell their games for a, a stupid in, absor in absorbent amount. You know, they don't like the idea of being. I mean, like, if, they, if they charge eighty dollars for this game, I would be so pissed. They don't want to turn into like EA or something like that. You know. You could never sell this for eighty dollars. So they're like, they said, we hate money, and we love memes, and we love games. I yeah, that's like great. Games. It's great to have developers like that. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> you just it's got the quake, uh, you know, it's got the quake jump pad type thing, which is fun. Quake doesn't have jump pads in it, does it? No. Or am I thinking of Quake 3, like the, the multiplayer? I think uh, there's a Half-Life Deathmatch map with those jump pads, with jump pads in it. Yeah, now I'm remembering the Quake 3 it. Deathmatch stuff. I remember playing it in my school's computer lab and just... There's that one level out, like, in the void where you're just jump padding onto islands and shit. That was, that was great. Like, I guess there's Ziggurat Vertigo, a secret level from Episode 1 where they turn the gravity down. Kind of fun. What Ziggurat? happened to Dean Kid? He's... Busy, okay. Yeah, cut him some slack. He's, He's doing his best. You know, old. <laughs> also, I saw busy? this thing across the edge when I tested this, and I can't <laughs> jump over that, and I don't know how to get there. It's Looks part of the map, so you'll get to it later. Uh, well, this map finishes, but maybe in the next map. Yeah, you're probably uh, looking at the next map for the next. Who knows? Oh, I didn't realize they did that. Oh, there's something maybe. up there, but. Not sure how to get that. Well, guys, it's been fun, but is it Betty by time, Flippy? Yeah. I gotta get up at five a.m. I wish I could stick around, but you know. Honestly. Good luck dabbing things with the things and doing stuff there, but good job. Thanks. I'm trying. So proud of you. It's See okay. you, Chris. You I want to yeah, spawn this. <clears throat> Uh, I'm not sure I'm gonna find it though. Uh, can I somehow? Eh. I'm not gonna slow down too much for secrets, really. That's just a rivet for like a gun, I think. Uh, but this is the rivet gun. This just looks like a guy from Half Life, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is just a Half Life soldier. No, uh, I'm not. I'm a dusk soldier. Yeah. <laughs> Amorpher, yeah, Amorpher says, I'm supposed to be dusk. <laughs> Big ass difference. 
Uh, Protostar says you really need to play more boomer shooters like this. Absolutely. Uh, these are some of my favorites that I'm playing right here. Dusk, well, maybe not Dusk. Iron Fury is, but this is cool. What's the. Somebody what? didn't like that. Yeah. What? You, Dusk is Snacks a is a big Dusk fan. Yeah. I like it when it's kind of getting dark out, but it's not like nighttime. You know, that's the best time of day. <laughs> He's a right. fan of Dusk. Yeah. Wow. You're what it says. No. Oh, oh shit. shit. Very stupid. The scarecrows come alive. Ah. Who could have ever foreseen? Uh, you can get. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, there's a way to get up on there, but I'm not sure if that's like you said the next map or it's like. Huh. Huh. Oh yeah. You can like pick up and throw barrels and shit too. If you're so inclined. Do stuff like this. Oh, I missed them. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Miss terribly. You can miss terribly with barrels if you like. If you kill stuff, I guess they drop like 1 HP, little vials, which is a uh, interesting bit of balancing. Kind of lets you kill your way to heal a bit. Yeah, I really did not make it that far into this uh, game. Did you not even make it here? No, I made it this far, but I didn't make it that. Uh, yeah, I remember this area with the goats or some shit, you know. Yeah. I just remember getting stuck in that, uh, it was like a really large part in, um, like, there's this, oh. really, this huge arena in episode three. There's an area, it oh, might yeah. be in this level, but I remember they took a room from Doom 1 and they, like, threw it into one of the levels as a secret. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, it's not, like, the texturing's obviously different, but it's like the, it's that room in E1M2 where you descend into it and there's like the imps up on the ledge. Like they copy and pasted that room pretty much. <laughs> so, so like does opening stuff affect like the next map or is it like, I'm not sure. I have to find the secret in this one. I think I... Hmm. Cause I played this for testing and like I couldn't figure out what that opened necessarily. What's the morale stat? Isn't That's just dumb. armor. You pick up like diamonds and stuff, and it's like that That's protects what that you. Does. Okay. Um. Have I played Thief? I uh, <clears throat> never played much of the original Thiefs, but uh, you know they're obviously classics that I probably should. I you know I played the Thief like like reboot game actually that was actually all right but it's i don't think it's good for a thief game though so people were pissed it's terrible, terrible. Yeah, but, i mean i enjoyed it as like kind of a thief bad. light basically at the time. Like just, thief three. let's just make an immersive sim but just ruin everything that makes an immersive sim exactly because i don't like immersive sims so that's why that i that is you're wrong yeah i'm wrong yeah, you are. I mean, there's a reason I play games like Doom. They're very straightforward shooters. I don't really... I get overwhelmed with so many options. It's not that complicated. I'm sure it isn't. Um... Do the thing. Do the thing? Isn't there a way to get up there? Yeah, just Probably. Do. You use the gravity gun. Oh. <laughs> how could I forget? With a 30 minute tutorial on how to use it. I fucking hate the weapon <laughs> tutorials in that game. Like the rocket launcher. Like the gravity gun's one thing, because it was a totally new weapon that no game had ever had before. But like the rocket launcher, like, yeah, I know how to use a rocket launcher. I don't need to sit here for 10 minutes learning how to use a weapon that was in the first fucking game. 
Oh, I, I guess you can just do this. They sh I, I didn't know how to use it when I was a kid first playing Half-Life, so I would like try to shoot it with the laser on, and I'm like, why does it just throw itself at a wall? <laughs> <laughs> I shoot it at something. I think my, my friend, he would played Half-Life for quite a while by the time he passed it on to all of us. And uh, and so he kind of was like, yeah, I know, this is how this shit works. Hey, wait, wait, there's a secret hatch wedge, in that little no, area. Wedge, the wedge, base. go back, Turn around. go back. That wedge, little go spot, back. The area with the gold, there's a hatch in there. The area with the gold? Where you just Oh, the hatch. Yeah. I wasn't sure what that was. Go back. Okay, I didn't realize that. You have motion blur on? No. Doomkit did not add a lot of hell textures to this set. Whoa, Riveter. what the hell is this thing? A riveter. Rosie the Riveter here for your service. Oh, end level. Why is... Oh, I'm looking at the wrong fucking thing. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, you were, you were maybe delayed. That's why I was like, what? Uh... <laughs> no, I was looking at it on YouTube. Yeah. I forgot what I was looking at. <laughs> Um, is this like a secret exit? It says end. Yeah, I assume so. Just is wait. Maybe um, a... because I end level. I guess it is. There's also a teleport, but I'm guessing that just puts you back. Like, yeah. yeah wait, go on the teleport. The I think there Sorry. is. I think there is something in this level. There is I... something on top of this farmhouse, but I don't actually. It's like one. I think it's it's just like one rivet pickup. Who cares? Or it's a um something. It's gold or something. Like the, that little shed that had like the red. It's on the other side of the corn maze. Yeah, this. Well, I hit some switch that like. Well, this is the normal way down. Okay. What's That's the like? normal way down there? Have you gone down there though? Go down there, cause I like do a quick save, cause I am just curious about something for my own sake. If my memory is failing or not, I might be like, you know, dying here, but no, never mind. Okay. Yeah, you can go back to the. I was just curious about the thing. I was wondering what was down also, there. Also, there's like I a weird that, uh, physics thing where you can just launch off these things. I don't even know how I did it there. Quake, if you're on a sloped surface and you jump, you jump pretty fucking high. Yeah, I don't know how I did that. Whoa! You just um, did it again. Yeah, I think it's just holding forward off the top. It's just Oops, a feature. I did it again. Yeah, I always have to remember that you can just pick up, you know, physics stuff and just use that to get places. That's something I like think about when I'm thinking of like Quake. But it's a cool feature that they added. The Half-Life Two thing. They just stole that. It was so stolen. <laughs> Uh, reboot sucks? What? Oh, you mean the Thief reboot? I was like, well, just a second there, sir. <laughs> Don't go mucking my childhood show, man. Well, I play. I actually recently played that reboot uh, GZ Doom thing on uh, Doom World, and it's all right. It's more of like, it's a very light adventure game. I think it was more of a I'm, test thing. I imagine you and the two other uh, reboot fans that exist on Earth might enjoy it. <laughs> hey, my cousin might like it. Clippy liked it. Oh, oh, there you go. That's all three of you. Because <laughs> we're Canadian. It's a Canadian show, so we're very proud of the first, or at least one of the earliest CGI. Uh... My only, my only uh, fucking frame of reference for that show is people taking the piss out of it in fucking YouTube videos. Why? Because it looks fucking weird today. I don't it's, know. Yeah, it, <laughs> they just it's say like, that it's fucking I, awful. I oh. think I've said this before, but like the video game great. funky. Video game Donkey was talking about rebooting. He says like reboot was cutting edge technology back in the nineties, but nowadays it looks like it was done by fucking Tim and Eric. Uh yeah, things get better. It's crazy. That is a very uh passive. You're telling me way to early to CGI that. TV shows didn't age properly? Thanks, Copernicus. That's pretty fucked up. Uh Be the level using environmental weapons to get the low tech award. It's pretty funny. Should Low call tech. it the Luddite Award. Yeah, you'd be all over that. The Dim Slew? Now I know that it's pronounced Slew. Sloth. Uh, 
No, it's the slough is like a marshy or muddy yeah. area or something. Sloth. Sloth. Like when in the I song, thought it was sloth. Uh, oh god, it's in the song We Can Get Down by uh, Tribe Called Quest. Fife Dog mentions having a slew of rappers pushing positivity. A place of deep mud and mire, or less commonly used slough or meaning swamp, inlet, or river. Yeah, huh. I did not realize that until Wilster corrected me. I have um, lived on a farm. I know what a slew is. You don't <laughs> oh, is that it, really? Don't. Yes, that's, that's cool. it. That's, that's why I know that. Farm you life. do not want to fall into the slew. Yeah, yeah. This is the secret level, so that's cool. Thanks for uh, telling me about that hatch. I mean, I saw that little indentation in the ground, but I didn't think to actually hit used on it for some reason. Got you. Because the slew used to, oh, oh the shit, slew used thing to you know, here. freeze over in the winter. So you'd like, you know, like, oh, I'm going to go just walk around on the slew because it's kind of a nice fun game to, you know, to play chicken with the slew with your friends. And then, oh boy, the ice is breaking. That's not good. So I can go down that water hole. Yeah. Go down it. But uh, there's also this other area here. Yeah, go down the hole first. It's probably like a secret or something. You can probably get a weapon or some shit. Or some ammo. It looked pretty... L yeah. I thought it was Might like a whole different cache. area, but I guess you're right. It's probably a secret. Go in the hole It looked now. very long, though. It goes in the hole or it gets the hose again. <laughs> <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, secret. Key. We got a key, secret key machine and gun. machine gun. Yay. Heavy machine gun. Yeah, the Thief reboot was, um, like I said, it's it's like it's basically a modern, like, this is not really a Thief-style immersive sim anymore, but... I mean, to be fair, immersive sims aren't really commercially viable. Yeah, they they never really caught on, and then you just have all these, like, neckbeards nowadays. They're like, mm, those are the fine games. Yeah. System Shock 2 is really good, though. I... That's one of the only ones. It's like, yeah, it was all like Looking Glasses games are the only ones that people care about in that genre, really. Yeah, it's a very difficult uh, genre to pull off properly. I imagine it's harder to sell in this day and age because of, you know, people's attention spans these days are so short. Yeah, like, Prey was really good, but a lot of people just didn't like it because of the genre itself. Even though, as an immersive sim, it is fantastic. And you're referring to Prey, the sort of outer space one with the mimics, the wee, yeah. gooey black monsters? Right. The replay value on that is, like, ridiculous. And, um, just the... It's, you can, like, go out of your way to, like, try and break progression, and then it turns out, oh, they actually intended for that. Like, that gun that shoots glue. If you get a bunch of it, you can, like, build a platform and skip entire sections. But it's all, like, accounted <laughs> for, so it actually works instead of just being broken. It just works. No, it's a great game. The, the no, main I'm saying it just works. It, the main issue I had with it was all the enemies kind of look the same, because they're just, like, goo things, and there's not much weapon variety, but... Uh, I played I played a bit of it and it, it was very cool for what it is. I it's my personal thing is that I just get overwhelmed with so much choice. I'm just like I want to do this, I want to do this, and it's just like I I it's too much for me sometimes. I see how it is. Yeah. Uh, Not everybody can be a member of the superior future. Uh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> To be fair, you need to have a very IQ, high IQ to, uh, <laughs> to uh, What's the show that, that was Tyler called? It was about Fight Fork. Rick and Morty? Yeah. yeah. Fuck. My roommate's a huge fan of that. He cannot wait until the new season starts on September 1st. Neither can I. I'm looking forward to it. I like the show. I... Just hurt? Well, oh. kind of like the first two seasons. Yeah, I didn't like season three as much. That was more of a mixed bag, but I like the first. Well, two guys, this is a this is a slew I don't ass slew right here. I I've I thought the show has been consistently fun. I've enjoyed every uh, episode. I've, I love it. I've definitely felt like because I've I've seen all of the episodes because my roommate will just be watching it and I'll sit down with him occasionally mm -hmm. when I feel like tolerating him for the day. You can play <laughs> talking right now. I shouldn't be saying these mean things. 
uh, you know, and I'll sit down, I'll, I'll watch Rick and Morty with him. I'll tolerate the show, uh, particularly the later seasons. I do feel like it's gotten worse as it's gone. Your taste and it's, I don't know. I, I always, I would expect you to like different things than with how your humor is. Yeah, like you, I really expect him to like always sunny, and then he he like bounced off. I'm like, wow. I guess this you can come down this way. Is that that must be it? Yeah. I I just I don't I don't like I don't like it. I do not enjoy don't sir. Rick and Morty. No sir, I don't like it. Although I'll have no part in that. I'll have you know. Give it. That's a... I think oh, right, it's that's awful, the key and I is do not secret. care about it, at, care for it at all, my good sir. Yes, very much so. Oh no, <laughs> my mouse wheel settings are the opposite of what I like. Oh. No. Oh. Uh, where's the... Down the bottom. The next there. weapon like yeah. there we go for some reason i really like the other way uh, mm -hmm. some games just do it some don't well that was effective the river guns op it just shoots through everything, right? Oh, no, that's the crossbow. Oh, okay. But the, well, the, river the, river gun. Gun, the river gun is pretty powerful. It's very effective. Oh, this was all a secret, I think. <clears throat> or wait, no. I guess it was the yellow door. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, right, I go... Or wait, no, this was a yellow door, okay. These fucking guys. Wait a minute. Okay, there it is. Alright, I'm about to lose my mind for a second. Draw. Whoa. Are you winning, son? No. Oh, look, you're in that part of uh, Half Life where you have to lower the water level. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah. Okay. The iconic lower the water level section of Half Life that freaked the shit a... out of me my first time through, and then I, like, every subsequent time, like, yeah, you just, like, take a left. I really like that, so I made a section I, of the water. I, I remember getting lost on that part at the same time. Okay, my first time well, through, first I, drowned time I drowned at least. I drowned at least three times my first time playing the game. I don't remember dying. I just remember just move, running around in circles like an idiot, going, "What the fuck do I do? Where do I go?" I had to look up a walkthrough. <laughs> oh, I think I know the one you're talking about now. Yeah. Oh, it's a really early game. The drowning just reminded me of something I need to complain about in Half-Life 2. That the suit uses the same meter for uh, the flashlight in drowning. It just has that one meter for everything, yeah. Yeah, what? so it's like your flashlight's almost dying, so when you go underwater, <laughs> you drown like instantly, and it is <laughs> awful. By the way, I At love least... that the scarecrow just, just like explodes into like splinters. It is made better since... Oh, you regenerate the health from drowning, which I think is a good mechanic. I like playing Mario um, Sunshine, and you could you could drown Mario sometimes if you felt like it. <laughs> yeah, if, you, if you're up to it. You do that yeah, but... in, in Super Mario 64 too. Yeah, but I didn't have a Nintendo 64 growing up. We made do. We were country boys. That's your country boys make do. I had to make do with my far more advanced Nintendo GameCube. 
Uh, you like that Man, sonic dragging noise? 64. I didn't get a 64 until it was until after it became obsolete. Protostar has some issue with the script error and decorate. Wait, I don't the, know if you guys sonic, know decorate though. When you say the sonic drowning noise, Are you, you mean you? like the the absolutely panic-inducing the. I had Sonic on the Game Boy Advance, which is apparently a pretty shit port, uh, but that's the only version I had. <clears throat> and uh, I could not beat the Labyrinth level. I just sucked too much ass at that game. Is that the first, like, main... The, the, the first main underwater one was something. I think it is the first main underwater one. I, I don't even, like, it's, it's so disappointing because I never got to see the rest of the game because I... I could not beat the fucking Actually, labyrinth. That's yeah, that's where I got stuck on when I was a kid. The rest was like way easier after that. I never got past it. It's like this one game, Contra, for the Game Boy Advance. The at least the Game Boy Advance version of it. No turn. I back. could get to the I could get to the second level and I can get to the final boss of the second level and I would die to him every single time. I always sucked as a kid, you know. One night I managed to kill him and then I got through the whole game in one sitting and I just felt like a god <laughs> and then I never I never managed to do that again I would die on the second final boss of the second level every time it was this fucking train level I just uh, with uh, I remember how much that sucked as a kid when you got you know you could only get you know your parents bought you the one game and it's like I can't beat the second level it's all I have to play you just play it forever <laughs> it was like halfway through the game but in Diablo 2 I could like not beat the second act when I was a kid because of Duriel. Duriel, yeah. Oh my god, he's so brutal. He's like the hardest fucking <clears throat> it's so is a joke. And Yo, Diablo is it's like Kane's rib cage, check it out. <laughs> he's been drinking his milk. Yeah, he's been sucking on milk, so he's got thick bones. He's got the thick rib that's, cage that's bones. That's what I always loved about um uh, Mario Sunshine as a kid was that it was like if you were stuck Digging on one graves. level there were like there were 50 other levels you could play. So it's like, yeah, I never got past like the first level of the hotel area, but it was like, whatever, fuck it, I'll just go to the fucking amusement park area, you stupid ass game. <laughs> there were oh, some uh, levels. Did you mean Mario Sunshine? Was... or? Yeah. yeah, yeah, Sunshine. It's the one that I had growing up. I'm not a noob. I don't play these shitty games that suck ass. Well, it That's used to be game. that, you know, the games weren't that long, so they just had to make it super hard so that you don't beat the platformer in, like, what, two hours, you know, I guess. Just yeah, and then they just end. got it to the point where you can do the original Mario Brothers in, like, 30 seconds anyway, so fuck you, dad. It depends on the game. Like, some are, like, <clears throat> like Half-Life is fucking strangely long with how old that game is. And Opposing Force, even, even though it's just an expansion pack, like, that's, that's a good length campaign. Yeah, yeah, Push Shift is really short. That's only like a few hours. But Opposing Force, I think, takes like five or six on a casual. Blue Shift, Blue Shift uh, is such a, uh, a is so lame compared to Opposing Force. Like if you just finished Opposing Force, you're like, oh boy, now to play Blue Shift. Oh yeah, it's, it's so, just such. It just pales in comparison. Like, okay. Wow, this well, sucks. It's good. Probably one, the, if you're gonna play all of them, it's probably the best to play that one first because the best yeah. of the others are so much better. And like the the levels are good, like the urban or not the urban, but like the Black Mesa theme. But they just don't use any of the later end uh, content. I wait. I uh, love the Zen section of Blue Shift though. I think it's the Zen. That's the one I'm thinking of. Like where you go and there's like the old outpost in Zen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's that. I really like that. Like, it's like 30 seconds. You just go there, you press a button, and then you leave. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm just, it's, it's a high point. And uh, there's also, I love the opening part, like exploring the security facility. Like, that's probably the best, like, pre. That's better than the stupid ass Half Life 10 minute tram ride that you can't do anything with. I like the, uh, the end with, like, the old section of the Black Mesa facility. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's well designed, I, I, but it's like feel, so short, and it doesn't have like any of the. I feel like most. Of, I feel like most of Blue Shift sucks, honestly. Well, I think it's good, but it sucks by comparison. If it came like, out before, cute. if it came, it came out, out before, I I probably would be less harsh on it. But the fact that it's also made by Gearbox as well, they just like you made all these cool new innovations. Why didn't you 
I'm put some of that cool shit into Blue Shift as well. I'm pretty sure well, it's because they the... wanted it on the Dreamcast. Yeah, they developed it oh, yeah, before the, the Dreamcast. Uh, was, yeah, and then Dreamcast died. They're like, oh fuck, now what are we gonna do? <laughs> like, they had finished that port and then, like, just never released it because it was like, eh, oh, nobody's buying the Dreamcast, why bother? They took, like, some of the worst parts of Half Life, I feel like. Just, there's so many Marines everywhere. Like, it's <laughs> not the. It's like that's not the peak of Half-Life combat. I think they pulled it off probably best in. Actually, I like the posing force more with the Black Ops, but. I, I thought people I think... liked the soldiers back then. Well, the AI is pretty the decent. And posing but force it's... has all sorts of new enemies among the old ones as well. All these new guns, all these new mechanics. It's great. I like posing the guns. The guns actually. It's like one of the Posing best Force's like, new guns make the Half-Life gunplay tolerable. The amount of new content in that tiny, like, it, it's big for an expansion, but like, it's so much shorter than the original Half-Life, and it's like they have all these new weapons and enemies. It's great, honestly. I, 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 could, and it came, I could gush about Opposing Force all day. It came actually, with new deathmatch maps as well. Opposing Force is actually the first one that I played. I played the base campaign first and then um oh. what did i play off I, I it was in that i played blue shift and opposing force i think That's it was opposing order. force first actually i played opposing force first oh. ah. personally i yeah. wouldn't recommend that anyone play blue, blue shift at all <laughs> unless you really like half-life yeah, yeah so. unless like you really love half-life and you don't care if the if the levels are really mediocre. I love Barney. You're just stuck in grey hallways most of the time being bored to death. If you if if you love Half-Life that much, then yeah, I, go I, play I Blue Shift. I love being Otherwise, stuck I'd in say avoid it. boring hallways. Oh shit, I forgot about that. I love the consistent environments. Just I have something about it just ugh. The way it all blends together is like a consistent place. Oh yeah, I like how there's like overlap between the games as well. Yeah, like as a kid, that stuff was just like, oh my god. How do you guys feel about the about Black Mesa? I personally fucking love it. I think it's pretty good. I I, I played it years ago when it was still just a mod and they hadn't finished it. Like, and they were nowhere near done it. I only have one complaint. Have you, have you played it since, Will? Like, have you played no. it now that it's finished? You That's should. why I don't play no. early access, to be honest. I have you one ab complaint. You absolutely should. The wait for Zen was absolutely worth it. They took it. They took Zen and they made it fun. They made it compelling. They made it beautiful. It's eye gougingly beautiful just to sit there and look at the environments. I fucking love it. My only complaint is that when you uh, jib an enemy, uh, like a human, their torso is left, but everything else just like dissipates. So you just have this nugget on the floor. Oh, shit. <laughs> I need a riveter for this it shit. It looks so jar. If you blow up a human, you're not just gonna have a blank torso just laying on the floor. It's like, I don't out. remember that. I thought uh, Black Mesa was excellent, and then I actually got to one of the later. What's, what's the alien area called? Zen. Yeah. Like, what? Zen. Um, I got to that area. No, I liked it. And there's a level where if you quick save it all, it breaks the scripting. Like in the in the final release, it breaks the scripting, and you get stuck in a room with a box, and it crushes you. And I was like, trying for like 20 minutes to get out. I looked online. They just never fixed that bug. It was like, and I just stopped there. I was like, it was the dumbest thing ever. But other just than that, it was great. Stop the level. Yeah, I'd have to go play through this really long level to get- because I was near the end, too. It's really dumb. Yeah. But it's a fantastic, uh, game. Don't get me wrong. It's almost as good as, uh, Hunt Down the Freeman. Almost, but not quite. Yeah. <laughs> My fellow Americans. This is oh, yeah, Keemstar. I always forget that Keemstar was the president. And then I was like, oh, yeah, because I remember Pyro Cynical comes in at one point. He's like, so the aliens are invading you. I'm part of the <laughs> but compromised. The aliens are coming. Oh, I want to game end myself. Oh, yeah, that was the one with all the YouTubers. <laughs> Silly. I think Keemstar, you know, that's guy that's, uh, it, you just you made the right choice there. That was the best decision they made. Like, let's make Keemstar the president. And I'm not even joking. Like, that's just hilarious. We traded God for the demons. Yeah. My fellow Americans, let's get 
ride into Scourge the Scourge of the olden times. Uh, hey, Nick Dyers. Yeah, I'm playing a few different games. I played Iron Fury earlier. I'm playing Dusk now, and I might try something else after. I don't know. I might try a hot, hot. I didn't actually realize the second episode for that was completed, so, um... I love how the YouTube stream has a better frame rate than the fucking Discord stream. <laughs> uh, I'm only streaming out. in 30 FPS on Discord. Uh, as opposed to 60 on the stream, yeah. Because I don't think you guys need it as much, and it's... I, I actually he can't do it on my server. I can't do 1080p 60 because I don't have a. I need like one more server boost or whatever. Stupid thing. Um, but you know, it's also like I'm streaming and um, secretly hates us. I'm streaming on YouTube and recording it for my own uh, records, and it, you know, it just adds up when you're doing all that stuff. So I might as well just, you know, cut the quality a bit here and there. Oh, shit. The Intoxicator! Is that a reference? I don't... Well, this will be huh? easy with this. That's just the name of the boss. No, I think it's... Is it? Fuck. No, everything has to be a reference there's... now. No, no, I think there's a reference to the movie Reanimator somewhere in this game. Or, I'm losing my marble. I mean, only you would know, Leo. I haven't seen an Reanimator. I like Reanimator. It's a, it's a fine little film about some guys trying to bring back the dead, and it it doesn't exactly work out, oddly enough. Protostar hunt down the refund. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was the name of Pyro Cynical's video on it. Pyro is Foxy the Pirate? What are you talking about? He was. That used to be his icon on uh, YouTube. I don't Foxy know what you're talking about. Pyro Cynical. He's okay, I don't know and I he don't care. A, yeah. He was a voice actor for Hunt Down the Freeman. Wow. Most popular YouTube lesbian. Oh, <laughs> That's great. true, and he's, and he's the best part of it. I, I haven't watched Fire Cynical for years and I, I forgot. He got, expo he got exposed for being uh, for role playing furry fa uh, fart fish yeah. stuff. The people tried uh, tried framing they, they him tried as, like a pedophile. They tried for being a, a, being a pedo or a groomer. It's like no, no, no yeah. So he just he, uh, yes, he came I, out about all the real shit, all the weird shit that he does. But he's like, now listen here, I'm fucked up, yes, but I'm not a pedophile. And everybody was like, okay, we believe you. If someone Wait, runs up to it, I why would you I, say that? That's Well, weird. people equate furry with being a pedophile. People equate oh. everything they don't like with being a pedophile. Oh, okay. And it kind of just makes it disingenuous when you find a real pedophile and like... It's like, hey, what? this person's a pedophile. Oh, you're just saying that. That's yeah, what they always say. Same with the QAnon people calling everything rape, so nothing's rape. Yeah. What? Oh. It's just a common problem of overusing words. Like when you call everybody you I... don't like a Nazi, and then you find to go the all third the way right, back? and you realize that you've been misusing that term your whole life. No, but they disagreed with me. Wait a minute. I guess oh, that's I a fair have... point. I didn't think of it that way. <laughs> this game has such something. a good soundtrack. Is there something I'm missing, guys? Yes, because you've been stuck in this room for like <laughs> way too long. <laughs> well, I mean, this door open and it's fucking uh, this. I hit this switch and it. Didn't wait. Did you kill the, the thing in this room? Yes. Yeah. What did you kill? Oh the what? Oh there! I did oh. not see that at all. <laughs> it's a okay. little. Jesus. There are some levels which have some pretty vague progression. There's one, like in the second episode, I think. That's I don't know how far you got to <clears throat> spoil it. Oh, yeah, I just looked at the screen. Yeah, I got stuck at this exact same point. I think this yeah. was the last level I played. I figured out how to finish it, and then I got to the next level, and I just didn't feel like it. I, I mean, at least bad. it's behind the door, so I mean, no, you no, might as well check it further. But... I made it to the the mine level where you're down in the dark mine, and I was just like, okay. It's not hard to make people not get lost in a map. Yeah. It's pretty you easy. Just you do just do the thing. Do the you thing. Just, you give them Wait, like you can one deflect projectiles go. with melee weapons? Okay. 
Yeah. Yeah. That's um. I remember. Uh, Steamworks. I think it was G G Man Lives reviewed this game, and he said like, "Oh, the fucking scythe is a useless weapon." But then like somebody else, it might have either been Civi or Mandalore, who like found out that like, "Oh, you can just deflect projectiles," and there's the compilation of them just like fucking like neoing that shit in the Matrix and like just I being a total badass. With what's that? I believe it was Mandalore. Okay. And then, yeah, G yeah, like, once yeah, again, once again, G Man proving how bad he is at his job. <laughs> I, I don't know. I think it's fair to not know that you can deflect stuff. I wouldn't have expected uh, that. Okay, as one example, yeah, but he, it's there's a. Yeah, I'm just talking about that. Can, you can write a yeah. full book on the stuff he's done and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of like the <laughs> Vietnam could, War. Snack, we could write a book about just about all the dumb things he said about Doom exclusively. <laughs> But especially, uh, oh man, Sigil. Yeah, it's the, Sigil. the, the oh, yeah. moment that I realized that Ooh, I shouldn't let the G-Man lives was when he said that the PSX Doom is, the I like, the best version. <laughs> um, <laughs> well, wait, when, for nostalgia or just, like, it's, like, objectively better? I don't remember exactly. It was a while ago. It's like, probably, okay, if you grew up on it, fine, but... He's probably, like, the biggest, like, perpetuator of the only like real men play at ultra violence but then he's like sigil's too hard guys <laughs> like, yeah game. i like the animation for this actually it just kind of flops out of frame <laughs> like that's it's like it's like weird, but like yeah, kind of funny. It good and it's satisfying, and I agree with you. But it is just like it just <laughs> walks out of frame. Like it doesn't I love even that like the, change the, the model. R button does this for everyone. It's just like there's no reloading, dummy. Like you want to just do this? <laughs> yeah, uh, the twirl button. Yeah, the twirl the twirl button definitely is like. It's so hard. Like I. It's so hard to like make something comparable to the Doom shotgun. If you twirl the pistols in an enemy's face, it hits them. So you can use it as like, like a regular uh, or super shotgun. The super shotgun. Like, I feel like very few things have come close. It's it's way more limited, but the shotgun in like the early Halo games is act is like absurd with how strong it is. And also the blood shotgun is I remember I love I love the Halo shotgun. It's, it's like it's brutal, like close range. Yeah. It'll wreck anything. <laughs> And and the um uh, ha original Halo Halo One's pistol was also pretty. Oh my okay. god, it's so but it's it's so fun to use. That, yes, I, and it, I remember. And it I'm a, not sure if they ever found out if that was like like a fuck up in development or something because it was so powerful. It's a very powerful pistol and it has a scope and everything. It's it makes great. sense that like it it, it it doesn't seem like a mistake because like the gun's massive and. Chambers like massive rounds. It looks like they were going for something that's beefy. I swear, I, I read something about someone changing a value somewhere in development and not intending it to be like. <laughs> I might be wrong. Oh, that's how Laura Croft got her. I can still remember the pistol sound in my head. That clomp. Oh yeah. Clomp, clomp, clomp. And then I, they know, made I, it I feel like the the Half Life Two pistol is more powerful. Uh... What the fuck? Where do I? Oh, I wanted to. Look at this thing. I wanted to use this. <laughs> Where are they? And then like the Half-Life 1 shotgun, I really like it, um, but it does feel very underpowered, especially on higher difficulties where you'll just like face, like, uh, like point-blank hit a Marine in the face with they double thought, barrels. They thought the feeding like, tube uh, was a second barrel. I hate the, uh, the, um, the pump action sound effect on, on Halo 1 shotgun, that <laughs> it's just, ah! <laughs> Really? Oh, I love the I shotgun it. in that game, but I don't remember it, it, that. it reminds me of, you know how some people really can't stand the sound of Velcro? That's my reaction oh. to it. Yeah. That's I mean, how I am with um, Sharpie's squeaking. Remember how you can just get behind a hunter and just one-shot them with the pistol? <laughs> I don't remember the pistol, but like, uh, it's I, so I love being able to just sneak up on any enemy, and if you hit them square in the back, they die instantly. Yeah. And you could do that with just about any enemy, including hunters, like this big giant, this Goliath thing is just covered in armor. Sneak up behind, quick snap on the back with, with, uh, with um, uh, you know, with the back of your gun, and he's dead. He's just I didn't even think I, I don't think I ever even tried meleeing them <laughs> like that. That's funny. Yeah, you sneak up, clonk. <laughs> this huge pile of muscle just drops dead. 
The portals work. He is pleased. Oh no. That's good. <laughs> I'm glad someone's happy. Cause I'm sure miserable. <laughs> uh, well, how did they all die? <laughs> what the? I shot one of them and they all exploded. Stop. No. Please. Which one of you is having a stroke? Both of us. We are one and the same. Yeah. Yep. I like Whoa. the... God damn it. When was the last time I watched the movie Akira? Because I swear to god, there's just a scene where it's just like characters like groaning for 30 oh, minutes straight. You sure you're not confusing that with an episode of Dragon Ball Z? That's just anime. I don't watch uh, Dragon Ball Z. Because that's, that's all those guys do. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Two episodes later. I really, I really like um, Akira. Okay. It's a, one of my Akira's favorite awesome. movies ever. It's mm -hmm. pretty kick ass. I, I like but, some of that's like I don't watch a lot of anime, but when I do, it's usually that kind of era. You say anime? Like, <laughs> anal -may. anime? No, no, An I swear anime. you said anime. <laughs> I don't watch anime. a lot of anime. <laughs> I said anime. You jerk. No, Y'all you you like to watch them Chinese cartoons? Yeah. I'm pretty sure, I heard anime. Do you, do you like anga and anime? Uh, yeah, like stuff like Ghost in the Shell, um, that kind of era. Ghost cool. stories. Nice. Oh yeah, '90s anime looks so fucking good. I just love that style. Like Cowboy Bebop has like just any anime from the '90s, even the shit ones. They just look amazing. Like Trigun. I remember trying to watch Trigun. I tried real hard to try and watch Trigun, and it slowed ass, but it looked great. <laughs> It looks great, but the gameplay is not great. I've tried to give anime a fair shake over the years, and like, there's been like a couple of shows I've enjoyed. It, it's, it's just like any other form of entertainment. There's good yeah. and there's bad, you know? Um, yeah. I'm not... But, I, I'm most not, of it's I'm bad. bad. I've, I've never been able to like really get invested in it for too long. The one show where I've, I've watched just about everything that's available for it is Black Lagoon. I haven't heard of that one. Look it up. Yeah, that it's one's cool. Good. I've it's seen, um, well, for movies, I've seen Akira and uh, Ghost in the Shell and probably a couple others. I've seen a, quite a few Studio Ghibli movies. I actually too. had to watch I had to watch Ghost in the Shell at university for some reason. <laughs> uh, I enjoyed it. I haven't seen yeah. Akira. I would like to, but... You know, Akira is yeah. great. That's Definitely like, watch that each, one if you... Every it's time I watch it, I like it more. Like, the first time I watched it, I was kind of like, eh, whatever, but I wanted to seem cool, so I told all my friends it was the best movie ever, even though none of them had ever heard of the movie before. And then, that, Well, uh, that's, the, that like, makes the, you cooler. Then the, the next time I watched it, I, uh, I was like, hey, wait a minute, there's something going on here. And I've seen it, like, probably seven times since eighth grade, and uh, it's like, yeah, every time it's just so much better. It was like rewatching The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly this weekend. Uh, I remember liking it, but then seeing it again for the first time in like four years, it was like, oh, wow, that's that was one of my favorite movies ever. There's this whole area. Oh, yeah, this, this, this level is very open. And I think, yeah, you need a key. A super shotgun. What? Can't call it that. In my shooter. Super shotgun. That's trademarked. You no, don't know. Own the super shotgun, man. <laughs> it's like you get off my property. You can't own property, man. I can because I'm not a smelly hippie. <laughs> Do a wow. flip. Do a flip. I uh, don't think I want to fall there. <clears throat> I can't do a Bender impression. His voice is just one of those voices. Ah, uh, three line me back. Oh, uh, well, I, I can't do any of the fucking Futurama characters. I need to Shame. test out this Good projectile. Show. There if we you go. If you were That's programmed cool. to jump off a bridge, would you do it? I'd have to take my programming. 
Yep. Yeah, because my roommate's really big into um, Rick and Morty, and I told him like you should you should watch Futurama to see how it just mops the floor with Rick and Morty in terms of like that kind of like sci-fi adult animated show. And then he watched it, and he's like, he, he fucking loved it. Yeah, Futurama's amazing. Like nothing can beat it ever. Yeah, those first like it'll, it'll be one of my favorite seasons. shows until the day I'm dead. Like, as I was telling him about Zap Brannigan, but I wasn't, like, doing the best job about it, and he was like, yeah, whatever. And then, like, he actually watched the show, and that's, like, the funniest shit ever. <laughs> Get, uh, go lower. A little lower. A lot lower. Too low! Hello, Hello. Lila. Care for some Sir. champagon? <laughs> Sir, all of the characters in the holodeck have come to life. Damn, the last time that happened, I got hit with three paternity suits. <laughs> uh, sawmill. So, Leela, the last time we met, you had sexual intercourse with a certain somebody in this courtroom. Could you please point them out? <laughs> I rest my case. Lady Mist, you're here. Do you have you played Dusk and stuff? Uh, I mean, I played it once for a half an hour, but like, I was necessarily the best mood at the time, and for some reason, I just ever went fell through. off it. Yeah, it happens. How dare you? <laughs> um. Okay. How dare you? <laughs> Where's oh there it is. Ooh, I got the the sniper rifle. This just looks oh this is a just a giant ass hunk of steel no. here. It's a good gun though. Yeah. Does One time I fell out of the tree. Eat hash, lift candle. Oh. Sleep? Oh, I got. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. There's so many little interactions. It's kind of fun. Get morale by sleeping. Oh, I hear sirens outside. Somebody got stabbed. <laughs> oh no, they found me. <laughs> or somebody was about took them so to long. I don't know how to get up to that. I got the red key. That's such like a rude way to hurt, like kill someone. Yeah, because there are there are polite ways. Yeah. Well, okay, that's way more personal and traumatic than getting shot. Hey, knife world! He called me Sand Edge. <laughs> Great timing. Called me Sand Edge and said, "Glad to see me playing Dusk." Yeah, I'm glad to be back on it because I. Uh, and sort of got through half of, half of it and kind of and wedged on at you. Oh, you've been playing yeah. Lost Civilization. Uh, did I sway you on that? I hope you've been enjoying it. Uh, Doom guy, I just saw you're going to sleep. I'll see you later. Thanks for checking this out. Okay. River Valley took you an hour and forty minutes. Wow, I. Yeah, I thought I explored a lot of that level and that took me about an hour, but I guess you just you just absolutely went crazy there. It's worth it. It's an amazing level. You, yeah, you, you went completely insane. They should uh, really... They should commit you. It's disturbing. <laughs> uh, I, I mean, yeah, my favorite map is definitely River, River Valley. Uh, you were looking for the red skull for like 30 minutes. Was that the uh, was that an optional key? I think it there's a lot of optional stuff in it, but like it's totally worth checking it out cuz there's so much cool stuff to look at. But how's the gameplay? Great. Okay. That's the then thing. That's, uh... Is like you did yeah, you'd expect it to get old, but like for me, I actually thought the combat was good. Like it keeps you on your toes like um, I think some people might not like some of the hit scan stuff, but it forces you to, you know, be aware of your surroundings and take cover from hit scanner like ambushes uh, and you know Doom's people not talk. A cover based shooter. <laughs> Run and gun shooter. I hate when people say that. 
Yeah, like uh, like so, you can still you can still play like an intelligent person and like, duck behind something and use the cover. Hello. With, if you're playing without ducking behind like cover to avoid hit scans, you're doing it wrong. Well, how do you like arch vial? Crystals of madness. Now what? What the hell's this? Yeah, th you throw that at an enemy and it'll start infighting immediately with a different enemy. I see. And, and it's not just like you have giant open spaces all the time where you're just dodging projectiles there you can use your environment to block stuff off quite often oh that's right basically the infighting crystal <laughs> that's so funny what do they call it? it it's meth oh i have it's to get meth. back up there to get to the yellow though damn crystals of madness are really good you love the optional stuff in lost Zoo. yeah i mean like some of the levels, I almost thought it would be, I'm sure speedrunners have already optimized it, but there's like, probably some, cr like, very, you can get through some of those levels probably super quick. But why would you want to? Oh yeah, the uh, speedrunners would have ball with this game because of the way you can, uh, the bunny hopping, you know, it's just oh, like in this. Yeah. Bunny hopping is a lot of fun, even though I suck at it. <laughs> I liked it in Painkiller back in the day. Oh shit! Ah, uh, you dropped the crystal. Yeah, I didn't know it was falling down there. I don't know, the, the, these ladies are pretty weak. <laughs> they go. weren't human! Uh oh, the mine that Wilster stopped playing at. Yeah, this is uh, the last uh -oh. level I touched. Uh oh. Well, I made it through this when I played it, but... There's a cutting mm. line. Oh. <sighs> okay. Um, the cutty mine. No turning back. I do like the... Uh, I think the first time I played this, I did not have the retro palette, and I don't think I had any jaggies. I think I like this look a bit more. Okay, guys. I gotta go. I got some work to do. Thanks for hanging out, Bio. We'll see you all later. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Anyway, anyway, back to movie, Bob. Did you know? I didn't know. Back to what? Movie, Bob. Battle Maniac. That's the, the... pro eugenics uh, Mario oh. head. Seven. This almost looks like one of those. Well, okay, no. It almost looks like one of those anti tank rifles from World War II that just. I didn't actually know how those worked, and then I saw a video where it's just like a giant, like, bolt action rifle that's so big, the bullet penetrates a tank and, like, splits apart and just rattles around and, like, shreds everybody inside. <laughs> like. It's just a giant ass bolt action rifle Operating that you have to lay on the ground. It's a fucking nightmare. Like, you'd think you're in a tank, you're safe. No, you're not. It's one of the most miserable places on Earth. I would be so claustrophobic in one of those. And like... I'm fortunate enough, I'm too tall. So if I was ever drafted, there was no <laughs> way in hell I'd be doing tank duty. I feel like the tank people, like, that's like a. You have to be. You almost have to, like, want to go into that. Cause like if you if your tank gets like fucking bombed, you're gonna burn to death inside of that thing. It mm -hmm. it also depends on what tank, cause like obviously the American like Shermans kind of blew up real easy. Like if you were in a nice German Tiger or something, that you might feel a little bit safer. But particularly if you were in Berlin with that thing right at the end of the war, you'd feel pretty uh, safe. I'm pretty sure no. America has pretty well built tanks. The Shermans were did not, the the Americans basically had like way more. Tanks and the Germans well, kind of took wait, a World okay, War II. I, meant, I mean, okay, I was gonna say like Abrams a pretty good tank, but yeah. The, Sh the Shermans like you basically you needed several Shermans to take on like you know one of the heavy German tanks. Well, but... early tanks weren't. Well, world, especially World War One, like early, really early tank designs were fucking garbage. Oh, World War One was fucked. Yeah, World War Two was. <laughs> yeah, that was just a tin in. sardine oh, can rolling cool. down. The same with the airplanes of World War One. They were pretty shit back then, where it's like you just got this shitty like wooden thing that's gonna like fall apart at any second. I mean, that was literally someone hand dropping like a bomb from their plane. 
<laughs> well, like... it used to be like before they mounted uh, machine guns onto the plane itself, they would just take their handguns out and try to shoot the other pilot <laughs> mid-flight, and it worked sometimes. They and actually, like, yeah. They put a, like the first machine gun mounted uh, plane, the guy put it on the front and then realized we're just putting holes in the propeller constantly, so you like put this uh you just put on like really heavy propellers that are like super durable and you'd just be blasting your own propeller constantly and he got <laughs> shot down behind enemy lines and he's like oh shit i gotta burn my plane before they see my genius design but they took one look at it and like this is worthless and they, yeah, they somehow to figured out how to they made something that like timed the shots in between propellers yeah, which no, it's, is pretty it's a cool. gear so that it, it yeah. knows so it, it can't fire if it's not it only shoots between propeller blades Probably the worst war you could be stuck in. World yeah, I remember one. the World War One yeah. planes for a while was mainly like reconnaissance and like shooting at each other, I guess. But wasn't that effective on the ground for most? They're also. And then they started been... using them to like drop shit, like gas bombs and stuff. Even on the ground, it wasn't great because like uh, there hasn't been any like like large hill conflicts but... for a while, so they weren't really set up with the use of like understanding of like how warfare worked properly. Because, like, back in the old days when you had muskets and stuff, you just kind of stand there and shoot at each other. Um, yeah, trench warfare was a nightmare. Cause yeah, because, like, like... You'd get sick and die horribly. War used to be, like, more honorable in how, like, it was, like, fun. And then now it's, like, over, we're just gassing everyone. And, like, the shell shock's just, like, not only just giving you PTSD, but actually, like, the concussive force, like, giving you brain damage. But yeah, it used to be you got into a giant field, you had one army line up on the other side, and you waited until the other army lined up on the other side, and then you did battle. But then it's like, no, we're just gonna spend three months digging a trench so that we can, like, pick you off one by one. And there's, like, still areas of France that you can't go to. They call it the Zone Rouge, the Red what? Zone, because there's just, like, undetonated yeah. ordnance, there's leftover arsenic in the soil. It's just toxic, and you can't go there. They like, still it's just pull out, like... Hundreds of thousands of ordnance just like every yeah, year. The iron harvest. Yeah. And it's like it's more like the the effects of World War One have lasted longer than the nukes of World War Two. Like you can go to Hiroshima now. You can't go to certain areas of France to this day. Singular nukes aren't that bad for the environment. It's bad for people, but <laughs> Random well, question like, says Protostar, what's your favorite mo Doom mod other than Brutal Doom or Project Brutality? I like how they say other than. I like, like them all. That's definitely my favorite one, but other than that. I, I like them all. <laughs> yeah. I honestly don't. It's like Supercharge is a great mod. Anti Mortem use. That's what's kind of like a, in my opinion, a more tasteful Brutal Doom, but I don't really play. I like the classic gameplay. So I'm not like the right person to yeah. ask. And Wilster just likes them all, you know. Gotta, gotta like them all. <laughs> He's the Ash Ketchum move. Yeah. Check this out. Woohoohoo! What's funny is, like, they can't actually hit me in front of me, because they're just, I'm just gonna bounce it right back. It's pretty fun. <laughs> the physics. Oh! Oh shit, I don't have... Are these supposed to also be... These almost look like scarecrows too, but they put on a dress? Not really sure. Uh... Your... Protostar says yours is probably Doom, but Free Roam? What's that? That What's that refer to? Is that like... Is that like Doom One, like all it all in one map, something like that, or? Hideous Destructor is a good mod. Yeah, you like that one. Yeah, it's um, pretty good. I haven't played many Doom mods. The only ones I played are Supercharged because of Annie Mortem, Brutal Doom because yeah, and then I also played the Moon Man mod. That's it. Yeah, I don't really have any favorites because I. Still like the classic gameplay more than anything else. Uh, I'm really impressed with the uh, fork of GZ Doom RPG. Um, that has a bunch of ton of features that basically turn the game into a looter shooter. It's very unlike Doom, but it's so many features. <laughs> that. 
track door opens. I think this lack of an auto map is probably what is unfortunate for this game and people getting stuck. Well, you can compensate by changing your map design. Yeah, I don't think they did. You can compensate no, for they things. It's like the track door opens. What does that mean? It means that well, the trap door is opened up. Track door. Oh, track door. Well, I don't fucking know. I guess it's it's, it's on the track, but I I just went down the track. And I didn't see it. So you have to drive the track tour into town. Oh. It's gonna be one of those days. Uh, oh, he just posted uh, what free free roam do explore the worlds of Doom like never before. Instead of having a level switch to the next, you can instead wander the terrain of the area you are on itself. You can go into different levels in different ways, not always from the beginning. Travel through secret tunnels, buy items and weapons, and battle monsters not normally in the beginning. Is it? But is it all based on like Doom One? Or um, that does sound cool, I guess. Played a lot I of guess. Doom 1. Doom 1 is way more tolerable than Doom. Yeah, if we're talking about playing through all of it, yeah, I agree. Doom 2. Vanilla uh, map wise. <laughs> it's just, I don't know. Even most of the good Doom 2 levels, like relatively, just feel like filler to me. There's very few that are actually, like, good. Well, sir, I'm starting to see why you quit at this level. The track yeah. door open. But yeah, it's I remember not... thinking, you know, I I have tunnel vision. Um... The track door open, but it's not the one that's marked as the <laughs> yellow door because that's like a that's like a hey, we subverted your expectations. But that automatically makes it good. Just keep taking a lap. Oh, oh, oh! It's he. Oh, oh! That's it's literally the end of the level. Oh come on! Don't do that. Mm. What? How is this the track door? When you say track door, it sounds like on a on a railroad track. Come on. It's all of Doom 1, Doom 2, and No Rest for the Living. Huh. Huh. Oh. Wait, Sandwich, do your Kermit the Frog impression. I don't really have a good one. Okay, yes, do your do, Jordan do Peterson impression then. Do your Kermit uh, the Frog hi. hi, I'm Kermit the Frog. Oh, uh, Miss Piggy, I really wish you wouldn't uh, force you yourself the on me. Let's... Miss Piggy, you stupid slut. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Piggy, uh, you're not really respecting the restraining order. Uh... And I don't respect. I feel women, like so... I feel like uh, it's kind of a Ray Romano, like her. Hi. Hey, it's me, Ray Romano. Everybody hates That's me. That's the brother, including myself. That's not. That's his brother. Uh, hey, it's uh, me, Ray Romano, brother. Yeah. Um, I'll I like how the I... picture is just like the woods with a cabin. <laughs> I would. It would be cool if I could. I think there's. It's just going to be E1 M8, just classic style. Uh, so uh, maybe I'll finish this first episode, and then maybe try out another. Like Hexen? Nope. Hexen's Seven pretty portal? good this time of year. What? Mm -hmm. hey. Oh, I should try out this sucker. <laughs> it's so funny how this just flops around when you're like zoomed in. I don't know about how floppy it is. It's extreme. I give this a floppy 5 out of 7. I like flopping. <laughs> I'm not picking up any shotgun ammo. Why not? I don't know. I'd like Shotgun some. ammo is good for you. There's some. What the fuck? What is this? Oh, this is a nice little sniper perch here. Oh, that guy was riding the jump pad. Some good tracks in this. I don't know if you can hear it this, this well, but um, yeah, it's pretty good. I like the soundtrack for this game. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, just wood everywhere. At least in comparison to most games, which are disappointing. What's that? Uh, what in about terms of like then? game soundtracks, I'm I'm pretty picky. I mo with most games, I just play with my own music playing in the background. I just mute the game soundtrack. There are oh, the very crossbow. few exceptions. Half Life had a great soundtrack. I don't play with the soundtrack on because it only comes in like every now and then. Yeah, it's nice that they they, they like, put the whatever. enemies in a row there to to get you to but test it's got, like, that. But it's got like a nice piercing. industrial feel. I don't know, the tracks are fine. I like some of them. I, uh, some of them I find not good. Are you talking about this or something else? I like Half Lambda Life. Core. Half Life. It's a good one. I like the... the or whatever. The... I'm pretty sure it's Lambda Core. Is it? Okay. It's, the, That's it's probably um, the most like intense one. That Doom Free Roam sounds interesting, uh, Protostar Thanks. I might actually take a gander at that sometime. I'll take a gander. I like I'll a take gander. A gander. Take a yeah. gander. And it's gander. I mean, I, I'm honestly probably not usually that interested in like, hey, we remixed the Doom 1 and Doom 2 levels that you've played 5,000 And on. yet, what do you? what is your first stop shop when you have the 3D models installed? The... The original game, yeah. So, in terms of showing was, off voxels, sure. No, no, no. Well, with the shitty cursed 3D ones, you went into the remixes of the level. Yeah. Because I don't so want to play legit levels with it, you know. I was buying pasta recently, mm -hmm. and then in the pasta aisle, I saw it, there. There was this woman talking to this other woman, and then she's like, "Pasta made with chickpeas." This must be so vegans can eat it. Wait, where does she think wheat comes from? A fucking cow? <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> Gluten is actually extracted from hedgehogs. And they were so made. It's such a disgusting comment to make. Yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> sorry, sorry, I can eat pasta. I'm a, I'm a vegan. <laughs> But I can eat chicken eggs. <laughs> well, Wonkles, it depends on your interpretation of what it means. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, yeah, that's. I didn't that's know you it. could break these. What? Somehow I never actually tried throwing those crates. I don't know why. Ooh. Seems like the type of person I'd call a pop tart a sandwich. That's stupid. Wait, what'd you say? Seems like the kind of person that would call a pop tart a sandwich. Pop tart. Oh, these guys sandwich. are purple. What the hell? Have you seen the what sandwich alignment chart? If you have two of them and you put some like peanut butter in between, then no. Have you? No. Have I what? Seen the sandwich alignment chart? Oh, it's like the D and D like alignment thing with sandwich. I think you posted that. I probably um, have. I don't believe I've seen it. I'll, I'll post it. Yeah, because it's like hot dog. It's like chaotic evil or something. Quaff beer. Oh, yeah, I have the crossbow. Hardline traditionalist. The BLT is a sandwich. Structural purist, ingredient neutral. God, this is a lot of words. <laughs> yeah, it's very scientific. Oh, that's a few too many words for me there. Oh boy. Oh boy. The chicken wrap is a sandwich. Disagree. Ice cream between waffles is a sandwich. A hot dog. Why are you reading it that way? A hot dog. A hot dog is a sandwich. You're basically reading it like the fucking girl in My Cousin Vinny who has the most elaborate, like, stupid New York accent. Like, the, the car has pause attraction. It had to be a car with pause attraction on it. Like a Brooklyn Jew guy. It's a hot dog. 
A hot dog is a sandwich if you're chaotic neutral. <laughs> uh, Dark Pulse says, who wants me to be in their house in 90 minutes? Uh, any Me. votes out there? Me. <laughs> My celium says gluten is stored in the balls. <laughs> Girls have to pee more often because they do not have balls to store the pee in. Uh, there's the blue door. Hey, wait a minute. I played this level. Oh, you made it past the mines then. You slide off. I guess. Look at me go. Orange Joe. Who the fuck's I'm Orange so Joe, good. by the way? I'm just old Orange Joe over here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm right, buddy. Really in the day. Okay. I'm Orange Joe. <laughs> yeah, that's what they call me. Oh shit. Orange Joe. Because <laughs> I'm Joe, and I'm Orange. Uh-huh. That's what they call me Orange Joe. My, my hair's not orange. It's just me. Is this, is this the joke? <laughs> I'm orange. Yeah. And I'm Joe. Okay. Caller, uh, can you turn your uh, volume down so I can't hear you? Thanks. My, my hair used to be brown. It was never orange. Orange Joe, Celium. Hi, my Celium, by the way. Uh, I don't know if you've commented yet. Uh, orange Joe's the man who skews the daily amount of oranges that are eaten daily by humans because he eats 10,000 oranges a day. That's not true. Statisticians orange hate Joe. him. Orange people Joe. look at me. They look at me and they say that's orange. They Joe. had to. They Wonder had to switch it. to median origins per day just because of Orange Joe. Why do they call him Orange Joe? Did his hair used to be orange? Nope, it was brown and now it's gray. I'm just orange. Is Joe. this a guy on the internet? Nope, it's just the Orange Joe. Uh huh. Appears to be a cult leader. <laughs> really? <laughs> All right. Kinda just looks like a kid with spiked up hair. Uh, I used to, uh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, you used to look like that. No, I no, used to never so mind. No, 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 no. I used to be a cult leader I, that looked like that. No, I never looked like that. But I did try to start a cult. But um, what I was gonna say was something oh, else that I'm not gonna say. I just hurt myself today to see if I could still feel. And Can I do. You? Yeah. No, then you need to hurt yourself more. Oh. Just to keep making sure. I fucked you like an animal to see if I could still feel. But you're mixing them up. That's not. <laughs> oh, great. I hurt myself today to feel you from the inside. The first day no, that I. I don't know why, but like on the radio, like that's. Closer is like the one song they would usually pick, and they have to yeah. censor like every like five seconds. <laughs> it, it, yeah, it, it it's weird it. to have that be one of your more mainstream popular I just, songs. I just drank the fucking lotion that was supposed to go on the skin. Like, it's not a bad song, but it like, said no I, hose. I know, it's 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 better like choices it. for the radio, yeah. I seem to remember uh, Trent Reznor himself being like, That's the single? Okay, people like this is the one. <laughs> it's catchy, you know, you can. It's got some good, uh, good, good uh, music in it, you know. I was never into it much, to be honest, because it's a little different. I like but I guess that's yeah, why it's a single. Right. Yeah, we I'm know you don't have much taste in music. <laughs> what? What is that, Lady Mist? Hey, that's what you're listening to. Today. You don't have a broad taste in music. Uh, no, and I don't claim to. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, well, yeah. You're gonna release a single off of the downward spiral. Which song do you pick? Uh, Do you pick the one that's in like 15, 3 quarters, 16 time, or... Piggy? <laughs> uh, I don't know not, why. I, no, you know what? I haven't one. looked at that album in a long time. I'd have to think about that. I know that album fronts back. It opens with Mr. Self-Destruct, and then it goes into Piggy, and then it goes into Heresy, and then I'm pretty sure it's March of the Pigs after that. Heresy. Um, I can't remember. That's uh, God is Dead and No One Cares. Oh, it's yeah. That could be a single, there. don't you think? Just him screaming, God is dead. In Maybe the in the States that wouldn't go so far. Yeah. So you gotta, you gotta pick a Fuck single you like an animal is much, <clears throat> much more palatable, which says something. <clears throat> well, it's not anti-religious, you know. I know, which is kind of funny. <laughs> um, 
Nothing wrong with having sex. Mr. Self Destruct is an awesome opener. It is a very nice song. I quite enjoy it. I like the uh, becoming. I like the becoming the good. Screaming. Um, Reptile is pretty the, cool. I think. Reptile, yeah. There's a lot of really good songs on there, but like, if you're gonna pick a single, like, it can't be Reptile because it's like too slow and like methodical. Yeah. Like closer is just that much catchier, and it's got like that perfect. It's in 90 BPM, just like that perfect. Just see you, Proto Star. Yeah, I mean, I, I think they, there's a reason why it is, but it's just kind of like, uh... like your alternative. Like, there's not a whole lot else for alternatives. Although the song "I Do Not Want This," I hate that song. Man with a gun. Is that where man with gun? Big man with big a, man with where, a gun. Is that where man with gun got his? <laughs> That's such a weird like just. I think he said he was making fun of, like, the whole, like... Did he say he was making fun of the alternative or, like, the rap scene of, like, the way they were talking? Well, it was a play on the rap music scene, but then it was also... I don't know. It was, like, the lyrics have, like, their own meaning. It's not about the government. But a lot of people interpret it to be about the government. That's not the purpose of that song. Oh, is this a boss fight? Oh, yeah. The Duke Brothers! Them Duke brothers have gotten themselves into a pickle this time, folks. However, I have a Riveter, which is... a secret weapon that probably trivializes this a fair amount. Nah, it's still early in the game. It fits. I wonder if I can... Them Duke boys have gotten themselves in a real mix this time. They're fucking dead. Is this a puzzle? Or, you know, we could release a it. warm place as a single. That would go over <laughs> great. I mean, it's not good Eraser. for the stream, but I really want to look. Eraserhead's awesome, but again, not single. Unless they do, like, a, some sort of single head, edit. Eraser. If they do a single edit and, like, remove the entire intro of some of those songs, maybe. Um, downward, Spiral. Eraserhead is the David Lynch movie. The song is just Eraser. Eraser, uh, the becoming ruiner. I'd have to probably listen to some of these to like remember. Wait, fucking, I know. Oh, obviously, hurt is the other <laughs> single that makes complete sense. I guess. Uh, yeah, I forgot that hurt was also, I believe, was a single. It's the closer. That is yeah. another one that is on the radio. Yeah, that one's actually. I. But also, uh, I, I think part of the reason they still play that is because of the Johnny Cash. Um, cover, so it's like, yeah, people know that song because Johnny Cash fans know that song, Nine Inch Nails fans know that song. You bet your ass they're going to be playing on on the radio. Oh, so this is E1M8. Okay, so the bot, we're through the gate. Probably uh, get through this first episode and maybe try a different boomer shooter. What do you, how do you guys feel about that term? Because, like, I used it kind of tongue-in-cheek. Like, it's super dumb, but kind of hilarious. It makes sense, and it, it, it exactly encapsulates what the kind of game that we're playing. It's a boomer shooter. Like, yeah, it's an old-school FPS game. Uh, in, the, in the sense of, like, I guess boomer just means anything not young now? Yeah, no, it, it does not literally refer to people born in the 40s, but, uh, you know... Okay, no, I, I mean, I find that usage kind of really dumb but kind of well, funny it's it's about what sounds good so like it, it sure it's like the have, game like, a catchphrase doesn't have to make sense in, i'm like, so surprised that you you the guys the correctos the, the well the games literally go boom so you call them a boomer shooter the, they just boom. the way you guys they correct boom, phrases boom. and stuff you're like nah boomer shooter's fine well that's just how that works for like organizations and stuff it like, is how language like, works, but you guys like, sometimes have a bone to pick with the language. It's not seems. really like saving off of the a cap thing. It's not like oh, they're all literally the worst people ever. It's a uh, systemic issue, rather than yeah, it's about what sounds good and what like gets gets people's attention. It's not necessarily what logic. Nobody makes knows sense what it means. It's what yeah. gets the people going. Actually, you know, uh, that that is how. It the my my grandpa is like the literal definition of a boomer. He was born in 1945, and he has 11 siblings. <laughs> Do a flip. I mean, a lot of people's parents. I mean, were my parents are boomers. 
It looked like you were trying to like launch rocks to like smash them in the face with that gun. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's the way it flops around is pretty. No, 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 because you were shooting the. You accidentally hit one of the rocks and it like flew towards oh. one. I'm gonna stone these guys to death. That's what I. It. I thought you were doing it on purpose for a second, where you're trying to like smash rocks into their face with a gun. Oh shit. I don't want to waste it on that. You know, it's funny. I think Doom has destroyed my brain for a split second. I thought, oh, I don't know if I can jump on that building because I might collide with those guys on the ground. <laughs> they should turn that on as an option. You have the option to make all the enemies infinitely tall. Infinitely <laughs> tall? <laughs> I, are there any boomer shooters that have actually gone that far? I don't think so. It'd be hilarious. Probably one or two. Yeah, five or ten. <laughs> I don't think any have done that because it's most there's people absolutely be, hate the, that. Most people the hate amount that. of boomer shooters. There's got to be one that's like infinitely tall monsters. <laughs> Fuck you. Get paid. Oh yeah, if you if you include, include like all the trash on Steam, yeah, probably. There's, no there's like a, there's a billion retro shooters that I you know you've never heard of. Hunt down the Freeman does that. Little known fact. Yeah, Wait. infinitely tall monsters for sure. Uh, hello. Trust me, old orange Joe. <laughs> I found the the brain sword. I, what's funny I like... about orange Joe okay, to you? So I like. Hey, Electro Pirate, what's up? My IQ is now you... infinitely tall. Why do you make jokes that you know I'm gonna laugh at that are stupid and then like interrogate me over it? That's just part of the I joke don't... at this point. Uh, I'd be like when I say I'm Orange Joe and I put on a stupid voice, I don't think anybody's gonna laugh. I have zero expectation of laughter, but then some some child laughs and I'm like, what is this? I, I don't wow. have a call you a child. I have... I mean, you should probably just like get a new mic because you would actually sound normal. He has a mic. He doesn't use it. Yeah, I have my reason. Jerk. Purposely makes my stream sound like shit. <laughs> it sounds good. It. I actually do prefer it. I'm just. Yeah. Oh, you know you what? I probably get like, used to the other mic. You're all like, who the fuck is that? Yeah. Vicelium <laughs> says he doesn't like how uh, boomer shooters are often Wolfenstein clones with the uh, hard ons for 90 degree angles. Like, I. The one I played, um. There's one I played that was. Actually, you know what? There's a few I've played. Uh, especially the roguelike ones because, you know, they're procedural. It's a lot easier to just do 90 degree angles, and it's just kind of like, yeah, you kind of didn't learn what Doom, like, fucking learned. What well, depends Ooh. on which one it is. Nightmare Reaper is pretty good. I played a bit of that one. It's interesting. Not, I'm not really into roguelikes anymore. I played too many of them. Wait. Oh, that's the yellow key. A lot of them are very uh, annoying. It's it's the fact that they, the like, I played so many, but usually they, they involve a lot of commitment and mastery of the game to figure it out and, you know, a lot that of painful like... deaths. That's the entire purpose, and it's fun. Yeah. For a point, and now I'm just like, put me in the map and let me fucking get to the action and save and, you know. I mean, it depends on, like... <sighs> you don't have to, like, win to have fun in those. It's usually, like, the way that, um... Like, okay, so much mom, you it, don't like... have to win to have fun. <laughs> well, Son, like, it's just about like, trying your best. If you go with, like, traditional roguelikes, like, say, like, NetHack, for example, like, it's a game that, like, most people that play it, even that play it regularly, are never going to beat it, because it pretty much, by design, filters out anyone that wouldn't know how to beat the game in exact, like, the right way, by just presenting challenges that will kill you. If you don't know how to get around it. Yeah, and I never like, liked those traditional roguelikes but either. But NetHack is like the worst example of that in terms of like how excessive it is. So you'll have people that have like played it for like over a decade. <laughs> don't have then, time to play with myself. And then they just oh, never end up uh, eating it. Where that's like the ultimate like goal you can kind of have towards it. So you can still have fun playing the game without 
the intention of beating it. It's kind of like just doing better than you did before. Absolutely, I yeah, but I, I personally like. I mean, where I am now, I just, I just like being able to beat stuff. It also depends yeah, like, on like. Uh, I don't, I don't like when they have meta progression in um, roguelites, where like you start out with like no way you can win, and then every time you yeah. die, you still like, get upgrades. That I thought that was like sort it. of. I mean, it's kind of a fuzzy definition, but rogue light is sort of. I feel like meta progression is sort of like a key part of that. Yeah. And yeah, and if so, if you don't like that, then the whole roguelite, roguelite kind of um, renaissance probably you won't enjoy a lot of it, I guess. I like the traditional ones more, just because they're they're mean. Did I you do try like the Jupiter to Hell? Isaac. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. I, uh, um, same thing with that, I got to the final boss twice, got so close, died, and I was like, I really don't feel like playing but through it again. At the same time, though, that's, one good thing about that is it's pretty short and easy to pick up, so it's not like something you need to dedicate to, you can just kind of pick it up and play it. Was I supposed to jump over that? Um, I said it opened somewhere else. I don't know. I really like the, uh... uh Oh, I really like the Binding of Isaac, but one of the it has so many issues with that game. Like oh, I played a ton of that. I actually loved that for quite I have, a while. Yeah, the, I don't like how you need to like basically no life the game to unlock <laughs> all these fun items. As someone that's done it. Yeah. Yeah, I remember getting quite a bit of playtime in that one. I have well over a thousand hours. Yeah. I don't like. Um, for the only game I have over a thousand hours is probably Doom. Oh, uh, I like even I have no idea how long I've played Doom, but it's probably a fair amount over that by now. <clears throat> but including no, like all the, mods the and stuff. Most, like the second most played game I've had, uh, because this is just I guess I don't know how long I've played Guitar Hero. I've probably played Guitar Hero for over a thousand hours, but uh. Um, okay. like for my Steam library, the most played I have a game is like less than a thousand hours. I don't have access oh, to my stats hell? anymore because I did it on console. Uh, back when like Rainbow Six Siege first came out, like all of my friends were like really into it. So we played it like almost every day and I ended up getting like 1,600 hours into it. Um, I don't know easy. if you're supposed to be able to jump over this way or if I've... Is there just a switch in here? Probably not. It doesn't look like it jumps but far. Anyways, Snacks, you brought up a game where, like, people play it without the express intent of Oh, that! It that looked like that's a texture! I, I know, it, right? That's what the you treat Jagger Fall? That looked that's like a fucking texture! Well, right. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'll start a new save and I'll, like, do something, and every time I play that game, I wind up doing something different in it. Or it's like this time I'm gonna join the the mages. No, I, I've never joined the mages actually. I don't know how to <laughs> I do I'll be not, honest, I've never joined those pieces of shit. I do not understand the magic system in that game. I don't know how to cast the spell, and I've been playing period. for like ten years. <laughs> like it's so weird. You have to like load the spell, and then you have to like do this other bullshit, and then it's like sub. Like I. I had a shirt that shot fireballs, and I knew how to use that. that hey, my Sally, I'm see you later. They said they're gonna try to beat Ev Eternity Map 19 without saves. I've never actually played Ev Eternity. That might be something to check out someday. It's what got me to start mapping. Uh, maybe I should check it out then. Dark Pulse. I probably says I probably got four to five thousand hours on uh, Unreal Tournament 99. Hmm. Dude, you're oh, playing uh, Dusk. Uh, no, Debag, what's up? I'm Play playing Dusk. Dusk. Yeah, was it? Did you not know? I, it's a boomer no? shooter stream, dude. I, I had it in the title. I saw you playing Icon Fury earlier, or I mean Ion Fury, and yeah. I was just like, holy shit. Yeah, I moved on to this, and because uh, I, I dropped out halfway through this game at some point. Oh shit! It's the fucking okay, Half Life so Marines. My you're ass episode, is you're on, you're on episode two. No, uh, I'm on E1M8 where it kind of transitions into it, I guess. You yeah. kill those guys, they go, oh. <laughs> Why is it just <laughs> Professor Snape in that video? I don't know. Listen. Shoot him without jibbing him. All right. He dies, he goes, oh. Oh, there's the Riveter. Wait, um, Dubeg, you watched Airplane for the first time ever a couple of months ago, right? 
not the oh first no, that's time not ever. the Riveter. Yeah, this but, is the oh, grenade okay. launcher but mortar. Do you remember the part near the end where like the plane's coming into the airstrip and it's like, how much longer is it gonna be? And a guy opens up a microwave and there's a chicken inside and then he says about five more minutes. Yeah. <laughs> that actor, that's Mike from Breaking Bad. What? It is. Yep, it is. It sure is. Jonathan I didn't know if Banks. you knew that. Right. Jonathan Banks. Yep. He was he's he's been around for a while. There's a lot of actors in modern oh, television shit. that you wouldn't know were have been around just doing things forever and you're just like, wow, oh, okay. Imagine. Oh, it's a whole infighting fest. I'm guessing yeah, the pre programmed I guess. Yeah. This is cool though. I just got back from the new Louis C. K special and it was eh. Oh yeah. It was okay. I mean it wasn't bad, but I mean it was definitely better than his last one, but it's called Sorry. Sarg? Sorry. Sorry. Oh, well, uh, gee, I wonder why. No, he already addressed that in the last special. Oh, what, what was that one called? I'm really sorry. <laughs> uh, sincerely, Louie. Oh, dear. Yeah, I don't he know if I feel like watching it anymore, to be honest, but, you know. I mean... He was funny he... when I when I remembered him. That special, he opened up going, so, uh, before he even told any jokes, he goes, did anybody else get in, like, huge amounts of egregious trouble this year? <laughs> uh, not me, but I think someone did, Louis. Uh... Yeah. I like when he started, I think it was live at Beacon Theater, he started the specials. Like, there's a lot of people in this audience tonight, like, enough people that I think I could safely say that not all of you are going to make it to Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody here is just gonna fucking ruin the holidays for their family. Wow. Somebody here is gonna die on the way home. I think he said that too. <laughs> Holy shit! That's he was always funny like that though. Like he was he was always good at going right up to that line and just like kind of not crossing I mean, it. And uh... it I, I am a firm believer that oh, you that can joke about absolutely anything. It's all on how you approach it and you know how you tell the joke. Yeah, because well, with places, that joke, you know, you're not targeting anyone specifically. That just said, at, like you're gonna ruin. No, it's like it's just one this of just you. said you're, this place is there. doomed. By the way, get it? No. <laughs> but I uh, exactly. It's like you know. It's like. Uh, yeah, man. I mean, right, it's, like, it's, it's the same thing about... as saying. What? <clears throat> well, he was talking about, it's like, yeah, there have been some, like, really fucked up babies born. There's been, like, babies born that are, like, attached at the face <laughs> to a dog. There have been, like, Chinese babies. <laughs> yeah. Oh <my> God. <laughs> he says that, and then he's like, okay, I think I just said the worst thing I'm ever going to say in my entire life. That feels kind of good, knowing I got that off my chest. That's the worst. I'm never going to go lower than that. I like this. This feels like a clip art of like sickles just like dude it pisses I, me off the sickles are different it pisses me off like they, they really? uh, it's my ocd seems close. Seems no close one's like to me. one's like no the handles okay oh, well, yeah. not everyone can afford a nice pair of sickles okay? matching sickles well, yeah I'm sorry i i, I can't I, go I to jc penny and find two matching sickles uh now i know you like this a lot to but i was planning to stop after beating episode one wow that's okay I mean, with you. Episode one's like my favorite episode, so that's fine. <laughs> um, I, you guy. know, I was, I was gonna join the the local farm there, but and I said you need to bring some sickles, but I wait made a minute. I, I, this is shoot, episode one. The... This is episode one, map nine. Can you shoot him in the back of the head before you? Okay. No, this, this is, is still final... episode one. I thought it was. Okay, well, please it's just the shoot final him in the map. Back of the head, please. The final How do you map want me to get him? One. Just, just like this. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you just walk up to him and say, oh, excuse me, sir, can you move? Or do that. I, I didn't expect him to fly that way. Just think about what his God. last thoughts might be. You gotta solve every problem with violence? Yes. Yes. You could've just asked him to move. You could've said, excuse me, sir. I, I, I got did it. I basically did that. That's how you ask people- that's how you politely ask people to move in America. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help it. <laughs> that's, that's, that's fucked up, but it's funny. <laughs> I couldn't help it. That's a Louis C.K. joke right there. You got me in the mood for that, I guess. Uh, hey, man. 
I get it. I was close recently when someone tried to aggressively hitchhike to me. Hey, let's lower the uh, let's lower the round count in our magazine so you can only kill eight people instead oh, of Oh, I'm intoxicated. Oh shit, I forgot you could do that. I'm kind of drunk here, guys. Yeah, the one I own is not legal in a lot of states because it holds 13 rounds. Oh shit, oh, this so you is, can only uh... kill 13 people. That sucks. That is... <laughs> you know how you can reload, though. That makes the whole country <laughs> safe right there. Yeah, really. The, the whole story I have has an extra one, so... Wait a minute. 26. I, is there something... <laughs> Why do you need 20 guns? Because I can't reload any of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look what happens when I try to reload. It just twirls the gun. I need more. <laughs> what is even that about? Like, I think that's an attack. What, just the twirling gun? Wait, what is it? <laughs> I didn't even know yeah, this yeah. one. <laughs> you could do that with every weapon, too, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Go I somehow did not try it with these. <laughs> I, th I, I got the sword. Have you smoked a cigar yet? No. You press Q, he puts a cigar in his mouth, and you regain one health per second. Wait. I don't I think have you have one. I didn't even know I had a weapon wheel, to be honest with you. Is there a cigar? I don't I think, think you have one. You gotta press Q, it's not in their weapon reel. wheel. The Q for me is just the last weapon. I don't. Oh, okay. Oh, wait a yeah, minute. Wait a minute. You're talking about. Um. Oh. Never mind. I'm thinking about. Fraught. My weapons are on the mouse wheel. This guy needs to Whatever. fuck off. Aww. Get off my roof. Get off my plane. No ticket. <laughs> You're, you're referencing the third Indiana Jones, right? That's yep. a secret. Or airplane. No, not airplane. The movie where Harrison Ford's a fucking on an airplane and he tosses that dude out the back. Air Force One? Air Force One. Oh, <laughs> look at this guy jumping around. He's having a good time. Woo. Have you beat that? Have you fought that dude with the horrible? Oh wait, no, that's the end of the next episode. Never mind. I was gonna say horrible Arnold Schwarzenegger impression. What? No, in this? Big John. Yeah, no, Big John. No. In he's this? No. Yeah, he's got this Doppler effect attached to his voice because there's like one of those wind elevators, and if you if you go on that at the same time as him, he'll pass you. He's like, <laughs> it's the funniest shit. Come ever. on, come on, do it. No, do it. Come on, I'm right here. Come on, do it. Come on. Open up the door. There's a bomb in there. Spin the spin the shotgun. Do it now. <laughs> yes. Right With the there. texture glitch here. Come on, guys. Dylan, you and son of a bitch. And he doesn't stop talking the entire fight. It just no, he doesn't. <laughs> oh, I feel like I did play that. I think Didn't I got past they that. Take that from Rise of the Triad. Yep. No, I think it was in. Yeah, actually, yeah, I think it was that. Either that or one of the later Wolfenstein. Wait, can I get on top of here? I don't oh, think I John That's was in ceiling. a Wolfenstein game. I think he was. Uh, oh, yellow my. key. Oh, fuck off. Well, well, That's was a it secret? Mega Hitler? Because they had a similar accent. Yeah, Hitler. Sounds like Carl Schwarzenegger. Well, he did have an Austrian accent. <laughs> They're both Austrian, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, blue to das blue. To <laughs> oh no, please, no. <laughs> Wait, have any of you have any of you played um uh, uh the Return to Castle Wolfenstein? No. Yeah. Okay, I have. That's that like. Yeah. I I I because I, I was like people were talking about it online like it's the, it's the best. FPS ever, and then no. I tried it. No, it's it's no. not. It's what's hitting? Okay, me? it's actually not that fun at all. I didn't enjoy it. I liked I like... it. Oh, these fucking guys! I don't like how the wall texture tiles so much here. This? Yeah. yeah. It almost looks I like mean... a padded cell. Oh, the well, this is just a misalignment. I, think. I mean, it went from a ten to like a zero right there. Five out of seven. Yeah. Do those even exist anymore? I don't, oh, I don't, I've never wow, seen that got one. both of them. Do what exist anymore? I have never seen a padded cell in my life. I've never seen one either, but I've also never been inside of a courtroom. Or I believe a that hospital. was um, 
older metal, mental institutions when they were uh, borderline. Well, not borderline. They were like I'm torture cells. Sure basically, you get on a hand, they just strap you in a fucking chair. These days. Yeah, that was when people with mental That's, illness yeah, were treated yeah, usually... as like psychopathic killers. They do put you in like a room by yourself for a bit, but they 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 don't. It's not it's not padded. Oh man, I gotta be in this room by myself. You try to hurt yourself, though. I gotta hang out with my best friend all day. What? Then they have three people check invited on. to this party: me, myself, and I. Then they have exactly. someone uh, check oh, this, on you every like ten, this fifteen is minutes. This the boss. See like, me? I would just yeah. act normal when they're not around. Then when they come around, just like act out crazy. And then when they leave, I'm just like, okay. Anyway, they left me alone. Thank you. This part's crazy. You aren't. I mean, I like those enemies right oh, there, the ones from the mine. Oh shit! You, this thing goes if, faster uh, too. If you act up, then they will like chill out near you. I'm just sitting there. Yeah. Because I want to make sure. And then you you'll never get out of the chair. Yeah. <laughs> Stop bouncing. I've been allowed to have fun. I, I, I spent a week in a mental hospital once after a, a certain episode I had, and I'll tell you, there was it's it. I was only there for a week, and it felt like everything I could tell you felt like I've been there for ten years. It was that's how nuts that place was. Yeah, I, the one time I was there it was for like a week, and it was so boring. Oh shit! Not even boring. It was just like the amount of stories I had within a week was enough to cover my entire lifetime. Look at the fucking- there's so much blood in those guys, it's insane. <laughs> they have huge guts. This guy's got a like, huge rib cage. Oh, big bones too, huh? Yeah, they got- they got them thick bones from sucking down <laughs> so much milk. I bet when that- I bet when that guy eats, he looks pregnant. Yeah, but he's not fat, though. He's not also, fat. Also, he's just... my brother is ten times stronger than Mike Tyson. My brother's biceps are like ten times bigger than Mike Tyson. It's all natural. It's just this genetic thing. And I guess kind of me too, but you know, whatever. Yeah, I'll, Dude, I'll it's whatever. Definitely are into it. <laughs> when is he gonna get removed again? <laughs> just start to asking him about Tate. <laughs> Yeah, because he's like, banned. yeah, the, it was the, he started talking about how he got like self-help. And one of the first things he says when he came back is like, have you guys heard of Andrew Tate? Just start, ah, start, start picking his brain on that. He'll get banned like in a fortnight. Well, considering he talked about having dreams That's of being two women. That's too weak, Just like, He'll be banned. The fortnight's like 12 days or something. I know. It's, it's, Clippy's going to take a while. Him. Trust me. Okay. He didn't yeah, do it right. before. Maybe Andrew I'm just Tate ignorant or out of the loop, but who's Andrew Tate? This guy, he's like, he Shit. was like a kickboxer in an MMA, plays he's retired just a now, and he's just public misogynist. He's, like, he's been banned yeah, off multiple social media. He's on like horses that tell like men how to like be all third of how like women are basically just weaker than men, all this cliche misogynist bullshit that. Yeah. Uh, uh, he's one of those guys that's like, alright, let me tell you something about women, guys. This is what you gotta do. Da, da, da. I hate that shit. I don't know if he so does, he probably does pick up artist stuff too, but he's just generally actually just, just totally There misogynist. are a couple of guys that were doing that same thing a few years ago. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, like, just, just, let's, let's bring him up next time and be like, so. I hear he's pretty it's, cool, right? It's, 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 not, um, he the... says he's not in favor of rape, but he's like, he says stuff like, what? Oh, you know, it, it, a woman's asking for it if she's like dressed in her appropriate or does Yeah, that's. That or... He also, he said women guy. have no inherent honor. What does that even fucking mean? Uh, it means that men are inherently. It means that they can't be a Klingon. <laughs> <They're good. laughs> well, usually, what they mean by that is like, men are by default have morality and then women don't. Uh huh. And it's usually just a way to demean them. Like, I would say oh. it's the other way around. <laughs> well, if you look at history, uh, what men have been doing for the past this what I'm few saying. centuries, yeah. And it's usually like, such again, things like, oh, what are women? The women are good at things too. They have better empathy, but they're not good at anything else, even though it's a core like skill that's extremely useful for like almost anything. It's also core Hi, all morality. I'm saying, all I'm saying is Eve is the one that ate the apple, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't write the Bible. That was exactly. Jesus. <laughs> That was written about at least 200 years ago. <laughs> that was, uh, I didn't, I didn't write that story. <laughs> I don't when make, Jesus I don't write the rules, I, I just follow. Like, 
<laughs> Create. I think. Oh my God. E one M ten. Is this? Is this just bullshit? Is that E one thing like not actually reflective of what episode it is? Like what? I don't know. But in the third episode, there's this enemy that makes like the sound of a pan fucking screech. Like it's like it sounds like someone taking a fork and scraping it down a metal pan, and it's like the worst sound ever. And at the same time, it sounds awesome. Oh, this is this is actually supposed to be the last level of the, the episode one. All right, I guess I'll do it. I mean, it has a, I didn't realize episode one. I didn't remember it having um, so much like uh, visual variety. I guess I thought it was. Is that a bad thing? No, it's a great I thing. I thought it was mostly the farm boring. thing. That voice, I thought it was somebody like burping on mic. Being a mafia. It's, a it is, mafia. It is so cringy. It's the first video I saw relating <laughs> to him. Behold what? my power! Andrew right. Tate talking about how he's basically uh, in the oh. mafia. <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry, so everybody is Andrew Tate in? I'm basically what? in it. I, you know, not quite, but you know, I'm if basically a video... there. Okay, if I see a video like that recommended to me, I'm going to laugh at them. I don't care who they are. Look, I don't know our viewers' names, but every person I've ever met with the word Tate in their name's a fucking asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I I apologize to any Tates in the chat. This does not reflect. <laughs> if you're a Tate or Tot, I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, I assumed it would end at E1M8, because I went to the secret level, so I thought that would be E1M9, but it's actually 10 levels, so, I mean... Yeah. There is a guy in real life, for in my life, that I know whose last name is Tate, and he's the biggest piece of shit I've ever met in my life. How about Emily so, Tate? Wasn't like, she murdered by Manson? Isn't that her name? Sharon Tate. Uh, Sharon Tate. Actually, okay, well... He's innocent. He never killed anybody. Oh, sorry. You're right. <laughs> is he also Sonichu? No, 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 no. That's Ted yeah. Bundy. Yeah. yeah. Christian. Was, and Ted. yeah. Wait, he and left out like, Manson. <clears throat> Did you see what Sharon Tate was wearing? She was asking for oh, it. Jesus fucking Christ, <laughs> You are a bad, bad man. Does anyone else just brute force these? That I was a man. Like. What about brute force? Brute force. Now that's a that, now that's a good game, right? Xbox. <laughs> Remember that shit. That sounds uh, like a grindcore band. Oh, shit, Brute Force was a it. Xbox launch game, I think. Oh, you gotta kill Napalm Death. You gotta kill the. Napalm Death is great, though. I like um, I like you suffer because it's the most tolerable of their songs. No, I saw them and they played that shit live. <laughs> <laughs> they go, and they'll fucking cry. Lost it. Quarantine Ooh, release, do off. not touch. <laughs> you love this boss, says Knife World. Or, oh, get ready for this. Oh shit, he keeps... Uh, What's yeah, with the, the horse shit? Music. What's... Why? It, it, does Krot... Yeah, Krot has the, the horses with the gas masks and like, now this. Well, horses used to have gas masks back in the day. Yeah, yeah, that they makes they sense. sense. Horse faces are fucking scared. But... I've just, I mean, I you know, more horses in games. I'm all for it. Horses scare me. I had a buddy. He was playing horses. Red Dead Redemption 2, and all he kept doing was punching his horse. <laughs> no, <laughs> I, a psychopath. My, my friend had Red Dead Redemption 1, and he would just ride around and then just like shoot the horse out from That's under him jibs. and watch the rag go off. Holy shit! Off. That's... <laughs> and then Look he, at he was uh. He, uh, he was like playing the game and he's just like he had the explosive rifle where like you shoot anything and it just what did we create on contact. and it's like he like oh shot these are scientists horse. with fucking needles i just didn't even notice that is, yeah come on they have lab coats you didn't realize you're scientists How could... oh shit i didn't know you could charge this for a this I looks like the daikatana story sandwich this is the fucking daikatana dude that you remember that katana oh my god yeah no but it looks so. it's uh, the fucking oh. um the that fucking is not uh, what a katana looks like. It looks no, you're like right. Imitation. I'm thinking of the um, this like magic effect yeah. on it was if like when you powered up your daikatana, it looked level. like that. You know you're saying, but it, it's, it looks more like a cheap knockoff. Actually, it's more of a trilby. It's not. It's a... more of like a yeah, a long sword or something. I don't hey, know. sandwich. How much you want to bet? There's a second horse. Oh. Fuck. The second experiment. A fucking. Uh, you can probably melee that shit back, can't you? 
Like this. The second experiment's a horse, of oh, course. Oh, God. It's like fighting them along. Check this out. At three fire, fire, fire. No, he doesn't want to. Oh, 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 oh. Holy shit! Nice! It's like Did you know you could do that? Yeah. yeah. No, I'm Did talking you know? to Bay. I'm not G-Man. You know, Did you know that when you go to fight Big John, he's behind a door, the crossbow shoots through walls, so you could kill him before even opening the door to fight him. There's something like, like that in the first Dark Souls, where you can kill the Moonlight Butterfly using a bow and arrow before he actually yeah. appears. Dark Pulse yep. says I should play um... Dai Katana now. <laughs> So you oh, can actually do that no. to a lot of bosses. You can even do that to the final hey, boss. You can get the... poisoned by flies and die like 20 times. Well, honestly, can... that would be, you know, I would sooner play Daikatana for a laugh than play Doom 3. You can't stop the stream without his buddy Superfly. I can't stop the stream without my buddy Superfly. Doom 3 is a great <laughs> game, though. It's the best game. It's fine. But Daikatana I mean... looks like fun to just fuck around with for a bit. It's just like, look how trash yeah, this is. You say that, but you're not playing it. I'm not. Say that I talk a big talk. talk. I talk there a big talk. There is a way to patch that fixes a lot of the problems, or at least makes them more tolerable. Like, okay. like the same I'm not a brony. You barely can was... make it through Doom 64. How are you going to handle Daikatana? He did Just... make it through Doom 64, I mean, though. Yeah, but he was, like, groaning the whole time. And then he deleted a night of my life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I still no, have it. I still what, have what it, don't we, worry. What are we, Proteus and fucking, uh, what's his face? Thanks, John. What? Suspicious. suspicious. We're talking about old Let's Plays. This is before your time. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, I thought he was bringing up some like ancient Greek philosopher, Proteus. <laughs> <laughs> Proteus is also a, a boomer shooter. <laughs> no. Proteus is also a boomer shooter of the Dragonfly works on, which is kind of cool. The meat hook wounds in your back still throb as you make your way down the cold, black, and bloody hallways that once held these monstrous creations. You leave the ruined town of Dusk behind, littered with the corpses of the possessed, hoping never to return, oh, and the distance stand imposing silhouettes of what appears to be military facilities. But why? A it dark voice like in my apartment to go to work. Dark voice pushes you forward. Do you truly seek answers, or is it simply too late to turn back? Continue the Dusk experience in episode two, The Facilities. Dead to rights. Dead to fucking rights. <laughs> Uh, let me just make a save. Uh, Dark Paul says it's a. Oh, yeah, Daikatana is a lot better with the community patch. I yeah. mentioned that, but nobody heard me. I Sorry. heard you, Lady Miss Dragon. Uh, is it the. Is that the one where it just, like, makes it so you don't need your buddy Superfly to finish? It and they can't other. die either, because in the original, if they die, then you fail the mission. And I yeah. think the girl's called Makiko or something. Yeah. Makiko. Is that the traitor? Oh, yeah. Spoilers. I saw this. <laughs> oh, boo fucking I'm oh, kidding, dude. Spoiled Dai Katana. <laughs> you spoiled the richly game. textured narrative oh, of Dai Katana. I mean, it's better than fucking War and Peace. I'm it's... waiting for the remaster. When I played through the Dai Katana swamp, it was better than winning World War II. Oh, man, it's so happy. Than good. Shrek Swamp. Uh, it was better than victory what in Europe. What are you doing in my swamp? Donkey! No! You miniature, irritating beast of burden! Okay, uh, that was, uh, pretty fun. I, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the dusk part of this stream. I'm looking to play maybe Hrot because... <clears throat> Well, it's, it's got a, a similar look to Dusk, uh, but the episode two came out and I never actually played it yet. So I figured I'd go through episode one here and maybe do an episode two, maybe on a stream or maybe on a video or something. I'm not sure. It would be cool if you played Doom 3 on stream. Yeah, you oh, should do Oh, Jesus that. fucking Christ. Leave him alone. <laughs> Y'all just doesn't like it. Thank you, lady. I don't think the bag was here when I made it clear that I really don't want to play Doom 3. I don't care. Yeah, you do. Like, you yeah, you do. Thing. It's it's yeah. just it's the fucking especially the beginning. I'm gonna be wondering. Oh my god, there's a story. I'm reading text files. And, oh yeah, no, sure it's so TV. scary though. It's getting it's hellified so again. Oh, Ooh. let's walk around and shoot god fucking imps then, three oh, feet yeah. away. Like every let's five shoot seconds. one enemy <laughs> at at once through, for ten hours. Hey man, before we had 2016. 
that's all we had in terms of 3D Doom. Yes, it's just being shuttled from For jump scare years. to jump scare, says Dark Pulse, and they're not also scary, so, like, that's... It was, a cool, a it was a cool game at the time. It was a cool text showcase. It was a cool twist. You don't um, think it's okay. cool at all. Don't lie How about Duke uh, Nukem but, 3D? Play that. Yes. That would be yeah, cool. I actually tested that out today. Otherwise, I'm going to probably... Uh... And so you tested it out, you had to make sure your computer could handle it? No, <laughs> testing out the volume and making sure I could stream it to Discord, etc. I don't know if I could do Duke 3D, guys. I just, I don't uh, know. It's it's cool. Discord racy. sometimes a little annoying with, like, uh, I actually figured out a way to stream anything in Discord, which uh, I had trouble with before. Um, yeah. Scientists hate him. He can so, stream anything in Discord with this weird trick. Uh, well, basically, if you have trouble finding the screen, you can go in, you can, um, there's a se section where you can add the game, um, to Discord where it shows your activity. Like, right now it says I'm playing Dusk, and then fr from that activity box, you can actually stream it, so. Oh, it's like, it's like pad data on an XM radio. Uh, sure. Uh, let me take a All quick right. break, Wait. guys, and I'll be back. I guess you guys want to see Duke or, or Hrot? The bag uh, wants Duke. Duke. Oh, you want I mean, Duke too? I remember. Yeah, H-Raw. I mean, I just saw a video of it once and... Hmm. Why yeah, Duke I'll... nuke him forever? Uh, okay. Everybody knows I can that. do that. Perfect. I drink uh, one beer and I'm fucked. Talk amongst yourselves for a bit. I'm just gonna... No, I don't want to. Get a... Uh... Now. Yeah, if now. Sandwich approves, I disapprove and I disavow. Everybody shut the okay, fuck up. Okay, thanks for being literal children, then. You're a literal child. I'm the you most mature person, binary. I yeah. Thanks for being a Fuck you. Thanks for being an ontological child. <laughs> I hate that word. I am not a child. <laughs> that word You're sucks. ontologically so juvenile. Me. Orange Joe. Okay, Jordan, we you know don't want to hear- It's none of your business how many diapers I go through a day sandwich, okay? Excuse me? Exactly. Oh, no. and God. What's this world coming to when you question a man's diapers? Um... I only bring this up because somebody brought up adult babies. Okay... You know, Pamper Chew, he likes diapers. Who the fuck's- what the hell's Pamper Chew? Oh he's god, a, oh no, oh god, oh fuck. He's an individual, uh, oh, oh boy, god. oh lord. He's a- um, he's a- he's a- he's a furry that's into diapers, and he's also a meth head, and a pedophile, and uh... He likes to dumpster dive. Alright, well that's enough for that. He likes to dumpster dive for used diapers that he can sniff, and he likes putting oh, them in the microwave. Okay, uh, okay. The stereotype okay. In your okay. In I think we get a picture. <laughs> oh, man. He likes doing meth. Uh, Someone really, really picked that problems. point? No. Elect that sounds like the least of his problems. Man. I want to try it someday. I oh no, shit, you Electro, no, you uh, Electro Pirate just Fuck sanded me you. 389. <laughs> Thanks a lot. I think you're actually my my first tipper here uh, ever on the sand stream. What Put that up. amount of money? $3.89? Very specific. Uh, that might be a call out to something. Knife World says, and I'm never tuning into a sand stream again. Yeah, you know what was funny is Wilster said that and I got tipped like right after. Like that, <laughs> that's not when he tipped. It takes some time to go through, but that was a really funny time for that to go through. Yeah, I never hear here and discuss movie Bob the real that fucking guy again. Fuck. Dark Pulse Dark Pulse says it's $160 Canadian. Yeah, <laughs> thanks. That 389 is uh oh it's five in Canadian. Thanks a lot, man. I really appreciate it. Five million yen. I know, um, you know what I really like about that, uh, is, uh, is now it won't say no data in the bottom left corner where Tipper says, so, that's, uh, and uh, I know you uh, also boosted the server, I know you love my, uh, my content quite a bit, so I appreciate that so much, um, I included the PayPal because in order to get the Super Chat YouTube stuff, you need to get to a thousand subs, so I figured I would... Put that in there, um, and uh, you know I'll, you're getting there pretty soon, though, right? Uh, I'm almost to 500 here. 
Yeah. Oh, uh, I but thought still, you were further, to be honest. No, I, know you're I wanted now. to be further, but uh, it's still pretty good to, in my mind. Um, Dude, good for you, man. That's fucking cool. Electro Pirate, yeah, I know. You want, Electro Pirate wants me to make a Patreon, and um, it's just a little bit of a timing thing where, like, you know, it's going to be extra work for me to make the rewards good, and, you know, you know, depending on how many people join, it's... Um, I kind of was planning to wait till I get to that 1,000 subscribers, and I would expect to have enough Patreon support there, but... Um, this is a big moment. I, yeah, it is, I, yeah, it is the first time I've really actually gotten money through this. So, um, yeah, thank you so much. And I, I sh it, it is, um, it is recorded on that tipping page. There's like a top 10 thing. So, um, I will definitely like, I think what I could actually do is, uh, even like shout out thanks to people who tip through PayPal, like either in maybe at the end of some edited vids or something, not quite a Patreon, but at least like a way to to thank folks so electro pirate i think i'll i'll do that for you maybe give you a special role in the discord um Anything? even though you uh, you already have team. even though you already have the server booster role but uh yeah sandwich just starts crying yeah <laughs> <laughs> thank you uh, so i i came uh, to ohio with a dream thank you baby jesus thank oh, you tom cruise <laughs> thank you buddha <laughs> All right, Pi Electro Pirate. Thanks for thanks for understanding of the yeah. Like uh, I have, you know what? I did a text file with ideas for Patreon levels, just as an early brainstorm. But like, and I've looked at a couple other Patreons, but uh, it's I'm not sure how much the support I'd get. I mean, PayPal here is almost a way of gauging whether people think it has enough value for that. So, damn, uh, shall have a bust in the middle of Times Square now. Uh, Electro Pirates Discord almost got hacked a couple days ago, so the boosting will go away soon, sadly. Yeah, that's all right. Um, I, uh, Boost you know, unfortunately again. couldn't get the most out of the boosting because, um, because, it, you know, the way Discord works, it's kind of dumb. You need, like, two. So, um, but, uh, thank you for the support in this other fashion. I really appreciate it. Um, Duke 3D. Checked it's it out. Not 3D. It's not, it's... Oh it's a boy. lie. Oh it's boy. a fucking lie. Fraudulent. Yeah, it's 2.5D, right? Romulent. I'm gonna sue for $3.89. <laughs> I did put it in American dollars damn. because I figured a lot of people who watch mostly aren't American, but, you know. I'm from Mars, so yeah. Yeah, well, you know, women are from Venus. <laughs> all right anyway they are though i've seen it they, like there's like this weird facility where like all the women on earth come from on venus oh wow you guys play that vomitorium <laughs> ever no it's like a i'm trying to hear about the woman factor i think that venus, was a gz man. doom kind of <laughs> game a bit of metroidvania elements Kind of looks interesting. I could play maybe play that another time. I'm actually glad you guys said Duke 3D because I had been planning on it, but I was like, ah, people have seen enough of Duke, right? But I, I guess yeah, but they right. haven't seen enough of Doom guy after like twenty thousand hours of your live streams. So they've seen enough Duke. Oh, I guess that's a good oh, point. I thought sure. people maybe wanted the newer boomer shooters, but you know, damn. Oh yeah, you got that legit boom. Pissing me off. Fun Duke nuked them. This is gonna fuck up my So there's head. a there's a setting here for Duke talk and there's a legacy Duke talk. Yeah, that's <laughs> they... probably the bit crushed version. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I just oh, did is that it? one. It's a separate it's <laughs> yeah. a separate check mark. Yeah, if it says legacy then that's probably just the version where, like so it's a bit crushing everything, like as it was in the original game. Okay, and for some reason every time I alt tab it fucking goes into windowed mode. And I'm not sure if anybody this is the um 20th anniversary world 3D world tour. Uh, if anybody knows how to stop that, that would be cool. But for now, it's That's not going to hold that. Brandy version. Uh, uh, if it's the world tour version, I mean, he has to be playing source support. He didn't whine. 
Uh, yeah, I'm not playing it. I'm just playing the, the you know, re-release, remastered thing, I guess. Cursed um, Randy version, okay. Yeah, Cursed Randy version. I'm giving my money to him. Oh no, capitalism. Uh, let uh, me just stream. Uh, Randy Pitchfork or whatever his name is. Oh, got him. Randy Pitchfork. Uh, got him. Uh, All right, hopefully you guys see that. I don't, I don't get it. Yeah, oh, I don't nice. get it. So this this version also has the rewind feature, which is cool. I think that kicks in when you die and allows you to rewind a bit. That's horseshit. Uh, is it? Is that a joke? Thing? No. Is that a, wait, that's not a joke. Uh, <laughs> no. That's wait. DSTA allows you to rewind. Is that horseshit? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> wait. Let me get let me get a Pepsi and uh, just why did you why did you explain that for a second while I go get this? Uh, okay, so um, it takes the complete challenge out of every game that it's involved in. It's like saving a state in an emulator and or the same thing, you know, pressing a Wii rewind button. It's not, if you like to do that, that's on you and that's your business and I respect I, that, but for me, that's just not something no, I enjoy. Bay, I have to bay, seen the, you already have quick saves. I have seen people do that, where they'll like jump into like a pit or something that they could just get out of, and they're like, "Oh, time to rewind," or they'll just like go somewhere they didn't. Oh, time to rewind. I mean, like, sandwich. Remember all those wretched prey videos where people were doing exactly that, and they just fucking gave them hell. Oh, like, oh, okay, like on a on a uh, no, yeah, like on a on a emulator, just like rewinding Mario, yeah. But like we're in a game with quick saves, it's kind of like quick save is different though. <laughs> quick save is you at least have to, you can't. No, no I look. I don't thing. use DSDA's rewind feature for that reason because I like to no, say like this is where this is where I'm going from. But in terms of like just I'm casually playing Duke, like I'm, I don't fucking care, right? No, I mean, I mean it's fine. I mean I don't give a fuck what anybody does. I'm just saying for me it's just not a thing I. Do. I might not even use it. I might not even use this because no. I think it only pops up when you die, uh, and I'm not gonna die. Why waste the time? Why is this turning into the big debate of the night? Like, this is the one that Watch me kick, 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 kick my legs like thing. a gangster. My response will be no longer than 10 minutes because that is the YouTube time limit. <laughs> uh, me, <laughs> you, Jeff Mrs. Bear, the answer to that multiplication question is for, but also Super Mario Bros. is the greatest <laughs> game ever made. It was my Vietnam. Uh, Alright, guys. God. Hey, Those alien bastards are gonna pay for shit. Kill Stan, don't fucking repeat it. Those alien bastards are gonna pay for shitting on my ride. Those alien bastards are gonna pay the insurance on my Hollywood ride. Hollywood Holocaust. Let's Those rock. alien bastards are gonna pay their alimony after I divorce Should I play them. Come Get Some or Let's Rock? What do you think? I mean... Why the fuck? Whatever you wanna do, not man. showing up on stream, but... Yeah, I don't see stream. anything. Those alien uh, ambassadors are gonna pay for that slurpee at the 7 Eleven. Oh, is it not? Wait a minute. Is it only. Those alien ambassadors are gonna pay Fuck for my YouTube, Wawa. Not it, yeah. Wait, when I go All full right. screen, does it not show up? I see it right now. How about now? No, now it's good. Yeah, I think it was it just. It's gonna be okay. Now it's okay? Oh, now it's gone. No, it's now it's gone. Wrong, wrong. Yeah, full screen's a problem, I think. Oh, for fuck's sake, Discord. Didn't you have that happen with a different game at some point? No, it's... it's does anybody know why this keeps switching to windowed mode when I fucking alt-tab? Because that's the fucking... <sighs> Jesus Christ. You should play it in DOSBox. <sighs> um... When you use chocolate damn waffles, do you use the high detail or the low one? It's really no. I, I go into Chocolate Doom and I turn it down even lower than it already. No, I, I use the high. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what's the resolution on the low end? Is that like? Pretty sure it's three hundred and twenty by two. Why is this not giving me ninety? In well, Windows, no, it's not even version. giving me full resolution. Oh. This is the high fucking... version is three twenty by two hundred. The low version is probably like half that. I'll play the really low version sometimes. This is really I stupid. I do not, because... It's not giving me a 1920 by 1080 uh, for windowed mode. Why? Dude, I, this is... Uh, what? I... I don't know. And also, every time I alt-tab, it... 
it fucking goes windowed, so when I try to stream it on Discord, it it streams in windowed, and then when I make it full screen, it doesn't like it anymore. So, like, I have to figure out how to not have it go into windowed mode, but I don't know. What a mess. This is terrible. One time I fell out of a tree. Maybe you should not use that version of it. This is the version I have. I don't. I don't want to set up. I can't set up something else right now. I might have to uh, figure this out for next time. Unfortunately, because uh, this is uh, unfor. I I test. I thought I tested this out, but it's because I it partly to watch worked. It tonight. And I'm not going to play in a small window on my screen. That's fucking stupid. Please. Uh, it's a low-res game. You want me to yeah, play in a it. small it, window on my on my screen? Yeah. I guess yeah. you won't notice it, but it looks fucking stupid to me. It looks stupid. This reminds me of something. Like, it's crazy. I've been playing. I told you I haven't been playing Fallout recently. Actually, I've been playing the PC version of Soul Calibur 6. And that game's God. graphics, if you were to push the graphics on that thing all the way to maximum it's fucking beautiful i just I've been really want to get this, this to work and i'm pissed on 12, off right 80 now 80 by 768 sorry guys i'll uh i'll try this one more time and then Try this one more time, and then if that doesn't work, I'll just move on to Hrot, maybe. This is like such a, such a like stupid little issue. Where it's like, why would this well, happen? Know, I think it would be cooler for you to dedicate a stream to this game rather than you know, play it randomly anyhow. Well, I'm sort of testing yeah, these out right. to see if I want to play more of them. It turns out Not so far game. both of them I'd like to play more. Just like, don't do full screen. That's probably dumb idea. I can't I mean, even. Yeah, it I fine. can't even do a full window though. It looks fine though. Because it looks fine barely... to you. It looks like crap to me. You know, I, I have to like play doing window both. I'm just like watching a video or something at the same time. I'll Is the window screen. like a small window so you can see your desktop behind it? Yes. Well, maybe you like that, but that's fucking terrible to me. I'm gonna play Hrot. I mean, it's more that I don't necessarily have much much of a choice if I have to do like one or two other things at the same time. But yeah, I'm. Uh, I think uh, maybe like uh, Debag said, maybe I'll do a Duke stream and um, figure this out by yeah. then, or maybe actually just play a different version of it because uh, I don't know. Probably have to change yeah. some config file to fucking stop it from going into windowed mode every time I Alt Tab. Fucking great job, Randy Pitchford. <sighs> yeah, it's all his fault. Holy shit. Oh, boy. So you're gonna really play old, uh, Is it, uh, is it Frot or Rot? Frot. Uh, it's it starts with an H. For a bit. It's... I may come back later. Okay. Uh, thanks for uh, hanging out. Yeah. Yeah. That you missed. No problem. Hey, nice to see you. I'll miss you. Thank you. Miss you too. Okay, here we go. This game is in trash, so game. it works. Never heard of it. Dank stuff. Oh, there's a bestiary. Huh. Is that how you why pronounce it? Why, why, not, why not a fucking worstiary? I mean, is it pronounced bestiary even though it's B A E S? I also heard you pronounce median as median earlier. Oh, that works either way. Yeah, no. okay. Miss Room is Rum. No, I, I'm not trying to make I, fun of Stanley. Like, that's say, just one of those words. I say that it I like always... everyone else. I say it the right way, okay? <laughs> well, because it's not spelled bestiary, it's spelled bestiary, but. That's, it's not the. Well, then that's on them. <laughs> sure, I... bestiary. Who gives a shit? Anyway. R from. Bestiality. Well, that's, yeah, I mean. I don't, <laughs> I don't comment on that anymore, though, do I? Uh. It's the bestiality. <laughs> yeah, that's... Wins bestiality. 
All right, let's make sure you guys this is talking running. about bestiality now. That's weird, man. Yeah, we're all weird. Mm. I'm not. Yes, you are. Shut up, freak. <laughs> oh, let's. How? Uh, I'm. I'm curious. Bestiary. Best. U.S. is bestiary. Bestiary. That's bestiary. I think people just say bestiary when I think I did because. You assume they're talking about Beast? Like, it's it's a... It's like a... Mr. Beast? He's my favorite YouTuber. <laughs> no, like, as in it's like a dictionary of Beast or something, but it's, for some reason, bestiary is... I don't know what that actually... Maybe it comes from the root Well, beast, actually, but... Sandwich, it's about how people use words, so you can't say that someone else is saying a word wrong because it's up to how other people say it. That's how words work. Oh, oh boy, here we go. <laughs> here we go, ladies uh... and gentlemen. I, I never even argued that point, but okay. Whoa, whoopsie daisy. <sighs> this is the sand stream, folks. The yeah, sand stream. Can, oh, God. Can I help? Welcome to the sand stream. No. Okay. Fuck, what are you eating, your microphone? I don't know. Maybe turn your microphone off before you chuck it across the room, though. <laughs> Can uh, I eat my microphone? Okay, you guys can see that, hopefully. Yeah, there's like a, a, a dog in the background. I see it. Hrot? Hrot! A dog? Yeah. That's not... That shouldn't be there. Uh, I, fi I figured I'll play through episode one, and uh, maybe I'll check out episode two, the, the more recent one that I didn't know was released. Maybe I'll do that at some point. Okay, ah. take... take Take off your socks, it's a bunch of rot. I'm not wearing socks, why would I do that? Dank stuff. It's, it's a bestiary. There's a handheld, there's recipes. Okay, that I, is a weird spelling. I've never seen that spelling in my life. No, that's how it's spelled. You just read it as bestiary because you assume it is. Trust me, I went through the same thing. And Smash Q. Bill Larkin. Bob Larkin. Sewer character. S up. Look at this dog Stop. snacks. What do you think of this dog? Oh my god, it's so cute. Sup. It looks hungry. It looks what like it's been eating. For? Yeah, what? it looks like it's been Stop. eating some, some What do you think this stands for? Something pooch? No, it's. I think it's a reference to what's up, dog. Uh, I don't like <laughs> I don't it know. anymore. What's up with thanks, you? For, thanks for ruining it. That's my genuine <laughs> interpretation of that. All right, uh, video. That's, that's my answer too now. Thank you for supporting I'm not sure me what I did with. I'm not sure if this uh, resolution thing was what it was, like on by default. But anyway, let's, let's check this out. Kiss me, Gustav. Oh, kiss me, Gustav. Play on normal. Here we go. Oh, this now, is cool. um, what's it, what's interesting to me, I. Tasty can poultry. Oh shit, that's a grenade. Forgot. Um, you can kick. Um, it's basically Doom Three. So yeah, you could I, just be playing Doom. 3 I right like now. 2D boomer shooters more than 3D. I've talked about this. Something about this look, I really like. Like this is going for like a Eastern Bloc sort of like software I don't know. rendering. So is this software? I, I guess it is. It just looks like it. I don't know if it actually is, but it strongly looks like it. Maybe I should play Doom on software more if I like the way yes, this looks. Absolutely. Yes. Dubai, you like uh, one. you like Doom Three, right? Mm -hmm. I love it. Okay. So, for the longest time, for me playing it, I didn't realize if you held down the grenade, it would throw it farther. So I always thought their grenade had like an awful range where you would just throw it like an inch in front of you. <laughs> I, you know, I had the same thing. I, I was playing Adventures of Square and someone in the comments was like, yeah, you can hold it down to chuck it, it is, further. But they, it, they detonate on impact with an enemy. So it's like, just... The well, also, <laughs> the shotgun is like, you know, like also super close range. So maybe you just expect like, oh, that's how they well, balance no, it or but something. But the shotgun doesn't kill you when you use it in front of an enemy. <laughs> like right. and, um, did you? Oh, like, you know that? I think you can break can this. Of... And I fucked it up by just throwing that grenade. Oh, wait, I can push this. There's like two situations I can think of offhand where the grenades are even useful in that game. Yeah, 
if you play it on the highest difficulty, it can be helpful sometimes, but generally no. I'm a dumbass that lowers the brightness to zero when I play that game. What's funny is that... Oh, shit. Nice. I need the to play weapon models. Oh, I love how stiff the animations are. Like, they, they are, they're so robotic. The, and also... And... Like, the fucking sound effect for the pistol is so, like... It's so, like, fucking dinky, but there's something about just the... I don't know, man. Like, the character that this has, I absolutely love. Have you seen it's the walking stupid. animation for the alpha, like, E3 demo for Doom 3? Dude, the alpha for Doom 3 was amazing looking. No, no, that it was. was. The walking animations were so hilarious, though. No, but I haven't seen them. It makes sense, oh, though. It's like, shit. 2002, like... I'll see if I can. Wait, I've always, oh, this is different ammo. I've, oh, this has the. Uh, did you say Z buffering? This has the texture like wonkiness thing. As you can see. That there. looks like the nine millimeter auto pistol from uh, Fallout New Vegas. They're. Uh, it's it's kind like of like are. jiggling around the textures. That thing. Um, yeah, you're right. This is very much a so like. Look at the, the way the software rendering goes on the gun. It's actually super cool. Super cute. Doom Kid says I banned him from voice chat. <laughs> What the fuck are you talking yeah, about? You should unban him. That was awfully cruel and unusual. Are you joking? Because I definitely didn't, but did something happen by accident? <clears throat> no, you banned him, remember? What? Uh, he's yeah, joking. He just he left. Well, if you if you want to come back, you should uh, love to have you back. <clears throat> Can pool, t pool tree? I posted oh, by it the way. With the, the timestamp. Sickles uh, are are in now. Yeah, apparently. this is reminding me of like what the sequel of Dusk would be. Although it, it makes like sense because it's like it's like a hammer and sickle type thing. Oh, this you can find these and just. That's a little like balls. flavor like that. I think this is uh, supposed to be in like I don't know Czechoslovakia or something, and like yes. during the seventies or something. So it's got. Oh, a landmark. Did you know that Silent Hill 2 takes place in the early 80s? Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's something I didn't know. That's fucking crazy. Makes okay, I've got now. a grenade. I've got a... I don't know... I don't think... Landmines are often not that useful unless they're, like, in a very pitched battle. Isn't that white? Isn't that right, Wister? What's that? That Silent Hill 2 takes place in, like, the 80s? It, it's very vague with it. I think that the developers commented they intended it to be like late '70s, but it's, it, you know, it, it it takes place whenever. You know, it's a very like kind of timeless feel. Where like, oh, is this modern day? Is it old school? It's sort of you know, it's not the '20s. You know, right? I would take a shower. Oh, uh, Dark like, Pulse. Dark Pulse is very uh, informative. Czechoslovakia, specifically during the Gustav Husak era. That's why it's called. This episode's called, what was it? Something Gustav. Petroishka dolls, yeah. Gustav. Hey, Dubia. Hey, Dubia, what's up? You're at an expo and got bored. Well, Dubia, have you checked out any of these boomer shooters like Hrot? What do you think? Uh, no, I haven't. Um, what? <laughs> <laughs> I like this. Uh, actually, you know, it is like a very sparsely animated but like the pump shotgun animation is actually kind of good it's weird like the the pump part like basically falls off the gun every time you shoot it and you like pull it back oh no in. that poor doggy sub dog uh. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry oh, snacks damn. also i love the way they pop out when you open the locker they just like like jump up yeah uh, if you, can... you look at like Silent Hill 3, for example, Silent Hill 3 takes place like 16 years after Silent Hill 1, but then it's like, when does Silent Hill 1 take place? Uh, 90s, yeah. I don't know. I actually read something about that, that I heard that 1 was like in the 70s. Well, uh, 1, because look at the car he's driving, that's not a 70s Jeep, right? Yeah, that's true. But then, yeah, I don't know, it, it's always, they leave that stuff very vague, and it's just, because it, it doesn't matter when it takes place. Got a rusted I'm the, key. Uh, I'm in the few that actually thought that Downpour wasn't horrible. I haven't played Downpour. I've only played the first three. 
I'm guessing this is Gustav used... here. That at like probably an actual kiss. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta kiss the uh, party leader. Kiss your kiss. Kiss your great leader. Yeah. What is that? One Karuna. Fine. My Check. Karuna. Is that is a that... play on words? Check, because this is Russia. No. Oh, rotary, rotary phone. I'm not sure. This is checking the air pressure, I guess. Oh, you can't actually crouch. Yeah, you know, anytime, anytime Czechoslovakia wins a war, do they look at the other world leaders and say, "Checkmate"? Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. Here, like, it would be that would be yeah. the worst country in the world to lose a war to because they're just like they like win a battle or like, uh, check, and it's like, shut up. Shut up. Oh no, see if if that actually happened, I think I would die of literal just laughter. If I actually heard that the government leader of that country said check mate. Like <laughs> back in like the nineteen seventies, Nixon's having a teleconference with the leader of Czechoslovakia and like they're like, We are now launching our invasion of the United States of America. Checkmate. <laughs> and then Nixon just looks this back. This sounds like it's out of Rocky Four. <laughs> like if if fucking Dolph Lundgren was like a Czech guy, was just like checkmate, you you will lose. But then Nixon comes back in Creed two with his son. Yo, check oh, this now. out. I want you to go out there. Oh. I want you to win. So we got that. these larger men with. That's that's a very nice way of putting it. I thought you were gonna call them the big, fat, ugly, greasy guys like I. This is the mancubus do. of <laughs> very this body is, positive of you. That is the mancubus of 1970s Czechoslovakia. What's this? Hussite hand cannon? Holy fuck! I... Oh, this dog! Oh my god, that's terrifying. <laughs> Is that imagine? blood on the wall next to him too? He's just staring at a wall like Blair Witch style. Yeah, I'm great. Josh? Josh? Uh, yes, I know Czechoslovakia doesn't exist anymore. Thank you. Whatever the fuck his name was in that movie. Uh, was... We're looking around. <laughs> Gotta find. This, I think, is some sort of. I'll have to check this. Try this out. This uh, definitely let's... feels like you're in an unfamiliar, like, area. Like, I wouldn't have known, like, where the fuck the setting is in what he said. It's got a very unique flavor that, I, for me, pushed it above dusk, like, in my... I mean, I guess maybe I, I like... Okay. Yeah. Personally. I have not played this game, but um, from what I've played of dusk and from what I've seen of this game, this one looks like the better game. That's uh, I was, I was, what I'm I was not, thinking. Yeah. I haven't played it, but... Although I think it is a heavy personal preference thing. Like, this one looks like the game I would like a lot more. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna say they're, it's better, but I, I I just like it. Like, what it's going I for like them more. All. I like them all. I think it's like 20 bucks, or maybe that used to... Maybe it's actually gone up now. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, Wait, that's just that a... Oh, never mind. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm not really. For the dog? You better be sorry, you're gonna go to doggy hell and then there's just gonna be a bunch of dogs shitting on you for eternity. There's fucking dogs. Aye. Excuse me, last time I heard, it looked like you were trying to wake him up. Heaven. I woke him up. Two. Two. The whole dogs go to heaven too. Sequel. The hell? Squeakle, as they call it in the industry. <laughs> if Doom Kid was here, he'd start asking. Do you about imagine squeakles? if like the Godfather Part Two was the Godfather the Squeakle? <laughs> like, they keep pulling me back in to Squeakle. It's like it's like <laughs> Michael Corleone has to team up with the shit. <laughs> Alvin. <laughs> His, yeah, his daughter's dead on the stairs. He's holding her. Alvin! Oh, I forgot. You can translate. Uh, wrap sanitary napkins in newspaper. I, for, I I need to be clicking on all the signs to translate. Oh. No, that was not. I'm not sure if these actually blow them open. They do. You can act like a man! 
Shells. What's the matter with you? I like how the map is like a roguelike map. <laughs> it actually kind of works. Funnily enough, a lot of this, you know, I was I was talking shit about 90 degree angles and yet it's I guess I'm full of shit because I like this. Uh, it's not all well, like this, the game, but shit. it's almost like it, it, you know, it's funny how that works because it almost goes with that brutalist sort of Soviet architecture, like oppressive feeling in a way. Okay. You know, so like the nazis were pretty bad right but i think they had a good sense of architecture i like the look of uh nazi architecture they did have some nice buildings yeah so also key. they had some good looking outfits like they they looked good while they were doing horrible heinous evil 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 things oh yeah they were wearing hugo boss <laughs> it reminds me of like norm like, mcdonald going like you know, this Hitler guy, the more I learn about him, the more this guy seems like a real jerk. <laughs> it's like, oh no, it's uh, it's like, yeah, you know that Hitler guy? The more and more I read about him, the less I care for him, you know? Yeah! <laughs> Let's try this out. He also is like, you know, like, Hitler had a dog, and that means that, like, there was a dog in the world whose favorite person on the planet was Hitler. Like, this dog's like, is that Hitler? Is that Hitler? Like, when someone that, enters the room, it's like, oh, no, it's not Hitler. It's I wasn't sure if that would blow me up, and it absolutely did. So now I might die. I wish a dog would love me the way that dog loves Hitler. <laughs> Hitler, Hitler was good with animals. He, he you know, loved he, animals. He got his dog to really, really appreciate him. Just not the human ones. Oh, that hurt me. Oh well, my god, dude, I was thinking Eva that. Eva Brom had a good taste for him. Oh my god. Alright, that was bad. I, I kind of got hurt for no reason there, and I didn't save that. Uh, I'll save when I maybe get some more. <laughs> um, this is the, is this the one? You ever see that comprehensive list of things that are literally Hitler? <laughs> what is... Item number one, Adolf Hitler. Oh. That's the list. Uh-huh. That's pretty funny. It's literally Hitler. That's, that's hilarious. Thank I, you. I, oh my god. Pre, Prebrim uranium mines are hiring. Ooh. Milk, the foundation of health. Did fucking Kane make this game? Lico. He's driving that joke into the ground. I said milk was gross one time, and now all his entire sense of humor revolves around posting milk emojis. What a strange, sad, and pathetic individual. Oh, this is where I was. This is where I was looking, I see. Like, in no vague terms, you need to get a life. Dude. He does that with, like, everything. Like, there was one time I pointed out that, like, Oh, jeez, those uh, doggies leap. Like, him posting smileys after, like, every single comment I made, like, was passive-aggressive and annoying. Except no, I was way ruder about it. Time. And then he started doing it literally every single time. Like, Make a point thought, of it now? I thought this person was banned. He was. They came back. Clippy was like, I felt bad for him, so I'll give him another chance. Mm, Elgaru says, made. uh, has a hot take. Milk comes from cows. Some of it. No, it Fucking no, doesn't. Fucking doesn't. Some of it. Where the hell did you hear that? Yeah, that's a gosh darn lie. It depends bastard. what animal creature you receive the milk from. The <laughs> animal creature. I regret I have that. nibbled Greg. Can you milk me? Oh, this is tavern. <laughs> you can actually press use fairly In far away. That's actually Greg really nice. What a creep. <laughs> You gotta the teat. I the convinced teat. him to clean his room one time. A milk bottle. You convinced who? Beer is out. I've... He talked about how he had like dozens of beer bottles like all over his floor. I'm trying to and play like, pool. You feel better about yourself if you clean your room. And I kept oh, and you were like, there. well then why don't you drink? Why don't you stop drinking so much? I think you said that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that I got was a one. while ago. Like, how do people live like well. that? Like, I am a slob, but it's, you gotta have <laughs> rules. We, he ended up getting banned after I started, like, making fun of him, because he said oct octopi were stupid, because they couldn't- Oh, this is that guy, okay. 
Wait a sec, I have to add this to my text. Now document. I know. I, I'm wondering if there's something happens if you sink all these. Then out of nowhere, he's like, I don't believe we came from monkeys. And I'm like, that is not how that works. That's, yeah, dude, what? <laughs> Octopi are stupid. <laughs> Doesn't believe in evolution. I would have a better conversation with an octopus than psychotic. Kid. He said they're not smart because they can't talk, yeah. so I started telling him that they can talk. They talk to me in my dream. They talk they're to like, the deep in the boys. That's such a weird bar to have for an animal intelligence. Like, so nothing happens when you sink all those walls. No, doesn't look like it. There's such an extremely like specific way that brains have to be wired to process speech properly that intelligent animals can't do. Generally, break glass. Oh no! What does this don't do? Don't do that. You're gonna get in trouble. I don't want to get trouble in trouble with the Four, Czechoslovak the police, but I'm... oh, end level. Well, oh, it's just like, expanded. dude. Oh, yeah. three, three, uh, three. it looks like I'm missing a bit, but uh, probably in secrets or something. Yeah, I love the look of this though. I feel like every time I'm on chat with you guys, uh, Wonkers is just in the background, like, fucking investigating missile codes on his guys' That's keyboard cool. just all the time. Because I, um, I had to just memorize the self-referencing sector, and I had to just memorize the, the floor and ceiling heights I wanted to use. It was... <laughs> He's playing war games. Luna. Alright, I've kind of screwed myself by being low on health here, but hopefully, uh... Oh, that's okay. You tried your best, buddy. <laughs> Citizens, keep yeah, calm and follow all instructions of the National the Committee path. diligently. Oh, for a second I thought you were really reading that. I was like, shit, I didn't know you knew how to read Who, who laughed Yeah, and check. That. I didn't know. I'm serious. I didn't notice there was subtitles at the bottom of the screen. I thought you were literally making that up. Looking toward the Congress <laughs> of the Communist Party. Max, did you laugh at that? Was that you? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, this door opens else. Fine. I wish Max I had laughs more at. Anything. Do you think I have a good sense of humor? Yes. I do. Except oh, that guy! Something I say. That guy jumped. He has legs. <laughs> he's not. He's not wings of redemption. Left foot forward, no step back. Who about that? Will have us to Pierzi. There's a really well. There's this is a, a few working piano. There's a really like there's a few depressing clips of Wings of Redemption, but there's one where he's like talking about how much he like how he just kind of misses the act of running. How he hasn't ran for like years. He's like, you know, I miss running. Oh, you can change the tone on this thing. Play Chopin's uh, second nocturne. This is Mario. I don't even know. <clears throat> I mean, nothing I like stopping the... him. I like the Nocturne that uh, Blonde Redhead later adapted into the, their one song. That's a very nice Nocturne. Nocturne 1's the best one, though. Hey, he just starts breaking. Oh, shit! Oh, my God! Get yeah, fucked. Yeah, who's paying for that? Who's paying for that? More like... More like... Right foot forward. Uh... <laughs> Oh, I, I don't know how you do it, man. Oh, is this Pravda? <laughs> oh, that's like the old Soviet newspaper. Nice. Pravda. Communist newspaper. I read the Soviet newspaper. It says we're fucked. <laughs> Frankly, I believe it. <laughs> Storage. Skullad. Doom Kid uh, put old biddies on the screen there. Oh, that guy's throwing up. I'm actually almost done that map with Doom Kids resources, huh? March 8th, IWD. Is that like... Yeah, how far along have you gotten, Snack? I, I have a very rudimentary layout. Do you have, All like, honest citizens of the Republic you... elect the candidates of the National Front. Did you spend three hours putting dynamic lighting into a fucking vanilla compatible map? No. Oh. You're doing it wrong, then. Well, the city sorry. of... Kladno greets the famous Soviet army. Kiss Gustav Go back again. to the drawing board, I guess. 
Yeah. Well, yeah, that's literally where you're at right now. Great ambient music as well in this. I can imagine. Oh that. look, it's Wolster's keyboard. What's that? Len I'm right. I'm writing Lenin. Sudra Lenin. Lenin, McCartney. Lenin, Harrison. Sudra Lenin. I don't know. Where's Lenin, Comrade going? Lenin, Eternal Lenin lived. Lenin lives. Lenin, Lenin is to live forever. Is this like an old Lenin. poem. Oh well, I wow. ruined that uh, concert call. Sure is a balcony. Ooh. Oh, oh, that is weird. Doom Kid did make the shotgun slightly faster. That was actually fucking up my rhythm. What the hell? Uh, Dark Paul says, I am what passes for funny in Canada. <laughs> That's funny. There's Jeez. a lot of stuff that passes for a lot of stuff in Canada. They just make do. They're country boys. Yeah, like, yeah, like, like, they're, like they're bacon. Except for patties. They're very specific about what counts as a patty. Like a peppermint it, patty? No. Like, ain't bacon sandwich. She's talking about the beef patty thing that was like probably 20 years ago. Shut the it's fuck up. Oh my god. That. I try to talk about anything. About... And you're like, wow, oh. Kai, you're so out of date with all these fucking stories. You should get new What's material. The... You're the worst. Leave my stream. <laughs> What's the blood crisis thing? What was that all about again? Well, we're, what? We've got a. There was a there was a thing where it was like this um this blood donation that a lot of the blood had oh, like shit. Hep C. Oh, I remember uh, hearing about that. I learned about it in my history of medicine class that I failed in university. I've got that blood type that you can give to like anyone. I have the blood type where I can take from anyone. <laughs> Perfect. I don't I want anyone else's joking. blood. I am what's that? I don't want anyone else's blood. It's like, I have you know, a type that keeps me warm. Oh shit. I'm actually cold blooded, but uh Soviet I shotgun. I, negative. I live in Mexico. It's called Soviet shotgun. I picked up the so no, no, no. Semi skimmed milk. I thought that was a diaper for a second. Picked up semi skimmed milk. That's the best. Tell me something. Stuff. So that's like 2%. Oh, I actually screwed myself by taking so much damage earlier cuz I think this um this game is quite uh, I you know t I think to go with the oppression feel of everything it's, it's quite uh, low on health these guys are you gonna eat your tots oh shit what'd you say I said you're gonna eat your tots the chickens have large talons when you have oh, barely shit. touched your vodka stop for it tonight I'm only 80 years old. Why must I drink vodka? It's bad for liver. No, son, you're wrong. <laughs> oh, look at that oh, water effect. What the hell? It is carbonated, soft drink. What is that? It looks like vomit. That looks like when you were a kid and you mixed all your Play Doh together. That's a really I, cool oh water God. effect. Play Doh I is can... one of the most, like, when I was a kid, Play-Doh was like the most heartbreaking toy because it starts off really cool and then it just turns into this brown muck and it's disgusting. Yeah, and it's... I would just always feel so sad because I couldn't like do anything with it. It tastes anymore. so bad. Oh my god. Wow, really? yeah. You know what? I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know what Play-Doh tastes like. I'm not a fucking mouth breather, but that's cool. <laughs> back, 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 fucking shit! I keep my mouth closed when I'm not talking. <laughs> Oh shit! That was a secret cruel can of of my a secret can of poultry in the gunk hidden in a wall. I better grab <laughs> it's that. It's okay. Oh, yeah. I, I just ripped it. it. Oh, this Back is... in my day, we had to eat Play-Doh. I, mean, I really I like this water effect. Just for the fact that it tasted like shit. Oh shit! It's a fucking it's salty. piranha or something. They don't have those in Czechoslovakia. You know, know Orange that is. Joe. Orange Joe got pipe. his name because he liked to eat the orange Play-Doh the most. <laughs> I think there's something to do with possibly radiation or something. I'm not sure. Yeah, orange radiation. Yeah, the first nuke that ever went off was like purple. <laughs> Vod, you know. It, like, it lit the sky up all purple-like. They were like, hey, that's pretty cool. The sky's purple. Oh, now it's not. Oh, we all have cancer. 
Okay. Let's let Fourth of July. Let's set off fireworks at a colorful nuke. Just to make a giant light display. Oh, a med kit finally. It's like that back in the nuke. day, man. They would set off nukes and like soldiers would just like run towards it. They'd also let you just play with radium and then make your bones fall apart. Oh yeah, your jaw would just fall off. Oh shit! Yeah. You're like you still can't touch Madame Curie's like notes because they're so irradiated. Like, yeah. that's oh my god, that's so fucking bad. Like, oh, I'm gonna go to the dentist because my teeth are falling out, and then the dentist just accidentally rips just... out your entire jaw because it's just falling apart. That guy just died. <laughs> you know, whoops, sorry. And I don't know why that guy just died. Let's go Maybe play with fish the ate him. He's more ammo. Um, yeah, I remember reading about uh, there was a guy who he was selling those irradiated cocktails. And, like, I guess, like, he believed it himself, so, like, I guess he's, like, a huckster, but, like, he was drinking it himself, so it's, like, well, I guess that's the... I don't know. Like, I guess you're not the usual snake oil salesman, but you're still pretty fucking stupid. Anyway, with his his whole jaw ended up just falling off eventually, yeah. It's... With most of them, they just weren't told about it. They are like, oh, it's totally fine. Or, uh, well, I think the thing like... was, like, he was doing it even past when doctors were like, that's not a good idea, but he was doing it himself, so, like... It also depends how you use it, because, like, if you end up, like, eating it, which a lot of the people that made, like, watches did in small amounts, that is, like, that is a lot worse than just touching it. Oh, like, the the so... people, yeah, the people painting it in the factories and the watches and stuff, yeah. So is it a yeah, bad cause... thing that I walk around with ir irradiated plutonium in my pocket every day? Is okay. there such thing as non-irradiated plutonium? I'm just saying, you know. Well, I mean, there's depleted uranium. I think that's why my leg may have fallen off last week, but... Oh, weird. Just buy oh, another one. Diabetes. Now I'm sterile. You don't need a leg to... Never mind. Uh, no, that, I'm... That, it, 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't have any more SMG. This I have a lot of this Hussite rifle. Um... I have grenades have on the right. Child support because I can't have kids because I was playing with uranium. Oh, by the way. <laughs> oh shit! That's like a moped though. It's so slow. <laughs> Living that check life, baby. <laughs> I think you could. You might be able to kill enemies with this. I'm not sure. Oh, this poor guy. Luna. Well, this the wait. Is this an astronaut? Is this a cosmonaut? That f He's no. CCCP. Thirty years of the Soviet space program. Um, that's weird. Maybe it's a statue. This is um. I think this is uh actually like a space. This is like a so like a Czech NASA equivalent, I guess maybe. Czech NASA. Okay. Meat charcuterie. Oh, that that's probably a fucked up. Uh... Oh, hello. Cheese plates. That's all they do. What's this? Clothing. <laughs> I'm gonna open up a store and just call it clothing. Deliveries. <laughs> and then, so, you know, um, the sell only soup. Yeah. Does anybody come on? Oh a very God. specific reference. Oh, there it is. Yeah. I'm buying soup. Okay, there's a, a lever there. Yeah. I'm wondering you? if I can go in one of these places though. I th uh, maybe not. Maybe I like this game. You know, I really like the Stalker series as well. So like, this is sort of giving me yeah. some of that vibe. Where are you? I'm at soup. Okay. Do you just oh. don't like that video? It's okay. I'm in the charcuterie. There's cheese. Dude, sandwich. You know, also would be a good idea to play. Uh, have you ever played Marathon? Meat price list. You can get a Gotha J for 32 case. A Gotha J. Kurishe Rizki. Halvezi Zadni. Jemne Parki, Sunka Vis Jacost, and Vepper oh, Pessy. Duck. Uh, I'm playing Krot Doom Doomerson. What's up, bro? 
How's it going? Oh, oh dude, Doom, Doom Kid's here too. Cool. Doom Kid, oh, I'm basically done uh, that level. By the that way, this skybox is sick. Resources. I know it's not a Doom skybox per se, but it's got like this animated fog thing that's very cool. Sorry, I've been slacking. I'm working on a map right now. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm offended. I'm offended. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> that was pretty fucking cool. That was cool. Damn, I didn't. I just. I was just a little too late in watching the stream to see what you guys were talking about. Uh, it's uh, the uh, an idle animation for the sickle is like he takes it a hammer and just like puts it next to it. <laughs> for no reason. Oh look, Doom Doomerson. Hey man, it's good to see you. Doom kids drawing books in the chat, and then it was he corrected to boobs. Dude, he <laughs> must be typing on a phone right now. That happens to me all the time. Doom kid, what do you think about this game? Have you checked it out before? This is Harat, or whatever yes. it's called? Yes, yes. It looks awesome. I've only seen screenshots, but I thought it looked really cool. I, yeah, I, I love it. Oh, jeez. I was trying to talk to, um, I said oh, something shit. to Decino earlier, like, uh, uh, you know, I, this is a really bad mapping trait, but, like, autocorrect changed it to, like, marketing what? or some shit. So it's like, this is a really bad marketing trail. Like, it just made no fucking sense. Goddamn autocorrect. Yeah, like, especially on phones. To sell me? I, I feel like the, the Discord app updated and it doesn't work as well on my phone. And I feel like I'm getting more of that shit now where I just, yeah, like, I had to it lags. To somebody what T9 was the other day. What? Yeah, T9. T9. I had, um. What is that? Oh, is that the SMS, like the old, uh, like the yeah, old uh, nine yeah. button? Wait, you use that? Yeah, man, my first cell phone had Oh. That. Oh, what the hell? It was kind of oh, like... You're talking about there. like some herbal, herbal mixture that you were going to try to sell to a stub bag. Have you tried the new T9? Have you me? tried the new sandwich oh, supplements? Like... I'm looking to take this channel a different direction. <laughs> it's three times more powerful. We got our first donation, so now it's time to go. Time to pull Ooh, out the Hussite hand the cannon, baby. But now, uh, uh, this isn't, wasn't an autocorrect thing, but I was uh, chatting with this girl, and we had plans to hang Shit. out one day. You're and beaming in. She had to cancel the day of because something like came up, and um, what is she said something afterwards about like, you know, she she apologized that you know. There was a bunch of shit going on. She said that she probably wouldn't be able to make time to, to actually see me. And I said, well, I respect that. And I said, thanks for letting me know. And, you know, there's no sense trying to force it. And I was trying to be very mature about it. I was quite proud of myself. And I found out I had misread the text. She said that she did intend on making time to see me. And now I felt like a fucking idiot because I just basically called oh. this off with her. Oh, why on earth? You literally read the opposite of what she said. Yeah. Damn. For a minute, Ouch. I thought you were doing a bit, but this is actually a true story, and now I just feel sad. <laughs> well, Doom Damn, Doomerson you... says, Doom Kid, suggest me a wad. I probably have it. I want to play. Doom Doomerson also says, don't say sun laws. I was waiting Under. for a bunch of white No, no, I'm kidding. Um, let's see. Sunderwear, yeah. Put on your... No, um... You got to put on your underwear? <laughs> The, the one shirt. I most recently thought about was Beta Labs 1 and 2, which I really enjoyed. So that's the one I most recently thought about that's actually good. So if you haven't played those, check those out. What is that? What it's the alive. fuck is that? Speaking oh of God. what is that? That's a what evil the... sausage. That looks that's like a demonic meat. sausage. Those things are like so them. cute. Oh my God. I love like, how Stanway yeah, has the obsession. Everything he kills, he has to kill. <laughs> Look at the way they talk! <laughs> <laughs> They're like spiders They're where their waiting. legs just like go straight up. They're waiting. Yeah, they're oh. presenting. That's, uh, these are cool enemies, though. Is these well, rib these are, are... Look at these the psychotic rib cages. Spiders are the opposite. The hydraulics in their legs, like, kind of deteriorate after they die, so they curl. Yeah. Yeah. And then, like, you have to watch out because they hit scan you. So Spiders? Spiders? Oh, yeah. right. Yeah, yep. Unless they're the small ones. Oh. Um, 
let's see. Uh, What's Beta Labs? Uh, oh yeah, so Beta Labs is yeah. That's um, it's a really interesting set of two episodes, I think, for Doom One, that use a lot of the Alpha and Beta Doom resources. So like it, you know, it used to have a much sort of like more silver shiny feel, and some of the weapon sprites changed. You'll recognize some of them because I've used some of the Alpha sprites as well. Is that an one. old one? Oh, uh, no, this is a more recent one, 2018, so not that old. Okay. Um, I think I might have played this one. Don't gawk. It sounds familiar, and I think I created a save file under it called it Beta as Fuck. <laughs> Dude, um, I'm not trying to shit on Doom Zero by saying this, because I don't think it's a bad one, but Beta Labs kind of struck me as, like, a better executed version of similar ideas, I guess. Yeah, I think I've heard of Beta Labs, actually. I might put that down as something to check out, because I like the idea of, like, using beta assets. Alpha. Yeah. Yeah, Doom always called it the Alpha. There was never oh, a release called it's called Beta, beta Labs. That's why it confused me. There was the press <laughs> release beta. Not your fault. Um, oh, oh, yeah, that's right. Press release beta. Do you guys no, like this, uh, this fun uh, amusement park ride? It's got, like, the swans, and there's, like, what looks like a gorilla or something in the middle. Is that about swans? See some swans? Oh my god. Swan. Swan. What? Like, what's going on? Which I album? I have to go cut a pizza. Yeah, I have to go album? get oh, a drink. Wonder Swan? Are you talking about the, the greatest gaming thing ever, the Wonder Swan? So, no. Nobody's talking about that. Uh, so oh, when I yeah, first got to this, sandwich. when I first got to this, I was actually a bit confused. You actually have to get on this thing. I played this first episode. There's actually a bottle of something something up there. A little some some. You gotta get on this. Ah, thing. I think it's a bit hard to get that one actually. Um, but there's you a bottle like of you something. Almost got it, like... Yeah, I'm not. I might just save to for the for the video here. Oh, it's it's the thing where like you, you press jump. jump you press jump. Oh, yeah, I'm not sure how. <sighs> Okay, oh, the quick load's super quick. A there secret's been a bottle of wine. Nice. Oh, uh oh. I'm a little. Uh -oh. oh, shit. Okay, I got my health back up, and now it's a little bit. <laughs> and uh, we're just getting tipsy. Yeah, what slot is that? Oh, it's in the zero slot. Might as well use the rest of it. Nobody, nobody can know. Okay. Um, that is the weirdest fucking design for a ride. Like a gorilla in the middle and all these. <laughs> I know, right? This, you shit. know what's funny is that's probably based on a real thing too, because like, I think a, a bunch of stuff in this mod is based on stuff from that time period. I didn't even. Think, I wasn't uh, thinking from any time period. It's just weird. Oh shit. Oh. Hello? Hey, it looks look exactly like the GoldenEye pistols. What, what's up, Wooster? The PP7. I, I thought you said my name. I, yeah, I think this is a Makarov, pizza. basically. Yeah, you were right, I was thinking the PP7. Yeah. But what did you say, Wooster? You were kind of blurry there. Oh, I just, I got a minute. pizza. Did I get anything from that? Oh, pizza. You you know, I think I went the wrong way. The and you look in the mirror and you say Wilster Wonkles three times, he appears in the bed. He appears in the behind, pizza. He appears behind you with a slice of pizza. Did I go the wrong Did way? I, what, what, what's, what flavor pizza? What toppings? Uh, this is pepperoni. It's a very basic pizza, but that's the way I like it. Basic no, I'm what they would call. I am what they would call a basic bitch. Um, okay, maybe I oh, am still confused like your, about this. You don't like your food that's supposed to be simple to be overly complicated, overthought, overwrought bullshit that takes itself too seriously, so you're a simpleton? Is that what they're saying? Overwrought bullshit. Oh, that's how. <laughs> Guys. Over oh, he's a boss. He's like a mancubus gorilla. He's a he's gorilla. He's a fucking kid. mancubus gorilla. Does he shoot? Or does he just jump at you? I don't know. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. Oh, shit! What? Yep, he's a mancubus. Oh, shit! <laughs> Give me the fucking... Yeah. Um, um, a mancurilla? Like a... <laughs> A gorillaculus? Gorillaculus. Oh uh, boy, I barely survived. I forgot you're actually just supposed to shoot that guy. 
That's actually kind of hard to know, like, if you've never done it before. Like, oh, you shoot the gorilla. Oh, yeah. yeah. Doom Zero the gorilla is definitely... shoots back. You're at the uh, you know, if I was... casually. What? Oh, if Jesus. I was Harambe, I would have just pulled out an AK and, like, shot them back, you know? If I saying. was Harambe, I'd pull out an AK. <laughs> no. Please, no. And then I flip that clip and spray that bitch for Big Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's a lyric from Future that sounds all kinds of wrong. I know. Future! <laughs> there we go. It looks like we've gotten all the monsters. Uh, I barely got it. Mash ringing, mash ringing, flash ringing. Oh, I actually got a uh, chibi yeah, for something. I don't know what. Flasher. Too bad that didn't kill me. What did I get that for? Kill all monsters in a level? Play. I hadn't done that oh, yet? Quiet. Man, I suck at this game. It's mayonnaise no, Patrick. An instrument? No, Patrick, mayonnaise is not an instrument. Sewage Our treatment plant. Is not an instrument either. I picked up the Soviet shotgun. Do instruments Wilster? of torture count? Wilster is a pretty good uh, impression of Squidward. I'm, I like Frog it. sewage treatment plant. Squidward, 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 Squidward. <laughs> Are you Squidward? The ba ba The ba 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 The ba ba Squidward? Oh. Uh, she's Squidward? Squidward I'm no. Squidward! I picked up Kifli, <laughs> which I guess is some sort of bread. How can you possibly have fun playing with a leaf blower? Why is it every time I pick up a weapon, it's bad? <laughs> Why is it every time I pick up an item, this sound clip plays? Can't but you keep it I'm down, Spongebob, boiling, I'm trying right, no. to be boring. <laughs> I thought you said we were going to the park, Sandy! <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah. Sandy's a girl? <laughs> Duh, I don't know, Spongebob. Does this turn into the stream, stream Bob Squarepants? <laughs> I, mean, I mean, I already have Spongebob on a thumbnail, not this one, but... It's it's been it's been established. On the Sandy and Friends one, of course. Yeah. I I do I have what wanted to add some other people, on? but uh, you know, it's it's like I have to come up with the idea and put you know, make it up and everything. Can I be sorry, you've got all the important ones there. No, true good. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Right. You are gonna finish your dessert and you are gonna like it! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you got him! They got chocolate. <laughs> I remember when they invented chocolate. I always hated it. I knew nothing good would come from you city folk and your flying machines. <laughs> I love the young people. <laughs> How many times do we have? Teach you this lesson, old man. <laughs> Mrs. Puff! What? Mrs. Puff! I'm here, Mrs. Puff! Oh no, SpongeBob! <laughs> Why, SpongeBob? Why? <laughs> ah, jeez! Oh, my leg! Yeah, who's, doing, who's doing the uh, Miss Big Head impression? What? That was the bag. Mrs. Puff? <laughs> That's it. No, I'm kidding. They're great! Dog pulls from the Rocco's I, Modern I Life. I haven't thought of that in a long time. Oh my god, that show is fucking great. There it was, was a, um, a movie for that that came out just a few years ago. Heifer? Remember Heifer? Oh okay. shit. Boy, Heifer! Uh, I don't know, I haven't seen it. I just know it exists. I figure, you know, maybe you Rocco's Modern guy? Life fans would want to know about it. Well, those backpacks just popped off. Have you guys seen the new yeah, what are they to... No. <laughs> oh my god, it's so fucking funny. I like it. I'm not surprised. I always loved the original Beavis and Bloodhead. And the one in 2006 or whatever as well, I thought that was really funny too. Beavis and Bloodhead do America? 
Oh no, right. there was a, no, that was a movie. That was funny. But there was like they did oh. an eighth season like years after the first seven. But it just it oh, blended yeah. in perfectly. I do like how uh, it, you know to go along with the atmosphere, you don't get a ton of health. Uh, so you, it does feel a little bit survivally. If you're into that, cool. and this is on this is on the the just the normal difficulty. Uh, I'm not sure exactly if the uh, harder one, like if that might just tweak damage or if that will actually tweak pickups. I'm not sure. It's not my wallet. Oh, the oh shit! Oh, that's the key. Are you Patrick Star? Yeah. And I found this driver's license in this wallet. Uh -huh. Then that would make this your wallet. It's not my wallet. <laughs> I should be using the pistols more because I keep thinking it's going to be the same ammo, but as the SMG, but it's not. Arr, PP7 armor. Don't use up all your PP7, dude. Yeah, man, don't use all your PP. <laughs> uh, yeah. Fine. Oh shit. <laughs> I was done. Um... I was hanging out with some people like uh, the weekend before last, and this one girl out with was the like, really trying. To... I was hanging out with uh... some people on the weekend. You fool! Listen calling to people to me. handle that one, dude. <laughs> calling people fools now. Oh, by the way, the reload here is the reload is actually the fucking flip from dusk, except it actually does. Re oh my god, dude, you got fucked up by that. Damn. Dude, I don't remember who it was, but like somebody legitimately got mad at Gordon Ramsay for calling people donuts. You I'm fucking donut. <laughs> yeah, he was like, dude, Gordon, man, stop calling people donuts, man. It's not cool. It's like seriously, like, got literally offended by it. I mean, that is not okay. Of yeah, all the dude. different insults he's come out with, I'm surprised they picked Donut to be the one that they're I know, right? Them. What the I fuck? I forgot about these guys. Donut. They're fucking flying heads or something. There's a head, a Greek head or something. Greek heads. There's definitely some weird experimentation stuff going on here. They like fly around. The drone. Yeah, I forgot about that. Is this is this made in the Quake engine? I don't think so. No, no it's, it's like a, a Unity engine, thing, probably. Oh, the Kex engine or whatever. Oh, really? Yeah, they they wrote the engine themselves. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's really they cool. They did a good job capturing the best of the Quake engine, I feel like. Well, like they were saying earlier, like it sort of looks like software engine in some ways, but kind of like an interest. Like, well, it is you... software, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Is it? it, it looks... Yeah, it's software. It's not like... Uh, I guess because you can that run on your computer or software sandwich, duh. Uh, I mean, like you can actually. Yeah, you like, you okay, I thought there was more of a. There's just a resolution slider, which is funny. Like, look, you can go super clean. So it actually is a bit. It's actually. Uh, it looks like it's OpenGL or something. You could just turn up the. Uh, the pixel. Which I think that's I think that was the default that it was on, but I don't know. I would not recommend turning this resolution up because like. I'm gonna choose to believe that you're wrong. It looks like this, and. Uh, Why is the resolution a percentage? Yeah, I know, right? It, it's it's basically just um, a sort of pixel filter. Turn it down as low as it'll go. It's a pixel filter type thing. Uh, let me try that. Hey, bio. I'm back. Hey, bio. Yeah, this is the bio. lowest yeah. it'll go. Did you finish those errands? It looks the same. <laughs> what? Is that a joke? Yeah. No, he's not finished with those errands, and he never will be. <laughs> oh. oh. It's a custom engine that says dark. Yeah, calls, sandwich. So. It's a joke. <laughs> Getting kind of bored. Oh, is that a joke? <laughs> God, guys, come on. Fucking don't, don't try to make. Oh, funny I don't get ones. the joke, SpongeBob. <laughs> I need to yeah, get my work. The ceiling is right. You're not a very good employee. Well, what happened, Wilster? Can I have some food now? <laughs> no. 
nothing. I like how the the conch gets some fucking attitude with Squidward in there. <laughs> Dude, that, that as a kid, that fucking broke me, but also made me laugh. <laughs> no. was hilarious. There's I a way was, to go uh, down with some people. Bad friend, but couldn't stop laughing at it. What was that, Wilster? I was hanging out with some people, and this one girl was like really trying to like hit on me. I guess she was really into me, uh, whatever. But uh, and I, I mentioned at <laughs> one point that I feel like guys? I don't believe I, it. I was mentioning it. I mentioned at one point that I like Spongebob. She's like, I like Spongebob too. And I just like, like, yeah, everybody likes Spongebob. What, what's your point? Yeah, that, it, 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 that's, that is something you could say to a date. It was not a date. This was okay. not a date. Okay. I was just there. Like she was, I was there with other people. She was there with other people. And Wolster basically did the fucking strangest thing ever. A girl said ah! something like, hey, we have a <laughs> common interest. That. I was waiting for you to get near the I was waiting for you to get near the excavator. Oh, so you oh, you, play, you know this you. well, Bio, huh? I want to hear Doom Kid say the thing. I know uh, E1 fairly well. I ha I haven't caught up with Atrot in or Hirot in a while. Um, yeah, I haven't so played I haven't, Episode I've... Two either. No. But, Long uh, live the homeland, by the way. Vlasti Zor. That's not it. no. I I haven't I have played. Really like... I played Hirot really early. Um, when he had re first released the um, half the episode, the first episode, so I haven't too. gotten to play with all the uh, new updates and stuff. Yeah, I, I played it way back when it. as well, and I uh, I don't know if this updates much for episode one. I'm not sure I remember a kick being in the in it when no, I played it. No, the kick wasn't there before, and there's a a double barrel shotgun. There's all new there's all these other weapons and stuff. It all look it's just great, and I'm really happy. Of how far the dev has come in such a short time frame. Oh yeah, I absolutely really love it. Doom Kid, what were you gonna say? Oh no no no! Please can go on. <laughs> come on, dude. I wanted to. No, hear I, I'm, I'm kidding. Son I'm of totally a bitch. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, so um, I fucking can't remember. It's been fucking ten minutes ago now. A million years ago. Oh, it shit. was about Wonkles rejecting advances from Ooh, some girl. Okay. What was the context of this girl telling you that she loved? Because, like, what are, I want to tell you what it sounded like, Mister. It sounded like, um... Oh. That, wasn't, some, that wasn't a thing before. <laughs> oh. Some girl just Man, randomly, like, started You're talking so to you. At a, <laughs> I have no idea. I, Jiggy I'm, I'm breaky. <laughs> Some girl started talking to you at a party and tried to like tell you she had a common interest. I already in don't believe it. Like... Oh my fucking god. Go. Oh. Hold hey. on, I'm, I'm gonna get a smoke. I can't handle this shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the least believable thing Wilster said to me. I'm just ever. sitting there in anticipation and then. I still don't even know what the fuck up. happened yet. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I opened. Kind of a, you haven't gotten past. He's talked to a girl. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and neither is he. I haven't got. You know. Yeah, I was gonna say that. You stupid asshole. Like, <laughs> doing a joke. Oh shit! Ah, oh, what the fuck? Helicopter time. Oh yeah. So Wilster, it sounds like a girl just came up to you and was like, "Oh, I'm interested in SpongeBob," and you were just. Ran this girl's in totally into me, that. guys. I Look at this dumb. Oh my god. No, 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 no. She, she was. The, you, you don't know the whole story. Like she was definitely very. Oh, I'm sure she no, was. I didn't. Well, so I you're didn't a very attractive out man. Loud. Sandwich. You have no idea. No. Uh, but I didn't say out loud. I can't like, say so attractively. Man. Like, yeah, everybody's. Uh, in this, I didn't say that part. You know, I just okay. thought it really, okay. really hard and tried telepathically making her feel it with my body language. Okay, we've yeah, established that right. much. What else? What else? This is, this is fairly recently. Orange to tell you while everyone else... Oh, I'm sorry. I thought there was a secret for a second, but I guess no. Like, shooting those electrical panels are usually progression. Also, that's a cool smoke effect, actually. But, uh, so, Sandwich, as a... Uh, sorry. Sandwich, as a citizen of Soviet Kanukistan, you can really relate to this game, huh? No? Oh, yeah. Anywhere that's not, like, ultra-capitalist is just like this. <laughs> to the one place that hasn't been affected by capitalism. Space! Hey! Hey! <laughs> Shit. 
Tim Curry is an excellent actor. I'm sad he that he's like very sick. What's going on here? Yo, man. Yeah, I've seen him lately. Just you Curry's know, one of those guys where around. no yeah. matter what part he's playing, I like he's always entertaining, and you can tell he's just having so much fun. Yeah, like it he's makes, probably makes he's so weird. good in in Home Alone two. Uh, that movie, you know. <laughs> I'm not joking. I really like Home Alone 2 and Tim Curry is like, we got you a pizza. I loved his performance as it. Is I Home Alone 2 it. not like pretty universally seen as a funny movie? Yeah. Home Alone 2 is great. great. Well, I'm, I'm surprised you picked Home Alone 2 because Tim's role is so inconsequential. How I'm about well more Darkness and Legend? That shit was sick. Why? Well, I've seen Home Alone 2 like maybe 13 times by now in my life because uh, my right. grandparents had it on VHS and every time we went to my grandparents' house, we would just watch Home Alone 2. It didn't even, it would be like July and we're watching Home Alone <laughs> 2 lost in New York. Hey, fuck it. What kind of idiots do you have working here? The finest in New York. <laughs> like I, I said, I think... Either his role is it or Satan in that movie Legend with Tom Cruise. That shit was fucking awesome. <sighs> Soup main course cake. Are you so anxious? <laughs> Thank you. Blood. Blood. Play? Wait, what? Yeah, it's what a the little fuck. Um, it's a little game. It's I don't think I ever of, saw this. Like, you know, like, like uh, Tiger Electronic, those crappy yeah. Tiger Electronic ones. So he's made one of those. <laughs> It's a Wait. Mr. Game and Watch. But this is like <laughs> Mr. Spritz of the Otiets. <laughs> Wait, how do you. Why oh, you have to go up. I see. <laughs> Why are some languages just so inherently angry? Like you just It just <laughs> sounds like people are screaming and <laughs> rage. And Spritz the Gonyevskis, Gabadadu. No! Uh, you lose. I, I gotta, I gotta, now that I know what I'm doing. This is pretty, I don't you think I, lose. I don't know if I missed this. Do you remember if this was in the original? Oh, Game Jesus. Uh, I think this is a new edition. I don't remember it being. Is that wait and see? Wait, this is from a famous Russian cartoon, New Pagodi? Pagodia? Dark Pulse knows all this crazy shit. I don't know how. I mean, I, I, I would like, be surprised if it was a reference in. to a real thing, because uh, a lot of the stuff that's in the game is reference to real stuff, real historical yeah, stuff that yeah. happened in, in Czech Republic uh, during this time. Fuck. <laughs> well, das I don't know. I don't know if there, I don't know how, like if you get something for getting a certain. Probably not. This is just a funny little thing. Why is there a guy throwing a this pizza at me? This isn't the game trailer. Hot! Yeah, this oh, is just the whole trailer. <laughs> oh, it's really nice to build this other game around this uh, game and watch. If you had the Game Boy Advance version of the Monster House game, you could play um, Thou Art Dead, like that game that Skull plays at the arcade. That was an unlockable mini game after you beat the game. Is there it's a like rabbit yelling Eternal, at me? You can play. You can play the full Doom Two on Doom Eternal on his little computer and his uh, desk. Oh, I got pretty far too. Not over yet. Not over yet. It's ah. not over yet. The trick is to know that the egg still has to be oh. in the air. Oh, oh fuck. I fucked up anyway. Oh, jeez. You can do it, Wedgie. It's actually pretty yeah. hard. You can't do it. That might it. be unlocked. There's a, a dank stuff section of the menu that might un unlock that. Um, go to the main menu. I like anyway. how dank went from like being related to smoking weed to just like anything weird now. It's just called dank. When's the last time you heard anybody refer to anything as dank? It was Only really as a popular joke. like... Uh, five years ago, I would say, was when it was really popular. Yeah, exactly. Um, although I saw an image one time that kind of described it perfectly. It was like, no, Tim, we don't say dank anymore. We say based, like the cool Discord kids. <laughs> Hell! <laughs> the cool Discord uh... kids? Just yeah. Yeah, not you. What? 
Yeah, that's I'm a loser. Dick anymore. That's not I didn't realize dick. there were cool Discord anything. Come on, Dad! We don't say dank anymore! God! Now it's well, based! Hey, and, uh, I, yeah, that, yeah. That, that's that's like, based on what? Oh, based on what? You said base, but we didn't finish the sentence. Based on what? It's no, just based. Dad, it's some middle-aged father it. in the world walked into his son's room in the year 2022 of our Lord, and he and he came in and he was like, are you browsing those dank memes, son? And his <laughs> son just like went, Dad, it, nobody says that anymore. And he's like, I thought I was going to be cool, but I am drool. <laughs> he like starts trying to pull out all the stops because he's like, doesn't know, and he just comes into his son's room with like a blunt, and he's just smoking mad weed. He's like, "Come on, son, let's be cool." He's like, "Dad, I've been smoking weed for like ten years. It's not that cool." Dad, I'm straight Damn edge. It. I just started okay. listening to my friend. <laughs> didn't so actually realize that. Like, um, didn't realize Sonic that the, the key, uh, the key things actually show up on the map. Yeah, That's real bad, man. I could totally see that. Yeah, well, that's great. Now, Dad. Now it's all about ah. now it's all about not not masturbating and being unusually mean to women. <laughs> that's where it's, that's where, where, where everyone's cool on the internet now. Apparently. Do you actually believe biodegradable that those people are not just like the most furious like coom brains that have ever lived? Like really, <laughs> they're definitely they angry all the time. <laughs> Can you use your better mic? Why? Please. <laughs> oh, I missed one monster. I think no, his I, mic I won't. Might not hear him. Dub Dubbag's mic is just as shitty, but I I won't I won't harass him about it. But but Wilster. Yeah, but Dubbag doesn't it? own a better mic, to, you know. Wilster literally owns yeah, it. Dub, uh, Dub has the excuse that that's the only one he has. Yeah. Right. Wilster? I yeah. mean, I do have Bother. another one. I do have another one, but I can't use it as a headset, and I'd have to, like, hold... I used it for a couple months, remember? I had to use a different mic, oh. but... Oh, yeah. I've got another one now. So I kind of don't have an excuse, but I don't care. That's the thing. You can hear me. You have me, to right? hold it, you said. Not anymore. I got another headset. So my mic is literally ten dollars. That's all it cost. Sokol Jim. I mean, if you have I'm a better mic, better. I think it would I be nice. Like we will be able to hear you better. Cards and shit. Whoa! If you if you tell. get a if you get a better mic, we'll be able to hear you better. The viewers will be able to hear you better. Like, be, uh, your caller, go ahead. Be nice. Yeah, uh, Sandwich, long time listener, first time caller. God, that hurt me. I just wanted to say, uh, these guys that are on your stream, I don't like them, man. You gotta get these dudes off. That dub bag dude, I can't listen to him no more. Hey, go back to fucking your sister. <laughs> yeah, wait, that's my sister to fuck. <laughs> How can we start a family if we ain't even family to begin with? Wow. That's what I'm saying. The royal mindset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll throw a fucking bunch of, slap. A bunch of weirdos, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Will throw a better mic. Wacky. Can you tell me where it is? Where is it, actually? I don't know. What the fuck? Got these fucking guys again. What's your current mic? Is it like just a cheap little Xbox 360 headset? Pretty much, yeah. Mine is an on headset with like a little like bendable oh, microphone I can put in front of my mouth and then like just headphones. It's it works fine. It's gr fine. Mine it's is one of, of the uh -oh. several generations older Yeti Blue mics. So hopefully it's mm -hmm. coming through reasonably clear on your guys' end. Yeah. At this point, I kind yes. of view it as part of my vocal identity on these, like, Mine's a, a Samson Meteor. Yours sounds good, Bio. Bio and Sans in particular are very crisp. I have to look I up what mine something. is. Am I just, like, average, like usual? Is that supposed to be a Snacks dig is, 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 like, above dubs and Wilsters substantially, but it's it only captures the high end in your voice. It sounds like it's very like oh, there it's skewed towards the high end. It oh shit, like. that's a secret. 
It's kind I, of the other way around. I'm already if high, losing. If I make high pitched hissing noises. It doesn't pick up. It's very rude. Well, That's a Discord's weird up about picking up uh, high pitched and loud stuff. Like it just like cuts off. Um, I had to change my settings around. I think it's better now. I noticed that Sandwich just streams when I when I sometimes I will laugh. It's I'll be the only person to laugh at something that someone says. But I'll watch the stream. Like I don't watch the whole thing. Oh I'll yeah, you go watch. silent when you laugh loud, so it just sounds like nobody's laughing. Yeah. And it's kind of hilarious. It immediately cuts you off as soon as you laugh. So like, that's uh, I, that used to happen to me at Discord because it's um, it's so uh, I don't know which one it is. I ended up turning all the filters off and all the like, whatever. Yeah, just all the audio filters, and now it doesn't do it. But I don't know which one the culprit was. I'm using my other it. microphone. Does this sound any different? Does yeah, it sounds Adam, better. way better. It sounds like Adam, a thousand times better. Adam, when you laugh, you might just like the loudest honking sound, so your microphone immediately dies. Yeah. Well, it's, it's Discord. I don't think it's the microphone. My guitar. I think I made Adam laugh because he's quiet all of a sudden. It's really funny that yeah, <laughs> yeah he just gets so quiet. Laugh. It's. I know he's laughing. <laughs> I well, sometimes I actually have to wonder like, is he laughing? See, is I don't it? like using this microphone because I'm scared to like, because I can't. I don't have a headset with it, and my headset does not work in my jack, or otherwise it'll crash my computer because my computer is a piece of shit. I don't want to catch your guys' conversation on my microphone and cause a feedback loop. That's why. Red Army Street. Yeah, you, yeah, ha you have a reason, I guess, to not use if it. You ha fine. Just keep your microphone reasonably far away from your speakers. It works for me. I'm using a desk mic. Now I gotta hold it though, like I'm on stage at the improv. Wait, why can't you just? <laughs> why can't you just use a headset with that microphone? You can use both. Because I just told you that my computer, it's got this weird ass thing where like if I plug the headphones into it, it just like completely shuts off my sound system. I don't know what it is. It's what? weird. Also, I don't really have a good pair of headphones. My, I'm, dude, I, I don't, I'm poor, bro. It's the funny I'm thing poor. is, Dub, I can hear what you actually sound like now. Whereas yeah. usually it's like some weird cell phone call being recorded through a tin can. Look, it's uh, it's absolutely fine if you're if you can't use a mic because of tech troubles or whatever. Like I have no issue. Do I sound that. sexy now? Yes. yes. Okay. Cool. Yes. Elevator. Let's look around first. Grenade. I honk when I laugh. Well, I'm not that I don't. I rarely honk when I laugh. <laughs> Object in socialist care of the Consumer Cooperative Supervisory <laughs> Committee. <laughs> Is that a goose? Is that no? Just Adam finding something funny. Footwear. You're, let me tell me your name. Call me Adam always rather than bio. Now I need to know your name. Buffet yeah. espresso. <laughs> Fruit it's uh, just saying Dinky just sounds awkward to me. I don't know why. It's like, I Why? can't nickname. Just Adam. The Adam, 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 Adam. It's just easier. It's quicker. Ah, it's partly yeah, it's skimmed it's milk. My favorite. Semi skimmed milk. Sorry. I know what Sandwich's first name is, but I don't want to tell anyone in case he's never told anyone. I have not told anyone. How'd you know? A secret <laughs> Doom World powers. I could say, oh, Doom World, my knows. email address, most likely. Yeah. Sandwich. Sandwich, I know who you are, Ian Brandon Anderson. <laughs> what I will say is bravo, Sandwich, bravo. <sighs> okay. You know the meme I'm referring to, don't you? No. Sorry. Okay, okay. I mean, I'm not, like, I actually, I need to actually change my PayPal address because, yeah, I think it shows my email or whatever, I don't know. Yeah, you uh, balling now, so you gotta fucking start. <laughs> I did get a tip earlier. I don't know if you saw that, dude, kid. It was quite exciting. Oh, someone uh, tipped you on. Uh, on how did they do it? You don't PayPal. Have to oh, okay. I, I'm PayPal. using uh, Stream Elements, and they have like a PayPal tip page thing. And... Oh shit! What? Pete, how much money did they give you? Five bucks Canadian. Yo. Yeah, that's cute. That's at least one gumdrop. They gave him one billion dollars. Five dollar Canadian is roughly the same as five dollars. But it's uh, it's Electro Pirate who also boosted my server, and he's uh, he's been telling me to do a Patreon for a bit, and uh, I think uh, until I do that, I just you know that's a way to support me and the channel. Uh, 
Don't really want to mess with Patreon quite yet. Possibly yeah, when I get a, a thousand bit, subs. A bit early for Patreon at the moment. Yeah. We need to build more of an audience for it to be sustainable. Oh shit. Gotta go in the WC. Man. The WC? Why the WC? Because uh, of the W. The w what? Dude, I didn't I didn't look at the machine. door of the restroom. I thought you were referring to that dumbass yeah. channel called the WC. Uh, Have you no, heard of that before? No. There's a scene. Okay. Sand, jump on top of the washing machine, then press the use key. I think that's like a shredding machine. No, it's not. It's a washing machine. You'll get a, an achievement. You're not jumping on achievement top of unlocked. it. Queen it's a washer is. drum. We. <laughs> Woo! Are you... gonna blow Ladies up. and gentlemen, game of the year, Throck. Jump on top of it. I, I am. Telling you that that... I am, oh, doofus. <laughs> I, I don't know. You're I'm watching YouTube, aren't you? Doofus. Yeah, I am. I don't yeah. know how yeah. you have to sit on it or whatever to get the achievement to unlock, or maybe just check your achievements. No, I, you I, it, it, just, uh, it just popped up. Oh, okay, there you go. There yeah, you go. thanks. W-O, wash, wash coon. Wash coon. I <laughs> posted this five minutes ago. Okay, let's see. That's what I think of your WC. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Fuck it's yeah. Stood for, like, the WC. I think it's for, like, the women's channel or something like that. West Coast, baby. <laughs> it's either the women's channel or West Coast. <laughs> You don't want to mix those up either. <laughs> it's the wash closet. Yeah, wash the closet wall. actually might. That's a European no, thing, right? No, the, the water closet. Water closet? Oh. Is that. Yeah. You see that in that's Australia? Or? Water yeah. water no, 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 no. But it is really an actual. Water, water closet is an actual uh, nickname for, for toilet or bathroom or whatever. Yeah. So what, do they, what do they say in Australia? The dunny. We call, it, we call it the loo or the dunny. The loo. Ah, the loo dunny. Toilet, the loo. Dunny. You can't keep water in a closet. It's just gonna leak out. Fucking dunny's clogged. Oh shit. Well, anyway, it doesn't stand for water. It stands for waste can because you dump your ass in it. That's all. It's doing. <laughs> <laughs> Magic cough gecko street. Magic cough gecko? What Magic are you cart. saying? Fishing prohibited. Yeah, I can see that. I don't know why you'd need a sign for that. I don't know if anyone's really gonna be... They're pretty hungry in Czechoslovakia, man. Don't yeah. eat fish. They're full of microplastics. I'll eat whatever I want. I'm already full of microplastics. I think the mercury is what's gonna get Whoa. you first. I the eat average a lot American of fish. eats like a fucking credit card a month worth of plastic at this point. <laughs> I'm not even making that shit up. I wish I was. Wait, who? You. <laughs> Me? Yeah. I don't eat fish. Wait, you, eat you guys... Regularly. It can't be an Xbox... Uh... Not true. <laughs> oh, okay. Dark Pulse is just saying stuff. Uh... What are you saying, Dork Pulp? <sighs> Got him. Dork. I oh. came out that way. These like a speaker system, I guess. Oh. Maybe what I want mercury I... poisoning. Okay. What the? They're teleporting. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Quit it. Nightmarish. It's it's fucking nightmarish. No. Radiation poisoning and mercury poisoning are two of the most horrifying things that you can possibly think of. I disagree. <laughs> Let's, oh, yeah, really? let's keep it at that. Yeah, I mean, hey, I we'll can this map that. looks really good, dude. Garage. Uh -huh. I wish I made a map for this. Are you looking at it in the editor or in game? No, no, I'm playing it. This is the first time I've okay. ever actually played a Wilster map. Wait a minute. Oh. Can you get on my uh, app? I, I was your reading your huh? chats. I just. I will. I... Sorry, what'd you say, Sam? Uh, Dark Pulse says nobody reads my chats because nobody loves me. <laughs> Oh, well, that's, <laughs> that's okay, Dark. I've read a bunch of okay. Dark Pulse's chats out loud. Yeah, me don't too. Be, don't be so hard on yourself. I bet your mom used to love you. <laughs> yeah, Squidward's look at it, the bright side of life. Him. Before she had other better children. 
<laughs> His first name is Trellbalot. So, I don't know. I have a key, but I can also go in this direction. Um, maybe Dude, I'll check out the key. I don't know anyone here's first name, and everyone knows my first name. That's fucking bullshit. You know, my well, name is... Your, your, name is your name is public record on Doom Wiki. Don't blame me. Well, I've, already, I've already shared my first name with you. <laughs> Snacks, you did? Really? Yeah, did you forget my name? No, uh, if I rack my brain hard enough, I'm sure I'll remember. I, I said it during this stream. I actually did. Yeah. I know Snakey's name because she because uh, she hired me to um you know uh edit that uh trailer for her. So I have seen her name in an email. I'm all about my name. Like a lot of people, my name is just out there. Yeah, I'll just say it. Call me a it. dub. Uh, as a med kit. Dubbington. Dub Dubbington. There you go. No. What's, what's your what? name? John Goldeen or something like that? Yep. <laughs> oh, that's, that's a good one. I can remember John easily. No, my name my name is uh my name is, is uh, what? Uh, my, my name, name is, is... <laughs> My name is you. <laughs> my name is <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, no, oh, that took me too fucking long to get. God damn it. <laughs> My name is Hugh Mungus. My, so, my name so is... Snacks' name is Sarah, and Dub's what? name is John. Okay, I... No, Dark Pulse is, saying. like, seriously responding to me, being like, my mom's still alive, so she still does love me. She's already told me I'm her favorite of three children. Yeah, whatever. Okay, good for you, Dark Pulse. I'll give you all a hint. My name was Sarah. You're getting, you're getting pranked, fam. Bell my name here. does start with a J, but it's not John. Uh, Joseph? Jason. Yep. My name is Jay. I did remember it as soon as you said Jay. Hi. I think you said it in a Doom World post at some point. Jay. Oh, Zay. And my name's Tazon Day. Wilster's name is Willie, of course. Naturally. <laughs> Sandwedge's name is Sandy, right? Yeah. Yep. Sandy. Sandwedge's name, but it's confidential for the moment. You can just. You could just call me old Orange Joe. Yeah, I'm not really happy. Mm -hmm. I'm not really interested in having it out there at the moment. You can call me old Yellow Snake. Uh, oh shit. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this seems like it's gonna be a pitched battle of some sort. There's a cage match. Should fight yeah, a cage. I I would not have put my name out there if I had, uh, if I had looked into the future and seen what the fucking internet would become. I just destroyed this. Statue. I know what your name is, Doom Kid. Don't worry, fam. You'll you'll be alright. Bio's name is Terry. <laughs> <laughs> He's the original Terry. No, I saw him. Terry. 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 Nah. He sounds, he sounds like a I'm going to have you all raped by imps. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, it's so fucking Terry. <laughs> Hi there, Bruce. Yeah, Bio's name's just Bruce. It has to be. Yeah, yeah the Monty Python, Python sketch, everybody's named Bruce. Hi there, this is Bruce here. Yeah, that's Bruce. Yeah, it's not Bruce. Yeah, that's Bruce. So what's your name? Just, like, talking <laughs> gear around. Yeah. I'm pretty sure when they did that, well, that like scary. live with an audience, they'd just like be throwing like real beer cans into the audience for them to chug <laughs> while they were doing it. <laughs> Only there, Bruce. <laughs> Everyone, that's what Dark Ball says. Honestly, Bruce isn't that typical of a name down here. Like, I've never even met down anyone under. Bruce. Bruce is not hello. I have no idea why it's said to be a common Australian that name. That lock's here, folks. Harry is definitely a more common name in Australia than Bruce. <laughs> Harry is <laughs> not a common it's name. Not most common names I come across are people whose names start with an M, so like Matthew or Michael. There's or, a fucking uh, billion Johns here. Yeah, billions of Matts and Michaels in my experience. But Everyone's name I is have a Matt or Michael. Both of my grandparents, their names were James, and I have like four uncle James. Everybody Ooh. I know around where I live is called either Jose or Lewis. What the fuck? Dude. Lightning gun. I, I had those lightning gun. There was that twenty. Oh, lightning gun. Okay. 
There's 20 to 30 people at my old uh, uh, demolition thing that I used to do. And three of them were named Nathan. It was really fucking weird. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That's crazy because the, the, job I work at, the job I work at is only a staff of eight people, and there's three people named Jason, so that's interesting. <laughs> that's really odd. Do they say they're seeking Jasons? Yes. <laughs> um, and then I tell them, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know where he is either. Is that Jason, where they got you? Jason, where are your <laughs> Sports club. Spartak Yadni Street. Spartak Yadni. Oh, the soccer. Kick a goal. Warning, falling plaster. <laughs> Kick a goal, Sam. That's another achievement. Rooster, I like this map. I already got I've it, been, I think, yeah. I've been wandering around in it for a while. You did great lighting. Yeah, that took like three hours and a lot of like weird sector trickery to like make the floor and ceiling different brightnesses. I gotta show you, my, mine is nowhere near as developed as yours is, Wilster. God, you guys are so fast. What do you mean? I'm not even... <laughs> I didn't do the thing, though. It's snacks. By the time my map one is complete, I have a feeling you'll have already made two. Maybe. We'll see what happens. She'll have made an entire episode's worth. Professionals. Well, this might be a little harder, because it's following a slightly different form. Like, Snacks had a game plan with Stigney. Are you doing that, Sandwich? Are you just spinning that around? Whee! <laughs> no, I've taken control of Sandwich's stream. Oh. I, I was hoping I could roll around in it, but that's not like the motorbike. <laughs> just for fun. Yeah. Yeah, yeah nice teleport, Doom now. Breaks his legs and Doom guy has to go through the rest of it with a. I put on a wife beer. I've got armor now. I've got something in my front pocket for you. Why don't you read it? Please, how do you do? Dark Pulse says George Foreman, the boxer, named all eight of his sons George. That's, that cannot be right. That's, uh, how did you... George. What? You Foreman. made this all since last night, Wilster? Yeah, I started it yesterday. Oh shit, the basketball court. Oh, ah! I and I had to work today. So. It's the fucking... I... Ah, uh, getting it's old It's the sucks. fucking gymnastics, like, thing. Holy shit, it it's not It would've taken less time, but... George Foreman named all his sons George. George <laughs> Jr., George the Third, George the Fourth, Fifth, and six. He's a uh... wow. way to make yourself feel like a number. Quote, I named all my sons George Edward Foreman so they would always have something in common. I say to them, if one of us goes up, then we all go up together. And if one goes down, we all go down together. Uh, folks, that's getting punched in the head too much. Because I'll you know, never forget their dad's name. I disagree with what he did, but his logic, there's something there. No, <laughs> there. no, there's not. What do you mean the fucking no? He's just saying the family should stick together. Oh, there's nothing there. <laughs> so you need what? Like how fucking stupid? Like I for like who are my brothers? Oh yeah, they're all George. Thank God my dad did I'm that. George. Well, I said I don't what he did, but there's something there. You know, I can not climb these. I think there's a there's something there in like a weird childish way, I guess, of like not actually understanding oh, anything. Close-minded fuck. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna name all my kids Sandwich so that they all have something to. <laughs> I, they, you know, they all have something to be tied to, you know. My children are taking the legal name Wilster Wonkles, all of them, every single one. Man, woman, child, they're all getting the same name. Uh, one of his daughters is Georgetta. On oh, camera, TV, he's gonna... On the bright side, he's a celebrity who named it, gave, at least gave his kids a normal name and didn't name the kid Apple or something, like some people. Ash X yeah. something. But yeah, a Doom Kid, that map would have taken a lot less time, but I put like hours into the lighting, so... Do you guys want me to like check, like test or check anything out at some point? Uh, I have a map to send you. I can do that. 
I mean, obviously a private one, I assume, is what you prefer. It's just as long as it's not by someone named George Foreman, then Sandwich will lose his shit at you. No, it's okay. It's George <laughs> Foreman the seventh. George Foreman the third, actually. Oh, George I mean, Foreman's no. one through four are fucking jerks, but yeah, well, George Foreman six, seven right. makes some great do maps. George Foreman eight, <laughs> they're a little bit long and, you know, I don't know, a little bit slaughtery for my taste, but seven, George Foreman seven. He's I mean, he's a a is trying to happen. paint this as me having named all of my kids the same name. Just because I said that there's the family connection aspect. That one little... <laughs> you have a last life. name for that! What the fuck are you talking about? I'm just saying, I appreciate he's trying to keep no. his family going. He did it in a dumb all way. All of my kids have he did it in a dumb name. way. Okay, Sandwich. What else was the logic? <laughs> like? What he stated was not actually his logic. Then what was it? Uh, you know, like, his logic is I got punched in the head for a living, and now I don't know what I'm doing. That's stupid. <laughs> it's, the point, though, is not stupid. The point of sticking together with your family is not a stupid. Oh thing. yeah, the, okay. Are the kids the same thing? That's stupid. yes. That's family is not stupid, doom kid. There. Yes, you are correct. That's yes, a great point. A George Foreman said, "Family's it. not stupid." He made a great point. <laughs> That's right. That's right. That's that's why I said there's a little something there, and not the whole thing is pure that's fucking the, wisdom. That's the slogan they have on their family crest. Family not stupid. And it's in just, Latin. Their family crest is just Vin Diesel's fucking head just saying family. No, 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 it's a George Foreman grill. Oh, <laughs> who would be my brother? Now, Sandwich, you said that that's what the... last names are for, but all of my children have different last names. Okay. You could do that. I mean, once no, they grow up and marry, maybe I, or I something. The, the joke. I mean, was I got I got like five girlfriends and they all have like the same women. name. <laughs> yeah, is it seeking? No. <laughs> I mean, it could be, but it's finger one, two, and Sorry. three, four, and five. Sorry. Walk, walk. I'm gonna name my kids thing one and thing two. <laughs> I'm gonna make sure they know that they're just kids. objects to me. He's gonna give them d last names that are nothing like his own, so Palace whenever they get culture. in trouble, they can just be like, fuck them, I don't know that kid. Get him out of here. <laughs> I never seen that guy in my life. Weirdos. My yeah, see, that's the problem with George Foreman, he can't do that. He's just like, is this your child, George Foreman the third? Nah. Nah, that's someone else. That's someone else's um, kid. That's someone else's kid, man. I don't know what you're talking about. That George Thorman. Uh, Calibrex says his, his grill makes a mean grilled cheese sandwich. Yeah, anybody there have a George Foreman grill? How are they? Also, joint work for the prosperity of homeland socialism and peace. Cool. <clears throat> spreading the spreading the message. <laughs> Let's get the message out there. You know. Let's get some partly skim milk. No vowels in it. <laughs> that way I just say. What's funny? <laughs> I'm still laughing at the George Foreman shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, it's got something to it. It's like, you know, family is like a good thing, you know? I mean, you are a. I mean. It's like a good, it's like a good thing, family. I said the fact that there's a little something in there. I'm just. Like, going it's down okay, dude, kid. Family, I know what you, I know what you meant. Down. I know what you mean. Uh, and then, you know, sticking up with them when they're up too. Like, you know, going through that together as a family is a good moral, even if his way of executing it yeah, was Yeah, and stupid. you know what? You know what? It's... In order to also be more of a family, he just punched all of his sons in the head repeatedly for That's, years. I, I'm not surprised you're saying that 100% seriously. So they could like be closer just... together and they could, like, understand where each other was coming from, you know? Like, family. The concept My family of familial empathy is a lost on Sandwich. I can tell that much. <laughs> Look, I want my family to be close to the other two, and I never knew really how to do it until I saw this movie, The Human Centipede. <laughs> Palace of Culture. Like a Serbian film. <laughs> That's the best way. Uh, yeah, just it's, we like to hook up every now and then. Uh... Oh, the music is so. Um, Would you? Under... This is a, a hypothetical. Better than the George Foreman grills, the George Fiveman grill. Am I right? <laughs> Boo! <laughs> yeah, there was a, a hypothetical Boo. I saw on Twitter one time. Here's a question for the room: Would you rather have to watch your parents have sex every night of your life, 
for the rest of your life or join in once to make them stop. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Like you yes. have to be in the room with them and you have to watch it every single It's a real Sophie's choice, life. my friend. Yes. And then, what, or what if only you can one of join. my parents is alive? How does that work? The, the, well, they're, they're, they just imagine that they're not dead. Oh my god. Well, so uh, this no is way, going off the rails. One, you get to watch your one parent commit necrophilia every single night. <laughs> it was god. this was like years ago. I don't think there's much left over at this point. Oh, oh by the way, well. apparently George Foreman the third is actually a boxer. Oh, dude, Alabrax rigs a good. good I will love him and pet him and call him George. That's a great comparison. <laughs> George Third is they the Georges have nicknames. George Third is Monk. George the Fourth is Big Wheel. George the Fifth is Red. George the Sixth is Little Joey. I'm still pissed at Sandwich. I want I want to figure out. <laughs> you cross you cross the wrong kid who happens to be doomed. You crossed the wrong doom, child, my friend. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm not I'm allowed gonna, to go in here, but I'm I think I have to. I'm mod where I'm going to dehack the gun so every time it shoots, it says, Sandwich is a jackass. Oh! Whoa! You don't even have to dehack that. You just have to put the sign file. The, yeah, yeah. Uh, that uh, yeah. fire extinguisher was wow. more effective than I expected. Oh, Wilster, he just he gave up halfway through that sentence. <laughs> Keep clean. <laughs> he said, you mess with the ah, screw the whole thing. You can mess with the sound of all that. Keep cl what? Is that a boot? That's a tud. Oh, it's like Look gray. Like you need to get that checked, man. A really, man. really beige turd, though. Yeah, you need to get that checked. It's just poop. It's poop sandwich. What is that, a pig on oh, yeah. Or like, it's like a spawn key? Or like, what is that? No, that's a, that's a really beige turd in this beige game with its beige color palette. It's not the only it thing. Is. If you, if you miss, There's nice. brown. If you, if you mix the palette from this game with the color indigo, you get a new color. Shut up. <laughs> Previously unnamed darkish brown shade. Oh shit, these guys are gonna get a rude I awakening. I don't I don't actually hate the palette. I, I love the way this game looks. I should have let them get hit. This is my new shade of brown. It's called the day after Chipotle. Okay, do not enter or cross tracks. I got had to try that out. It's electric, you dumbo. Uh no, you're the dumbo. Stupid. No, no, Bo. You I can't remember if it had Bo. this map system in it. I actually really yes, dig this like roguelike one. looking. Yeah. yeah, it always had the auto map. It was always there. Okay, it's it's Lombology. it's quite uh, like I was saying the before. It's like you, you'd think just ninety degree angles and like square rooms, you know, wouldn't be that interesting, but it works with the you know Soviet era feel, right? Yeah, the bru uh, brutal architecture the of, of the era. Just uh, quite brilliant to make that kind of architecture interesting. Yeah, he does a great job. So this is—is oh, is this really all one guy? Yep. I, I find that hard to believe. One fella. Oh, Ed. He wrote the engine himself, and he... is he check doing... or? Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. No, he's credit. <laughs> <laughs> Boo! You know, that, that's a new one. I Like, I thought we had dried up all of the check, like, puns. No. But that, that I haven't kicked anybody. Just, just realized. <laughs> yeah, are, you, are you considering kicking someone from this Discord call or something? Is that why you're bringing that up? <laughs> These fucking guys. They look like spitters. Silent Hill monsters. Pig spitters, that's what they're From... called. Well, These guys are weird because when they hit sandwich. you, I think they they have like psychic stuff going on, so when they hit you, your screen kind of goes dark. It's kind of fucked up. Sandwich hates comedy and oh, hates this thing. Uh, what else will we barrel, learn? The double barrel shotgun in the corner there. Oh Edward shit. I was wondering when that would come out. Mode. Hell yeah. I I wasn't sure if that would like wait till the uh, second episode, so that's awesome. 
Oh, wait a minute. It actually doesn't come out first. Huh. Sandwich, <clears throat> is this game Eastern European? Yes. Are you... Kay. Oh my god. What? Uh, what was the, what where's the really line? Curious. Where is the line, that? Sandwich? Uh, well, I guess... I mean, I don't know. They're considered a little bit more westernized mm -hmm. than some Eastern Europe, but I don't know. I don't really care. Calibrex says it color equals Slav jank. Yeah, Slav jank is one way to... Care about uh, the fucking Eastern Bloc. So it doesn't care about family, <laughs> doesn't like humor, doesn't care about the Eastern Bloc. Yeah, it's an Eastern Bloc country, which is usually considered... Europe, but yeah, sorry if you live in like Slavic state or the Balkans or anything. You just don't exist to sandwich. You're just fucking. No, I I don't care about your trying to bring up that stupid argument. Is what I meant. Not that it's not that I don't care about countries. No, there's an argument. So I to be uh, fair. respect. Yeah. I respect all of my Eastern European. What argument are you friends. talking about? Nothing. Where do that, I go? Please elaborate. What? I don't understand what the, the issue is. Yeah. Okay. Sandwich is me a racist. <laughs> Thank you, Lady Miss, for coming in and totally missing. <laughs> no, she she hit the nail on the head that time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really. yeah. I was talking to Sandwich oh, at the PM the other day, just dropping end bombs like a motherfucker. I was like, well, my God, Sandwich. Oh, oh doing? yeah, shut up. Uh, I mean, like... Like... <laughs> Don't even joke about that, dude. What the <laughs> fuck? Guys, yeah, I heard Sandy at the local Ku Klux Klan convention, and I'm really concerned. Why were you there? <laughs> I was just passing by. You I was just passing by the Ku Klux Klan meeting. You know, as you do. I saw the white guy come over. Oh. <laughs> just just passing around. through. I'm telling you all, fucking drop yeah, abort, abort. Good. <laughs> oh, you want to talk about abortion now? I see how oh, it. let's talk about abortion. <laughs> the joke of abortion, but we need to go to a different I state. I will turn this age. stream around. <laughs> I'll turn this precious thing pretty damn quick. That's it. To Winnipeg. <laughs> uh. Disarray leads what? to injuries. <laughs> yeah. Well... <laughs> Disarray, we know all about that in this stream. <laughs> oh yeah, that's pretty much our motto here. The sand stream. Disarray leads to injuries, so be careful. <laughs> Is that just like an array of different insulting things you can say to somebody? It's the disarray? Dude, I love Ooh. the disarray. Christ, no! Fuck yeah, wonkers, that was good. That, that was, was good. good. Oh, it sucked ass. Fuck these haters, dude. Everything. She called this the hater yeah. cast. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because, well, that's what I am. Later. I'm the biggest hater that ever was I hated. I can't actually get there. Oh, I have to go down. Lady Miss Dragon, you're more, you're more like the Haiti Miss Dragon. <laughs> oh, Jesus <laughs> fucking <laughs> Christ. Oh, I forgot. I have this thing. It comes out. It comes out. So you have to click three twice. I realized after I said, after, like, the moment I said Haiti that I was like, wait, that's a oh, country. This thing yeah. <laughs> Like, this thing kicks like a mofo. <laughs> this is also a very nice, uh, satisfying Dark reload animation. It's, it looks pretty funny. If he turns the stream around, it might actually become good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it was kind of boring earlier, like, there were a few times when, like, you're talking yeah. about movie involved and stuff and a couple other scenes, but yeah, I know, maybe I just don't I'm like. Is that all you could say is yeah? What the hell yeah. is wrong with you? Don't you have... <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I'm I'm just kidding. I I love sand streams. I I hope it's known that I'm just. Oh, this, <laughs> is, this shit is fun as uh, hell. What are you talking uh, about? I love it. Thank you. Hi, I'm. This is why you call him Soul Sandwich. He doesn't fucking know how to take compliments. Quality. <laughs> yeah. I am. I am like it. Big, I smelly idiot, like and that. nobody likes Thanks him. Not. You give yeah, him a like... compliment, they're like, <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoy the streams, DeBang. Oh, really? Yeah, I wish you were around more. I uh, wish you were around more, but uh, you just keep playing that Fallout, and I just can't. Uh... <clears throat> Wait, huh? Uh, I know that. 
I know all you do. Dad's, like the way that I react to compliments, where I'm just like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. take a fucking compliment. Earth. <laughs> I'm just you're kidding. Uh, uh, Jason, nice. give it up your ass. Oh, no, I, I don't even know what you're talking about. Like, when the hell did I get brought up? I don't know. I don't know either. But, uh, oh, actually. There it is. Shoot the electrical panel. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I can't open it. Wait a minute. That's how you get our. Yeah. Oh, I see. All that near electrical panel. Does yeah, it kick the mofo, it. the psychic gorilla? Oh. The psych was that a psychic gorilla? Oh. No, no, you said that the super shotgun kicks like a mofo. Oh. Yeah. Uh, does it kick like the psychic that? gorilla? A little bit. It's got a funny reload animation where it doesn't look like there's like tubes, it's just sort of like... I actually can't make heads or tails of what's going on in there. I have to look right at it. Yeah, it just and stream sounds it just like just kind of stuffs it in a, in like a in your pee hole. What? 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 This yeah, what? We, we, He's we saying that it sounds like you got grains of sand in your cock. It's pretty straightforward. Yeah, and that's why I tell you to keep the sand out of my wedge. Oh, I don't yeah, no, want I get it. it now. It's a stream of sand. I didn't, uh, I, I thought he was just saying that the actual live stream itself sounds like he was talking to you directly. That sounds like you. Let's get into the palace of culture where all yeah. of the. That was really grainy I'm not sand. Talking shit about shit and Master B. I like how yeah. the fucking enemies just like throw up randomly. You don't do that in real life? <laughs> That's not normal. Really? You should see Next someone. Oh, hold on. Yeah, this weapon I've been rocks. Since I've been on the stream. Yeah, me too. Uh, no, you Just haven't. silently. Uh oh. No, you're right. Oh, isn't this like? There's like you're a propaganda right. film here, I think. Awesome. Sandwich. But, uh... It's not propaganda. It's just cultural education. It's just so, it's like propaganda. <laughs> you're not immune to propaganda. Ah, Lenin. Literally everything. Man, look at that oh, sweet right. beatboxing he's doing right there. Yo, I'm Lennon, and I'm here to say, the Communist Party helps you every day. Blow. Don't be a dummy, be a smarty. Come and join the Communist Party. <laughs> yeah, well, communism was founded by Jews, so I guess that makes sense. Uh... What? <laughs> Thank you, oh, Lady Miss, for... Karl Marx was Jewish. What? That's the joke. <laughs> That's the joke. That's the joke. <laughs> Maybe you we are like a communist, communist too. <laughs> uh, so I turned on the propaganda machine. Yeah, you were supposed to go down the fucking doorway. That was I, had, I had a freestyle, but I was, I, I, I can't say. Uh, back to the theater. Yeah. Oh, here. Didn't yes. see that. Sometimes the, uh, I don't know, gets dark. Sometimes, and I don't see sometimes. you're just unobservant. You're like a nut. Sure. Sometimes. Yeah, and almonds, almond joys have nuts, but mouths don't. Ooh, one, one shot, nice. We have mounds over here, and it's a shame because I like mounds. Ooh, jib that I, psychic I've head. Got twigs or anything like twigs? Lounge. Oh. Chocolate Wait. is a disappointment. You don't like oh, chocolate? Stuff? Wait, Not shut up! I'm trying really. to kiss Gus Gustav. No, Here, I right. think Chocolate's that not that cool. Bullshit. I don't like it. Oh, this Ugh. was definitely an important meeting room here. Uh, you next thing I know, you're gonna tell me that you don't think like hot breakfast is yummy. Hot. Oh, that's gonna be. What do you mean hot breakfast? Evacuation. You know, bacon uh, and eggs. Oh or shit! Or, you know, toast. <laughs> Secret that's communist gonna... evacuation room. I eat an unhealthy amount of eggs. I used to eat so many eggs that I got high cholesterol when I was 21 for a little bit. Oh, no. Next thing you're gonna tell me is you don't drink battery acid for breakfast. Sometimes. <laughs> okay, yeah, dude. Does. I eat shit Sometimes like you for you breakfast. Don't. You eat pizza you know, like, shit for um, breakfast. Uh, no. God, no. <laughs> I like well, how these guys can jump. Like, yeah. as high as young, you. But... Do you, do you also like, you know, like oh, pancakes and bacon, or at least toast? Toast, toast is toast, toast. Yeah, you can, you can do a lot of things. 
it's like it's just eggs. Like I'll make breakfast sandwiches. Nice. I'll just I'll do the thing with the toast where you put the, the thing and then the toast. Oh, that guy sucks. Oh, okay. Yeah. No. When um, I when I get home from work, it's three. Yeah, you oh, you I'm gonna get some toast. <laughs> oh, wow. uh, Wilster, what did you say? Oh shh. When I when I get home, oh. I live. I accidentally I just have three eggs. That's it. All right. Nothing else? I see something differently like every time and I cook the different. I mean when I was a lad I ate like four dozen eggs every morning to help me get large. What? And it was now that you're grown. Yeah. No. <laughs> I really need it. Nobody does it like me. I really need um... more sausage. Oh I got a medal. But I'm too lazy. I'll just like roll off some cereal. I mean so I have cooked sometimes. No, you can't talk about cereal on this stream. You're gonna get fucking attacked. Oh, jeez, yeah, sorry. Lazy. Palace of Kultur. I am too. Just not when it comes to breakfast. I like the incredible edible egg personally, but that's just me. You sir, Fred Castle. It depends because, like, every time I can remember, like, it being prepared for me, like on Sundays and stuff. Whatever brand you use is not very good, and I guess they didn't cook it the right way here, because you know, I look at it as kind of mediocre, because I've, now I, I've gone to like restaurants and stuff, and for the most part, I actually like their scrambled eggs, but... They gotta season them. Yeah. Like, do they just use salt and pepper? Is that, that it? I mean, if you mean just like put ketchup or something that aspect on it, that'd be... Oh, I like to make, ketchup. I like, to, I like to put Miracle Whip and ketchup on my eggs. Like... Oh. Okay, why no. ketchup? You just didn't think you were gonna say eggs. Use hot sauce or something instead. That's actually good. Not ketchup. Oh shit, no, I, it went I, into I, the I manhole. Yeah, we have hot sauce. Hey guys, I'm gonna head out though, okay? I'll miss you. Good night. Bye, Bye the bag. Thanks for hanging out with us. Especially anytime. If you put the hot sauce in before you cook the eggs and you like stir it in, if you get the consistency right, it just blends in with the eggs, so you just get spicy oh, eggs. Yeah. Definitely makes it much better, although I wouldn't use anything too spicy because, well, it kind of leads to stomach problems, and besides that, uh, it, it'll burn your fucking mouth for like a minute or so. I don't care. You never care. You just like, you, you just like it. Yeah. Or am I right? I like, yeah. I, I do like hot sauce, but I like cheese on my eggs first. Just a little bit, not too I much. I would if I wasn't horribly lactose intolerant. Do you not, do you make omelets or you just make scrambled eggs? Yeah, the fucking oh, wow. pretty stupid. Do you, will, you, you put any vegetables in some omelets, or you just eat the eggs? I, I'm, I'm curious about your omelet afterwards, sandwich. But I, I for me personally, some oh like chopped up no. bell peppers and stuff would go nice in an omelet. Um, and uh, yeah, of course, with with, with cheese on top. Of it, like I'm not big on like peppers, like. Red or green pepper? Well, red are better than green for me. But... Yeah, oh, red for sure. Green. I would you just use the hand cannon to unlock a hand cannon. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's <laughs> just awesome. throwing up before mm. I get there. Like, oh shit, he's here. And the steam in that last room, like those. Yeah, that was like a really good looking room. Very, very Do you ever? Do you ever, you ever put tarragon in your eggs? But is what? that a Pokemon? Oh, it's delicious stuff. I haven't had it enough, fortunately. It's pretty good. It's a, it's a spice plant. If you get like some fresh tarragon and you like chop it up and put it in there, it uh, makes them taste pretty good. It has a weird taste. Um, yeah. So I don't... It, it's not for everyone. Oh it's like a very light... I, the closest comparison would be like black licorice. Like the... Oh no, that's a no yeah, for me, yeah, dog. No, no, that's the. It's the most similar. No. It doesn't taste like your eggs taste like black licorice, but it has that uh like slight bitterness to it. That's kind like of aspartame taste, sort of. Oh uh, yeah, tarragon no. is a great additive to stuff to be fancy. I mean, I used to like make chicken with like um, oh chicken oh, with tarragon chicken. Oh this fucking right? this fucking oh no. I need to try thing. it. It sounds interesting. I'm very curious. Yeah, this bulldozer Lady is gonna come up. cultured and understands good food at least a little bit. I'm like sandwich. <laughs> yeah. Well, well. that sandwich? What he would like? He said he's. You he said he could handle 
red, you know, red, yeah, red peppers, mushrooms. I really like mushrooms, so I, I like those. Mushroom, 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 mushroom. What do you mean, handle red peppers? They're just slightly sweet. No, he means like as a combination with the omelet specifically. I okay. mean, it adds stuff. But I mean, oh, I love bell peppers. Yeah, me too. Generally, I like putting bell peppers on pizza for capsicum, as they call them in Australia. Uh, whoa, actually, that whoa, doesn't whoa, exist call, in Australia. What, what? Yeah, yeah. Wait a fucking minute here. Wait a minute here, Bruce. <laughs> oh, okay, no, oh, Wilson, no. you're not. Bruce yeah, is more. To tell. I associate oh, yeah, doggies. You know, Jim Carrey than anything else, personally. Bruce Almighty. You have to I make sure the dogs the are dead. From fucking Finding Nemo. You know, Finding Nemo is just a cheap, low-budget ripoff of the Shark Tale. Ah, <laughs> uh, jeez, I love your hot takes, Will Sir. Not. I couldn't tell you were Wait, sarcastic. Wait, Calvaria of Kaslov? Why is that ticking down? <laughs> what did I just do? <clears throat> oh, shh. Will Sir, you said hang on a minute, and then you just went on this tangent. Am I? What can't wait? What did I hear? You're gonna make a point and then you derailed yourself completely. Oh god, I can I don't remember any of that. What? Ah! Going... <laughs> we were talking oh, about no, horses. What the hell is up with Gas... horse first? Uh, that's what I said earlier. Yeah, it's like why is there that horse just got. He's gonna We're a horse redneck rampage or something. Really? No, no, I anything. said, hold on. I can see that. Because you mentioned liking some Australian thing that doesn't exist, and then I called you Bruce. <laughs> and then what I, uh. Talk to him now. <laughs> I, 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 I shut uh, him down. I, uh, and then Lady Miss Dragon was being a little, uh, difficult as usual, and then I, uh. <laughs> Now hold on a second. <laughs> finding Nemo is a ripoff of I, the Incredible Mr. Limpet with Don Knotts. I what the said fuck that are you talking about? Is a ripoff of Shark Tale. <laughs> no. And then Lady Miss Dragon was like, "I love your hot take." <laughs> no, I, and I couldn't tell that she was being sarcastic until she said "not" at the end there, because I'm a very slow uh, individual. Mm, individual. Don't sell yourself short. Why is this why is there an irradiated sign? On his he died from radiation poisoning. Oh, dig grave. Wait, you can flick something here? Hey, um, no. can you stop oh, shit. and start ripping? I actually already flicked that through the statue. Um, Wilster, you said oh, I got some a, shit, and I had a response to it, and then everything went to hell. I got some money. Nice. Isn't that how it always goes, nice. though? It's just another day. Maybe something about Wayne's World with the whole not thing? I can't really remember. No. <laughs> what was that video game that Angry AVGN played, where every time you get hit, he goes, no. Wayne's World, the video game. Yeah, uh, okay, I was... Hey, I never actually saw it. Not worthy, and then when you die, it's like, not worthy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's really stupid. That's what well, they were they, they clearly saw Marvel the movie. In the 90s when he was like, at top. You're right, at least they saw the movie. It's better than those games that were, they have nothing to do with it. <laughs> the future on NES where you're a guy, like a buff dude in a black muscle shirt <laughs> running around collecting clocks. Yeah. Did you see the collecting face? Collecting clocks! <laughs> Did you see the it's fake? Like, like, it's like literally they told someone who had no idea. It was like, bad time? <laughs> okay. Like, um, was. Roger, Doom Kid. Roger, no, no, go ahead, Doom Kid. I just, I just, why? Like, they could have at least had a guy with, like, a, a red jacket with blue no. sleeves or something. But they it was had a no idea. in a black muscle shirt. Why? They had no idea How what was... it was. Like, they, they had clearly never seen the movie. It's like, come on, you can't take two hours to do a little bit of research for programming this game? No, dude, you're picking up clocks. It's like basically Back to the Future. 
I thought for the longest time the music in it had nothing to do with Back to the Future either because it's just going <laughs> but if you actually slow it down to like oh, the lightning 40% speed it's the power of love and it actually sounds like it when you slow it down so it's like somehow they knew the power of love was in that movie but otherwise didn't watch it <laughs> Well, it's like with oh, wow. uh, for Spider-Man. It took them decades to finally make a live-action Spider-Man movie. And one version of the script, the director of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre was going to direct. And oh, it was going to be about... Because uh, the guys who wrote it, they misunderstood the concept of the character. And uh, here's from the Wikipedia article. They thought it was like the Wolfman. And they instructed the writer to write a treatment reflecting their misconception. <laughs> In this version of the story, a corporate scientist intentionally subjects ID badge photographer oh, Peter geez. Parker to radioactive bombardment, transforming him into a hairy, suicidal, eight-armed monster. The human tarantula <laughs> refuses to join the scientist's new master race of mutants, battling a succession of mutations kept in a basement laboratory. Dude, I want to see that that's movie. Fucking, yeah, I was <laughs> going to say, that sounds fucking cool. And then here's the next sentence. Unhappy with this perceived oh, debasement of this comic book creation, Spiders. Marvel Stan Lee pushed for a new story in screenplay. And this surprisingly, that's Forgot like about if the it was spiders. Like, you had Batman, but it's just like yeah. a dude like who's all like getting tortured by bats and lives in the ghetto or some shit. Like, yeah, <laughs> it makes about as much sense as the movie Albert uh, that Joe Dorowski guy is going to make about Dune. Something oh, with like uh, or it's like it's war, uh, but... oh, was it gonna be it's like Batman. based on the book that heavily? I guess. Weird. Mm, yeah, it took some creative liberties. We'll just say. Well, maybe it's good it it's didn't work out because I like the but... the one they actually eventually made. What you mean the David Lynch film? Oh. No, the more re that one's <laughs> trash. Let's oh, stop. You are such a dude. That movie's okay. It's, All right, it's not. It's not great. It's so like, it's bad. Flawed. David Lynch doesn't want to ever be tied to it. God uh, damn, you are uh, so. Judgmental. At the end of the movie, <laughs> it rains, and it's supposed to be like a great thing, and it's just destroyed it's all the spice in the it's universe. Stupid. It doesn't make I any didn't fucking sense. The movie sense. wasn't stupid. I didn't say the movie was. I said it's not that like. I, okay. If you think that's a really truly shitty movie, you have not seen that many movies. Because there are shitty <laughs> movies out there, and I would not rank oh, that I, among them. It's not I mean, good. okay, I will it's say so it has boring, some. Though. It has some like really good set design here and there. It's got some interesting ideas. It's got Sting with his shirt off with a cod piece. It's pretty. It's all right, but the as a Dune, yeah, as a yeah, Dune it's, tribute, it's, it's bad really bad, sure. man. Oh, it is <laughs> compared to like the actual story of Dune. It sucks. I, I totally agree there. Yeah, just if you take it on a movie. If you call if yeah, if you're saying like yeah, obviously there are worse movies out there, but like you said it was trash, like that brutal Dune kid the other day. I mean Well, okay, the bad parts were Dune bad, kid? but the good parts were good. Of Dune? Um, was like what I wanna... parts to like be of note. It wasn't just bad parts. That's the key. Yeah. Although I mean, I can, I, you know, I'm pretty sure fun. I could just say something's trash is just, you know, a random, like, I don't know, a random opinion of something I thought was terrible. I'm not, I'm not making a YouTube video about it. It would be a little bit more considered if I did that. But uh, on the topic of, like, adaptations that don't know the source material, imagine if there was a movie about, like, this guy who's really good at baseball and he's, like, a real slug hitter for the local team and they, they call him the Batman. <laughs> oh my uh -huh. fucking god. Yeah, that's really good. You should workshop that a bit. Oh shit. What does that say? Long live May 1st. Oh no. Don't actually want to use like, the super shotgun too much because it, it uses a lot of uh, ammo, yeah, obviously. I... So. Oh shit. Did I just... Hear something? But he play he plays with a baseball bat, and it sounds like Batman, the the DC Comics character. But it's it's not like the Batman you know. It's more like a the guy who plays baseball. That is I, so I like so that. I, I don't know why everyone was like, "Fuck oh, you, Will Stewart! I hope your children die." As soon as you said that. Well, I, 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 that's I, I, fucking awful. This horse is swimming. They yep. could do that. Horses are actually really good at swimming. He's dead. 
Oh, he's I really good at swording. Nail. He's uh, he did be. I hit? I thought I missed him with that, and he just died. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. It looked like you missed him. I guess you didn't, because I was going to say, when he jumps in the water, you shoot shoot the uh, lightning bolt into the water and electrocutes him. Oh, like everything in there? Yeah. Like the quake, man. That's yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I remember yeah, yeah. like once, I only once exploded myself with the thunderbolt and quake, and that was because I ran out of ammo and it auto swapped to it. I That's should use lame. that weapon a bit. It shouldn't auto swap to a gun that does that. Forgot to use it. No, oh, this is actually I a really terrible time love, to have this thing out. <laughs> I love I the effect this when this thing goes off, like the way the screen goes all like white. Mwah. What? Soup. Main course. Cake. Cake. Fucking shit. Got you. One time I fell out of a tree. Wow. This is I'm worried working. if I say, uh, you know, I don't know what I can and can't say anymore. Sand is just being such Shut a the fuck up. Oh, Sand, Sand, stop. Sandwich, you're oh, you literally your Hitler. You're At least I'm not ontologically. <laughs> Hillary Littler. Oh, God. You're, you're Hillary Littler. Oh, I got all the monsters. Uh, Christ, uh, I think Hillary Clinton hit the most bad that shit. Oh. oh, my God. How the fuck could someone not giggle at that? Sand, Sand went through yeah. some trauma or <laughs> some shit. I, I feel like yeah. Calibrex says Uwe Boll presents Spider-Man. Oh no. <laughs> Uwe Boll. Oh, it's actually pronounced U Boll. Thank you. Yeah, um, yeah, you're right. That's how it's spelled. Uh, um, but hey, but Hernik yeah. Bazooka, what's up? Uh, you can yeah, you can actually. Like, I don't know if you know what this is, Hernik. Or wait, is Hernik? Is Hernik check? I thought there was someone back. who was check. Oh, Hernik's so. not check. It looks no? kind of Czech or uh, Slovakian or something. I, I know. Uh, I know. <laughs> what are you I know what it, well, if you if you don't mind my asking, Hernik, uh, do you do you understand that, some of the wording that here? Really looks Czech to me. Hernik, Hernik is Czech. Czech. Yeah. yeah. So I I would guess maybe you know about this game or maybe you don't because this takes place and I I would assume you do, but if you don't, this might blow your mind. Sandwich, have you ever heard of the band Puck? Puck? It, he probably would hate it. Don't bother telling. Have you ever heard of Fat Puppy? <laughs> Dude, I love Fat Puppy. They're my favorite industrious band. Oh, look at that. He actually lives near uh, Visarad Castle, which was the last level, right? But it's not quite that brown. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this game is very brown. This is where I came from, isn't it? Or... Oh, what? Oh, I always talk. This is this is where you came from. Don't forget where you came from, Sandwich. Go back. To that <laughs> These guys with the barrels. Ah. Is that all that was? It's just like, fuck you. Why'd you come one, back? One here? guy with the barrel. That'll get him. Just going. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this Chukum, What's up? Yeah, this is fraud. This is uh, episode one. Yeah, Hernik, yeah. have you uh, played this game and like, what do you think of it? I'm interested to hear your opinion. I'll, I will read the signs as I come to them. Uh, oh shit, there's a lot. Oh yeah. Uh, it's it's cool that the enemies are actually more mobile than you you necessarily expect. They can kind of jump all around and swim and stuff. I love that it's not nice. like the way you say mobile. Like I got mobile. Rather than mobile, I find that funny. I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's funny. Yeah, you talk weird, sandwich. Oh, yeah, sandwich, you fucking freak. You all talk funny. You talk different than me. What? I just I thought like mobile was funny. God. What? Why are you such a bigot, Adam? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> My name is Doomkid, thank you. 
<laughs> I wa I got one Corona and found this guy. It is weird. They always call him that name, but then you don't share your first name, so it's like just a one-sided like. <laughs> very well. Like, like no one else calls me Adam, so I don't find it strange. But it is oh, very well. Adam. Adam. Oh, that's Given's name. Did you like see like his it games up plus? Adam. I Change the username. Don't, don't make me say your name, name, Sandy. Don't do it. You've been testing uh, was, me tonight, bro. I was thinking of that uh, Vine. Isn't the guy who just gets like, who drops something? He's like, Adam! Don't worry, Sandwich. You'll forget about it in like a week. Maybe I'll, I'll just call you Kid. <laughs> hey, Kid. You know, oh, it's only good if he doesn't like how many like, consonants are in Doom Kid. That's like... Sandwich, I know the Vine you're referring to and nobody drops anything. It's the guy blowing a vape cloud. It's also so, awkward to yeah. yeah. me. Yeah. Oh, he's doing like a vape trick and oh, like he blows fine. it away and he goes, Adam! <laughs> Adam! And he saw a bit of vape coming out of his mouth at the end too when he says it. Yeah, Hernick says he heard the dude wrote his own render to make the game kind of crazy. Hernick has not played it yet, but yeah, he, I, I'm really enjoying this. This is episode one, and there's an episode two that I, I have to play on this channel now. Because, uh, this is great. Maya, what about, um, Billy the Kid, Kid Cootie, and Kid Rock? None of them are actual kids. Yes, but I don't speak to them on a regular basis. They're all dead. <laughs> well, fair enough. But I've gotten that comment <laughs> so many me. times over the years. You're, hey, you know, I've come to the conclusion that you're not actually a child. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is, this is the... I think this fucked me guy. up before, too. I mean, come on. It's a you, Doom you actually, guttural voice is almost not noticeable. I mean, you wouldn't even hear it if you weren't paying attention. Yeah, it's like, really it's forgettable. Like, I can't call him Doom for sure because then you're like, are you talking about the game? Like, no, I'm referring to him. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, <laughs> Just call him Kid. Like, be, then make it really condescending every time. Hey, hey Kid. kid. <laughs> what the uh, fuck do you want, Kid? That's okay. I'll call you Adam sometime. If I have to call you in. <laughs> oh, I think I just missed a, um, there's a section to go up here. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, there's, um, I think there's like a, uh, I was there's like a uh... switch to pull somewhere I think that I'm missing. Because <laughs> it sounded like you're like, <sighs> It sounded almost like you were doing the, the, the oh, gobbling noises again. Oh, uh, yeah, the noise you like to make. Is that, is that, is that, a, is that a problem? Uh, problem? I mean, it makes you look strange and it makes some people yeah. like fall in them. Ew. I don't come across as strange ever. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's completely normal and right. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I agree. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, Chukum is actually talking about his, uh, his contribution map one to the, uh, what's it called? Pleasant Vibes from the Party Garage, or as yeah, Clippy might say, from, Garage. From, from, from. Yeah, I'm yeah, so glad that the dead locked up really so uh, Therefore. Are any of you guys, uh, have any of you guys taken a map from that? That's the Clippy, uh, project, or the, the Crispy I Chicken did. project? Yeah? What, which map yeah. name did you get, or do you want to say it? This doesn't represent me. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know if that was an Always Sunny reference from his wife, but uh, it doesn't have to be anyway. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I'll just Honestly, the, the shooting the, that, shooting that stuff for progression is like, sometimes I just, it's hard to remember that. Here we go. Ah. World peace. Oh, isn't I, I that think nice? for that that map, I'll break all of my rules for mapping if I can make it somewhat tolerable. Ha! <laughs> yeah, that would work. What the hell? Just a beaker? Science. <laughs> You're crap. Science, Hi. bitch. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> oh, there we go. I love how you said it like so dead. <laughs> Breaking bad quote. Okay. Oh, he also, no, Chukum right. also has map seven, I said no chickens, which, uh, he is happy to disobey. Yo, Mr. Oh. White, science, bitch. Volumetric, is there? I don't I know why they didn't hire fraud, me. Yeah. I auditioned for that role and they said, no, you suck ass. Go back home to your fucking grandma. 
You were literally 10 years old when that show came out. Fernick Bazook is making Mr. Quake White. maps. Hey, Luigi, we gotta cook the maps. Ow. What? <laughs> oh, we gotta, we gotta cook the maps. I accidentally smoked our whole last batch, and we gotta make more. <laughs> we can to sell get, it. We need to get it on Mario. Mm, Mario, I can't. Uh, I, I can't afford the house me. anymore. We gotta get an RV to move into Luigi. That's what we gotta do. Stage three cancer with an IV, but I've got no RV. It's okay. Oh, That's so okay, burns Luigi. Just stay off the meth. You'll be fine. Don't wind up like your big brother over here. Luigi, we, Mario, we gotta cut these. We gotta cut. I, I always I fucking brute meth. force these. What? Damn, good strategy. What the fuck is that? Usually it works. Hex I guess there's nothing else. Fucking hex and puzzle. Jesus. Yeah, how are you supposed to solve that puzzle? Like, legit? Is there a clue or is it just bullshit? Oh, I imagine there must be like a clue somewhere. If I designed this game, I would not put a clue in. Well, I mean, you can just use, you can just use the process of elimination, but you, usually with like three of them, it's pretty easy to do. But this one is oh, like... Get eight switches with three options each. You gotta figure it out. Yeah, I don't know how many... There's probably quite a few that options is an idea. for this. Max hates my idea. I, I'm just gonna... Oh, that's not the only thing I hate. Or yeah, I see, hate. there you go. Whatever, I did it. Please elaborate. What else do you hate? I'm not sure the yeah, purpose of these puzzles. If like, if like, like, if you just brute force them, like, why put them in? You know, I don't know. It's a Duke thing. Maybe that's why. Oh shit! It jumps. Nice. Yeah, it's a great weapon. That's even better than the Quake Lightning Gun. I don't think that one jumped to different targets. Nah. The Quake one's just a straight line. Yeah. Is there something... I remember not using it very much when I played Quake. I didn't find it terribly useful except for oh, dealing shit. with um, a wife beater. Uh, shamblers. <laughs> Man, the yeah, best you know, armor in the Soviet army, the wife beater. We stand firmly behind Svoboda and Dubček. Yeah, I'm disappointed dude. he changed the name of the uh, the tin can. It used to be can of blood and fat, and now he's just changed it to canned poultry. <laughs> Chef was like a reformer, but then the Soviets came in and overthrew his ass. So, uh, tragic. Oh, Dubček yeah, was uh, overthrown. So this is like a hidden zone where the Dubček holdouts still reside, eating their blood and fat. Delicious. <laughs> Delicious. Oh, I need to become quake, friends with the dev and then tell him to change it back. <laughs> yeah. Can of blood and fat. It's just so much funnier. Ah. I love it. Ah. Bloody Lenin. Oh, head. Dark Pulse knows about UVB. Oh, is that a Lenin I head? I've about that for a while. I, I assume even... it, it's supposed to look a little like no. Lenin, and it has a little arms um, that stick out the side. That. It's funny. It does kind of have this face. Oh, I didn't know. Yeah, I didn't notice the little army bits. <laughs> I kind of wish they didn't sink halfway into the ground. What the so fuck? Could... <laughs> Just a guy like, hey! What I wish is that when they saw you, they say, Nuts! Get out my new cool smoke barrel! Yeah, you know, like that Simpsons episode. Yeah, yeah. No, I haven't seen oh, it. Do you want to see my new chase on? I don't know what the Simpsons is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you right. Just like Simpsons fun. Mario. Luigi, I can't watch The Simpsons. I'm blind from eating too many quarters. Oh, the nickel poisoning got to you. Oh, got him. Nickel bag oh, shit. Barrel boy. The ones oh, my, uh, they, oh, the bank oh. keeps calling. They say they want the nickel back. Oh, no. <laughs> I want to never smile. I, yeah, sandwich, it's a condition. You know, Way to fucking better. rip on it. Real cool, dude. Time. I get a disability that all that I the time. People are like, "Why are you so mad?" And I'm like, "I just look depressed all the time. It's all my fault. I'm sorry." You mad? There's a, there's a I'm saying it based on Sans' facial expressions. That's the difference. I'm saying it based on how. Anytime anyone says anything funny, he goes. 
fuck you, fuck your mother, fuck your fucking <laughs> hamster. He's not. I got a now. degree from fuck Western University. I've been you trained in humor classically, I've been trained in humor contemporaneously. Contemporary, you know talent. I walked Bob Dylan up on stage. I saw Bob Dylan in 1969, Some of Love, what have you done? So you changed the date on it, I noticed. You didn't say 1963 this time. I did it for you, you Ulster. No, you piece of shit. You're nothing. Dude, that was funny earlier. That was actually a truly funny moment. Sand wasn't laughing, naturally, but I found it to be a funny moment. What did, what was funny? Yeah, I find your whole three. Bob Dylan wouldn't have been active then, and then yeah. I find your whole uh, life to be a funny moment. I can't remember the. I think he said 1970 something. Because I he said 63. In like 1966, nah. and he started like. I'll bet you the old money right now. It's 1970 something. What? Okay. What is? I guess he's oh, the, the, uh, oh, you mean the actual the video? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I think he said 73 or something. 70 something. Okay. Thanks. We were talking about what I said earlier. Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking of saying. Like... Yeah, well, your memory sucks. He just proved it, so there you go. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you for your input. <laughs> we value your feedback. Thank you. Ooh. I would put it. Really rather if you be quiet. Uh, no sandwich. We're not going to be quiet. Sorry. Ever. Dude, what about the top pigs in video games? We need to make a list. Such as? Such as? Oh, they, that doesn't open, huh? Does, does he actually mention the Angry Birds pigs? I can't no, remember. No, he does not it's mention funny. Angry Birds. It's, he says Zelda, uh, um, maybe, I don't remember what, I don't even, I've uh, watched the video like 50 times, I can't remember the games he brings up. Who's this guy? Uh, uh his name's Adam White, Chibi, he's kinda, he's a genuine weirdo, like, uh, uh I'm not gonna get into it right now, but, yeah, he, he's more than just that cringy guy in that video, he's really oh. kinda weird. Wow, Whistler's not getting into something for once. Yeah, yeah Whistler's like, I'm not getting into it. The funny thing is, the guy who's like pointing out how cringy he is is basically as cringy as he is. It makes it even better. No, the best yeah. part about that video is the two other guys on the couch who stay <laughs> dead silent the entire time. Like you could say something, you could try to make this less awkward, but you're just <sighs> just stone faced, just like thousand yards there. Mm -hmm. there's, yeah. nothing, <laughs> there's nothing that they could say at that point. They were. It's kind of a weird, like having that captivated. ceiling be completely. I guess there's supposed to be wooden boards, but I don't know. It kind of doesn't look like it. I don't know. It does look oddly paper. Gonna cry. Piss your pants. It reminds maybe. me of Hellkeep, except Thinking. a little more subtle. Oh shit. Maybe shit and cum. Are you gonna cry shit and cum all at the same time? Probably not, but there's a chance. And piss your pants. Wait, what the? Cry, oh, these are the milk pants, bottles. Maybe, maybe shit and cum. Yeah, it's like four things. Thinking workers do not six drink, six drinking four. workers do not think. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's catchy. In other words, drink. That's probably a real fucking sign somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Drink, fish, drink, fish, drink, fish, fish, no fish. The same way it's like, um, uh, stop it or cop it with the stupid seatbelt thing. Uh, I don't have that ticket. Yeah, click, I have thank a you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I have a sign for my seatbelt in my car. It says, even if the quickie wrap that's sticky. I what? don't. I don't have to what wear the one. The fuck is that? You don't have to you wear a seatbelt. No. no. She's a New Hampshire. Why, why, why? I don't. Oh, I just do don't. Have... If you crash your car, you'll be wishing that you did. Uh, that's debatable. So unless if you're dead. Also, my car's airbags are recalled, so there's a chance it would send metal shrapnel into my face afterwards. So. Oh. Okay, so the air, at that point, the airbag's wow. being She also fucked. doesn't have insurance, so she can't get into a crash anyway, so she just doesn't crash, right? Obviously, yeah. Yeah, duh. That's, that's also, not a good Also, my plan. glove box is disassembled, so if someone was in the passenger seat and I got in an accident, Adam, they would all... It's vertical, dink it, you don't know the half of it, mate. 
You can call me Adam Bio. I wasn't trying to be weird earlier, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> That's Adam degree of, of, of uh, like the thing Snack tells me is like I live in I live in a in a state of constant worry about her now. <laughs> Uh, at, uh what she's mentioned about her car. Doom Kid is now known as Biodegradable 2. <laughs> oh, that's stupid. Oh, this is some nice fog here. Man, you know what? You've rolled your eyes at so many jokes this oh, stream. Sh and that was the shittest yeah, fucking fighting. attempt to bring that joke back. <laughs> you have no, you cannot roll your eyes at others from it. You've, you've lost your God given privileges. Who are you? Jeez. Who are you? Who are you? Did you walk Bob Dylan up on stage? In 1952. I, I really don't know. I'm trying to remember who you are. I just love how he says that like it's like that means anything. Yeah, like. Put your goddamn horn away. I wonder if there's. Bob Dylan probably doesn't even remember who you are. I, I wonder. So, if do you remember when a dwarf walked you up on, on stage in the seventies? Like, no, what? Yeah, that the was the thing. Chukum says your airbag is a claymore mine. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> much. He also says bio two gradable. Well, he said claymore mine at first. If I just don't get Duma an accident, Duma decadable. Dude. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> You're just like, dude, no, no. Bro. Dude, no. <laughs> Bruh. This is all easily in my top 10 bruh moments. Uh... <laughs> top 10 things I've shoved up my ass. Number Bruh. 10, broom handle. <laughs> Wilster. Oh, Wilster. He's a great presence here. God love him. Boy, How, uh, uh, mic, How far am I into this? Because I might be uh, wrapping up soon. I'll, uh, like, you nearly finished episode one. Yeah. I don't you recall if this is. Minutes, minutes left. What? what? You, got, you, you asked you how long you had left. What? How many <laughs> Let me see oh. here. Oh! Oh! They need oh. to do like a fucking vacation getaway and get like Oh, this a is the this package. is the final map, so I'll just do this one then. I'll be back in a second. Oh uh, yeah, okay. This is the boss fight. Yeah. They can call it and relieve some tension. Are you gonna switch games after this one, Wedge? Yeah, but I'm the I'm gonna switch to go to sleep. The hot I, new... Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. I'd actually yeah. appreciate it, honestly, because, like, if you were to move into episode two, I wouldn't be able to watch anymore because I don't want any spoilers. Yeah. No. Okay. Where... Tomorrow morning, make Where sure... Come back. I should call to a therapist because I think you need one. <laughs> oh, Lady Miss Dragon, you pessimist. Uh... I'm always saying what everybody's thinking out loud. I mean, <laughs> it's as if you... Oh, well, I just noticed your avatar. <laughs> is that what's that guy doing there in your avatar, Wilster? I'm really curious. It's a, stop. It's a Photoshop. Oh, Jesus. Like, like, no. Photoshop a uh, fucking Carl Benjamin's face onto some bald guy. Argon of a That's exactly what it is. <laughs> Who's that? He's got like the smuggest. He's a face shitty YouTuber. Don't worry world. about it. I mean, that's yeah, all Wilster no, knows, so I guess well, I should just assume at this point. I forget, he's a also a politician. He deals in pan-European <laughs> He tried to be a politician. He tried <laughs> to be a politician. So he failed miserably. Is this that stupid fucking Nebuchadnezzar motherfucker? It's the Sargon of Akkad duel. Yeah, sure, whatever. I guess if you think he's uh, the same. Because Sargon of Akkad and Nebuchadnezzar are the exact same people because they came from the same kingdom. I refuse to actually call him by that name because like, he's like, oh, I'm going to name myself after an emperor from a million years ago. Like, you don't deserve that kind yeah. of name. Fuck off, Carl. Okay, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I want to you know, what the Especially fuck when he has the most milquetoast personality and voice. Knife World Dude, says he's been remember. working on Devious Deviance while listening. Uh, not sure I'm familiar with that. Uh, it says, cool to see you still playing through... 
Hat rot. That's the uh, <laughs> correct oh, way to say with, it. Um, yeah. Hat rot. With Sar Sargon of Akkad, he was he was a YouTuber, and then he decided to move into politics, and he joined a political party, and he started acting like so big for his oh, like he got such an ego about it. Too big it. for his britches. Yeah, and, and, and he was political on YouTube since like 2014, if not earlier. But no, no, no but I mean, like he actually he like say, decided. Dude, he got asked. He got asked oh, oh, openly, like, does pollution affect the environment and is climate change real? And he was like, I'm, I'm really have to do uh, no studies on the papers on that. And uh, he got all like, it was like dude, <laughs> let's not be political fucking, about this, dude, kid. Yeah, let's not be political. Yeah, it was just, yeah, he's clearly, like, he didn't want to offend his, like, he was starting to dip his toes further and further into right-wing shit. And he didn't want to offend his right-wing base by admitting that human pollution does fuck with the ecosystem. Well, I guess he I really wouldn't recommend Ray Mohawk to you to him. He's a trash <laughs> yeah, yeah, you hate the fucking planet. I, <laughs> I actually but love your Ray Mohawk stories, man. But when Sargon got um, into politics, he tried to flex. <laughs> he tried, uh... No. Oh, he tried right. flexing just... on the old YouTubers who were still doing a YouTube thing, and there was one guy in particular, Jim. He was oh, like trying to flex God. on him He's real hard. He was like, I, he was. Uh, he said, uh, "Tomorrow I will be dealing in pan-European politics, and I will be wearing a suit." I doubt <laughs> Jim even. <laughs> I doubt Jim even owns a suit. And Glory to the heroes who fell for friend. their homeland. This is uh, oh, I, this is the mausoleum of, of I guess the Red Army soldier or something. That's cool. Uh, mo we're once again, most likely a real, there. most likely a real location. Which is cool. We're too busy talking about the failed political careers of failed YouTubers. You're saying, if you want to actually talk about the game you're playing? Gosh, come I on. I reserve Just the right to to uh, <laughs> talk about the media. game. Yeah, <laughs> let's just we want to talk. You reserve that one right. You lost yeah, that, that one right. Whatever it was earlier, but yeah. that one you reserve. Yeah. I can't even remember what it was. Or I said you lost your God-given right to some shit. I don't even remember. To some <laughs> shit. I don't even remember what I was mad about, but fuck you. <laughs> I'm still angry though. What are you talking about? What? The only I thing really I know. Know. Oh, the only thing what? that I sort of jokingly pretended to have mad about was the Omnivore um, <laughs> form and shit. But even that was obviously just... The only thing I got mad about was Jim Kid forgetting who I was. What? Oh, I'm just twisting you your never told me. I feel like I'm being like... You're gaslighting me right now, Snack. <laughs> yeah, that's I don't what think I am. <laughs> well, now you infer it. You said the Tumblr just... word. No, Snacks I doesn't gaslight at all. When she asked to Some... when I'm gonna play her maps. After playing her maps, I yeah, I just like yes, saying like, it. Same like constant. Even if I don't have a map, I just I just fucking. Yeah, it's, it's no, it's actually kind of funny. But I actually don't care like when you play it. Like, oh shit! Oh. That horse came out of nowhere. <laughs> I'm looking at the. God damn, Wilster and Snacks already have double the kilobytes in their maps compared to me. You double you the kilobytes? Do the math, dude. Did you see yeah. the entrance I put too much effort into? Do the math. You know, it's the same Make as the line work thing, Sam. It's lost on you. Oh, shit. <laughs> what was that? On you. You said I said Wilster does nice line work in his maps, and you're like, that's the most stupid bullshit I've ever heard of him in being. Wow, you remember the exact quote too. That's amazing, dude. And the tone too. Don't forget, I remembered your tone as well. It was like a English royal guy slightly. There he is. Quite. <laughs> See so, if I can uh, add. Like these are uh, always. I never. I never use like mines in games like this. But I don't know. They're never is, terribly useful, man. Nah. Is yeah. there anyone who knows who that shaven-headed guy in Wilson's avatar is? I mean, obviously the boy Argon, but I mean. Oh, the They're not even like, tripping uh, the mines! Fuck! <laughs> yeah, <they're laughs> he doesn't have any legs! <laughs> I know! The one enemy that doesn't trip the mines spawns over the landmines! <laughs> Fuck! They really are useless! <laughs> 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 
keep your rockets handy. There's a, I think, if I remember correctly, there's a helicopter. Oh no, stage. I'm probably gonna die. I don't know if I want to save. Nah, kind of come on, you the killed the first helicopter fine in your first go. Save, save on another file, but yes, save. Oh god! There it is. I'm, I, I'm good. Right. I think there's two. Is there? Oh there's shit! <laughs> Oh, he oh, yeah. finally killed ah. me. That helicopter looked like it was having some control issues. I don't even know. I think I could. Um, landing, I think they spawn like oh, here. Wilster. Why? How do you get all these horrible, strange photos of fat men? I, I don't understand. Uh, how do you think? He has. He just has. His, he has a personal folder of them. Yeah. Why do you think he does? Well, like, how does they're he pick around. ones he picks? That's what I'm more wondering, like... Bad horsey! Bad horsey! I, never, I can never decide yeah. where I want my profile picture to be, so I just stick with the shitty OC I drew in, like, 20 minutes. Why don't you swap back to the, uh, cute little, uh, plushy axolotl I got for you? Yeah, but there's also the face zoomed in of the axolotl. I like that one a lot. Me too. Yeah, I even made a react on my server for it. I like how these guys actually fall over for a bit and they're just like, oh, I, I still got it. Ugh. And I actually have a picture of that axolotl hidden in each anti-mortem map. I think I found at least Michael one of them. Okay. I think well, I, I can see them. Too. And they're, it's usually surrounded by various snacks. I love, I love how it looks like a vaguely smile. Dope. Like there's so little thought going on in that in that axolotl's mind. The the real clean. one or the one I drew? No, no, no. Sorry, the the real one, the photo that's yeah. like. Oh YouTube. shit! I fucking like, ran over that and didn't smile, die. But very empty. Head empty, no thoughts. <laughs> in my like, element, I'm just living in the empty. moment. That snacks that that axolotl's just no phone in sight, just living in the moment. That snacks a lot. That snacks a lot. Blah, 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 blah. Was, I left at one of your streams the other day, and for like an hour, every time a wad mentioned Doom Guy in the text, you kept saying Doom Kids. <laughs> oh shit! I'm so sorry. Like, it was like Doom Guy. Are you happy about out. that? I don't know. It's oh, unusual. right, this. I just thought it was amusing. I know, I know. You're probably rolling your eyes at me. Don't do that. You'll get stuck in the back of your head. <laughs> Don't roll them. <laughs> That's something like your mom would tell you or something. You'll get stuck that way. Yeah. You'll, you'll just be stuck staring at your own brain all day. Glory, okay. <laughs> oh, wow. You know, I did like the avatar you had drawn on 20 minutes. I actually liked its snacks. Oh. I mean, it was, I I, I did like it too, but just the facial expression this oh, one was killed me. I see, well, yeah, I can't decide it. <laughs> the vague contentment just killed me. I don't know what it is. Knee tall in the... D Knee tall. Trying to figure out what Doom Kids means that? by K T I T D. Knee tall in the dead. Knees and tits in the dead. <laughs> Glory to our Stotska. Glory to our Stotska. Oh yes. Oh, we got the two keys. <laughs> oh, is it? Are you okay? Still yeah. Alive? Yeah. Alive? Oh, or is that okay. Wilster? Oh, it it's a lovely day. You were sitting there just going, whimpering like, like the Chuck E. Cheese rat before he says, <laughs> The Chuck E. Cheese rat whimpers? No, 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 no. He whimpers after he says poggers. <laughs> what? 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 Like. Oh. what? <laughs> what? 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 Anything. <laughs> Uh, you wouldn't laugh, Sam. No, you would. It, it's it's the thing where this weird, you know, the Chuck E. Cheese mouse mascot thing. Is that where 
poggers came from? That can't be it. No, it's not where it came from. That can't God, be. It's not where it came from, but there's this, like, um, the Chuck E. Cheese thing, like, did a live stream on the internet. <laughs> oh, no. I, I can't remember if they used it. Did they use it? was like a VTuber model, right? Guys? Oh, no. no. It was like a hand oh, puppet. Oh, no. Oh, it was a hand puppet. Okay. Well, like, yeah. he just, he's while he's streaming, he just, out of nowhere, just goes, Poggers! <laughs> oh, jeez. He just, he just the says chat it really kept funny. asking him to say it, Cringe. and he like, he didn't know if he was allowed to say it or not. So he's like, "It was bad, Gary," and then he, he starts sure. whimpering. He Bogers. wasn't sure if it was a slur or what, or why people wanted to get, get him to say it so bad. <laughs> and then after he's like twitching the puppet around too, like its head is just going, <laughs> like it's <laughs> what the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's so unique. Did we post that? Cause you should post that. Uh. <laughs> oh, the dead is still giggling me too. Fuck. A T I T D. Um. Oh shit. He's <laughs> in tits in the dead. Oh what? Shit. Come on. The grenades are so frustrating when you're trying to break it when blow up a crack in the wall. Yeah, I just ended up they using the fucking cannon. Back. Oh, this has to move, yeah. I think you go press the button. Yeah. I think. He just Whoa. throws up! The wall opens, he throws up. Oh shit! <laughs> you caught him in the middle of his quiet, his private time. He just like Where opens it up. Yeah. Oh, 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 glory to us, thrust, uh, uh, G. Oh, no. There's zombies. They don't care about that shit. They just want to eat your brains. Hey, zombie. That's rude. <laughs> hmm. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> More. Ploggers. What's that meme where it like describes what Chuck E. Che how gross Chuck E. Cheese is? Just like, hey, here's our rat. Let's fucking eat some rat pizza with all these children coughing Wait. around you. What? Why was this? What ad are you talking about? What's no, it was like ad? a meme about how gross Chuck E. Cheese is as a concept. But you don't um, know where it came. Temperature 15 Celsius, that. humidity 80%. Hmm. 15 gross. Celsius? Oh, okay, that's not too bad. Uh, yeah, but it's a it's a wet heat. Oh shit! Is that wait? I forget who's it supposed to be. Was a good album. Is that, uh, is that a, a communist album? party official? Yeah, that, uh, I wonder who it is right. though. It probably nobody you've heard of. I mean, I'm really going to check if I'm walking a communist. I don't think that's Gustav. <laughs> I, I assume he's the one in power. My, in my, you know, like 1980s Czechoslovakian politicians. Why not? <laughs> What's your fucking problem? You can take people, this outside, bro. People know like Brezhnev and Khrushchev just, and uh, No, oh. why do you want to hit me? <laughs> I should really take your You don't know Eastern Bloc leaders of the 1980s? You don't know so you should really uh see somebody about that all that weird oh. pent up aggression you got there, buddy. Nikolai Ceausescu, oh god, that guy's infamous. Kim Jong, Kim Il Sung actually got the idea to do a personality cult from him. Oh so, yeah, that was the Romanian dictator, right? Yeah. Why is there a thread in Doom General called Two Baron of Hell Anatomy? Fuck, that guy's running. What? Oh shit. The... Oh shit. Bye. What'd you say, Doom Kid? He was asking why someone made a thread called Two Baron of Hell Anatomy, which sounds like it might be fucking questionable. No, that was, um, wasn't, that was the thread about, um, drawing anatomy or something. The guy learning to draw anatomy so he could draw a baron. Oh, okay. All right. I believe it was something like that. Not, one of one. That, not, not the kind of thread of like, uh, why does the caco have two buttholes? <laughs> oh, I don't know why. Of, why would you don't complain about threads. that? It's just well, like, uh, you know, it depends on how much he has to shit. Like yeah, but I never figured out how to get little. past that uh, that one sarcophagus. It's too bad. Oh, Sargonicus? 
Sargana for Kata kiss. Well, oh, bless you. Sardine of a cod, dude. The best YouTuber. Clement well, Gottwald, 1896 okay, to 1953. Yeah. Uh, hey, buddy. That's <laughs> illegal. Uh, hi. It looks like he's he the first handsome. leader of the Czech Communist oh. Park. I'm I'm guessing I can't actually, like... It's an elevator. You shoot yeah, the yeah, electrical yeah, I know. block. I just I was wondering if I could... And then he goes down. We oh. goodbye. Eh, is he gonna like? Oh, the, grave is super oh, the refrigerator. Uh -huh. Oh, the exhibition. Yeah, this is where they put them down to, uh, you know, re, you know, make sure they're nice and uh, like limber. Restuffing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> got, got beakers of oatmeal. Cool. They, maybe they maybe they filled them with oatmeal. <laughs> oh yeah, folks, the whole beaker of oatmeal. Okay, oh. seriously, that's gross. It's the whole beaker. We wanted the best, beaker but it turned out like oatmeal, always. Folks. Oh man, that's actually depressing. <laughs> that's like the uh, whole boy. experiment. In Eastern a, European humor. Oatmeal. Oh, folks, it's a bit oh, no. more oatmeal. Don't go beagle. into the tower. Uh. Wait a it's minute. Right about the big beaker of oatmeal. I don't think this actually does anything, but it no, made me want to. No, no, no. no. You're ruining your life. Okay. <laughs> Shut up, Dad. That's not funny anymore. It is. Yes, it is. Shut you just up. Hate, you, you just idiot. have no sense of humor. It's kind of disappointing. Oh. Yeah. You can it, try. I, I mean, you, you do have a point because I have you guys on the stream. Well, I mean. That sandwich, you, you can try to win. You're the one who's lacking a life. humor sandwich. Sorry. We're all, we're all having a good time, though. Whenever someone makes a joke, you're just like, oh, that's, that's not funny, guys. It's fucking stupid. And then now just, Dark Pulse wants some like maple and brown sugar oatmeal. That does sound good. <laughs> oh, God. Please. Oh, he was, so he was the first leader of the Czech Communist Party. Oh, yeah. Makes sense. Beef jerky oatmeal. So he's uh, quite oh. beloved, I guess, oh, at this point. Oh, sorry. I'm I'll try not... to get. Yeah. This is a very black dream. We have no humor oh. here, okay? Black yeah. licorice. Black licorice no, eggs? No, nothing with black licorice, please. That is not okay, good stuff. Okay, time black... to fight Gottwald. Black licorice is delicious. Uh, I knew it. What? <laughs> uh, we hey, fight Gottwald. Oh cool. no, he's got a giant pipe! No, he's a spider. No, but he's, he has a giant pipe in his mouth and he's a spider. Man. He doesn't do that with us. And now he's I fucking he's dead. <laughs> Get bent, dude. It's he, like the He cynics. literally did. He got bent and burnt. Yeah. And in it's Z like he's sin. such a pushover. Oh! oh. <laughs> I love how his legs curl up like a dead insect. That's great. Try to That's stuff great. that with oatmeal up. now. Suckers. Fuck you and your oatmeal pictures. Like black licorice oatmeal. <laughs> oh, fuck! Stop! 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 That is most disgusting. You I... don't. You don't like black licorice? Oh, it, oh wait, fireworks! Not, <laughs> like, Hooray! Never, we did it. Licorice, but come on, black. it's not good clear for oat. Black licorice is like uh, one of the best things. Ever. Rip in jibs is her name. Uh, Right, well, again, the only good licorice I've had is certain kinds of red licorice. Black licorice, Ew. I guess. The only black licorice I've had it was never very sweet or something because... Yeah, it's supposed to be really bitter. Mm, like, yeah. Oh, uh, uh, Chukum says like that, one, that one coffin was fake then. Or maybe he just got up when I wasn't looking, you know? Yeah, probably something like that. See if the fake's still in there? Uh, can you even do that? I wonder. I, I think it... You, you know what? I think he did get up. Things, huh? What? Well, you're generally not a fan of sweet things. I mean, you mentioned not liking chocolate earlier, and now you said you don't like red licorice. Fight. Oh, I'm look, he got like up! Actually, oh, I got an achievement! Where's Gothwald? <laughs> Where's Gothwald? <laughs> Thanks, Chuka. Where, where did he go? <laughs> not everything, but I, I like sweetness a lot less than most people. I was getting the feeling, because 
Chocolate and red licorice are both tend to be like crowd pleasers. So when you said you didn't like them, I was like, hmm, okay. Sour is a better mm. taste. Oh, not All right. Sour is pretty good. Salsi, sour, and sour. Sandwich stream. I'll know exactly what uh, uh, treats to are. Beef stroganoff recipe. What you need? What? 500 grams of sirloin steak, 200 grams of butt mushrooms, 2 DCL of sour oh, cream. Mushroom? Decibels. Decibels, really? <laughs> what? That doesn't make sense. This is really <laughs> loud yeah, sour cream. Jesus. <laughs> two two decibels of sour cream. I guess it's really quiet, actually, sour cream. Uh, one DCL red wine, one can tomato paste, onion, pickled cucumbers, butter, pepper, salt. So this is a, if you guys want. Let me see one. I'm not going to read all this, but serve with rice, garnish with a scoop of sour cream and cube-shaped slices of cucumber. It's very important that they're cubed. Deciliter, 0 0.2 of a liter. Okay. Turns groaning. <laughs> I can't... Oh, look at this dog just hanging out in this fucking... <laughs> yeah, oh. This he's is the most heinous fucking hellhound I've ever seen in this, like... He's getting... He's, he's steam cleaning the dog. Is this a is this a hellhound, like, steam bath facility? I want to pet it. Up. So there's dank hoping... stuff here. What's Guys. dank stuff? The in-game's links to Doom Wads are apparently not fast enough for this person. You got the best year. Pedro! Oh, I that. Hey, so the pig spit is Pedro, Masco, oh, okay. Pedro. Okay, I so, want it to do everything SUP. for me. It's like Fierce time. gorilla. Yeah. Gorilla. Do you want someone to tie yeah, your right. shoes for you in the morning too? Kill Confident. <laughs> Confident. <laughs> okay, that would be really it's nice. Maybe then it wouldn't have overall Scapucci. Scapucci. I'll, I'll, son, you're ruining your life. Surat. You need to tie your shoes. Kedge the Vic. Or I don't know if the J's silent there. You're gonna get the belt, boy. Well, uh, hazmat suit. Already yeah. have a belt. Right oh, now. that's a minor. Okay, I see. Back foot. Gonna take my pants off and whip you. Oh, I got confused. What your? Simic the horse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at him when he's sitting down. That's a big oh. ass horse. That's Jesus. Jesus. Yeah, horses are usually cool. large animals. I mean, yeah, like, I he's, he's, like, like thick. Small. Like, he's a thick-ass horse. Last don't horse get, I saw. Don't like, get like, horse. Damn! Put oh, <laughs> this helicopter horse. down here, like, chilling. He's just sitting oh, chilling dude, down I love here. the way it's, like, nodding its yeah. head. Along <laughs> <the back>. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to go out and... Now. I can't wait to bomb some to Dongos. <laughs> it's definitely Kim listening John. to What is Love right now. What is the Baby, don't <laughs> hurt me. <laughs> oh, what? That's the guy I just saw dead on the ground. Did I even shoot that guy? I can't remember. No, he just likes to spread the Cosmo, wide. No, the, the Cosmo is not an enemy. He just falls out of the sky right I didn't even see that. Damn it. You didn't see him. You missed you missed that set piece. Yeah, I wasn't looking. He just fell in uh, front of like the Cosmonaut like uh, memorial. Which is pretty funny. Yeah, he, that? he just falls I... out. Goat? <laughs> <laughs> the fucking, the fucking are... horse thing is called goat. What do they call that where you do the... The, like gymnastics stuff on it. I don't know. A goat. <laughs> a goat, I guess. You're talking about the horse or whatever they call horse. it. The, uh, fuck yeah, that, skull no. spider. They call it the fucking saddle Loda. horse. I really thought that other loader I saw was going to attack me, but they. No wait. The... They call it secretariat. Gotwald? <laughs> Temporary secretariat? Oh. Look at that giant ass pipe he's got. It's pretty good. <laughs> Hobby horse or pommel horse says Dark Pulse. Dark Pulse just knows everything. He's new. He's the new Don't Doom kid. I know plenty. You just didn't hear me because you're deaf and think you're on garbage or something. What's the last one? Uh, oh, her neck mentioned that one. Oh, the giant spider. Her neck's giving you f your facts and you're ignoring them, Sand. You're ignoring that you're. Semek is the horse from a story that jumped down from Vaisarad right into the Vitava River. Yeah, don't erase his culture. Listen to him. <laughs> <laughs> don't make this about that. 
Two Eastern. And like, yeah, Eastern block. I would pretty much wipe it off the face of the earth if I could. But, uh... <laughs> Jesus yeah. Christ, dude. You're, dude that's horrible. you're like Hitler. You think Slavs are inferior race, even though they're like. <laughs> I mean, no. no. Abort. Same as a Abort. Oh, you can see everything from behind. <laughs> cool. I can see everyone's butt. Yeah, look at his sick backpack. It's cool. <laughs> it's a great skill to have. That's not backpack. Ba it's look at like that turret's ass. Oh Damn, shit, boy! Damn, that, that, that girl's got a butt like a dump truck. <laughs> no, no, Thick no, ass no, gorilla. It's the cousin of the manky bot. <laughs> Pedro. What did you say, Snacks? I said don't. Oh, okay. look at this horse. Don't, don't. <laughs> Look at this guy still chilling out, man. Oh, He's still. God. What is the <laughs> baby? Don't hurt me. Helicopter. Don't hurt me. Helicopter. No more. Bye, Will. Bye, hey, Wilster. Will. This guy's taking a <laughs> space shit. No, he's squatting. I, I he wonder why his legs over a grate. Oh, so why? Because he's squatting. Slab squat. Yeah, but like that's wide. That's why. Yeah. Does he have a hole back there? <laughs> what the fuck? Of course he does. What else is he gonna, you know? Oh <laughs> my god. Oh He's god. Gottwald has He's a hole. For a night. Okay. He's a man like any of us. No, not really, but okay. Uh, there's also the recipe. And uh, there's also the handheld, which is actually... Hey, look at this. It's, it's uh, Look, it's wait and see. This is apparently a cart a Russian cartoon character based on. It's like a little wolf guy who oh, I can't remember the specific. It was oh, been wait, a long what? time. Oh. It was the American or English name of it was Wait and See. This is pretty good. If I had this, this as a kid, damn, that would have been awesome. I had. I remember I had a couple of crappy Tiger Electronic games like this. I, I still remember, like, one of the first video games I can remember playing is one of those Tiger Electronic, like, it's like a space shooter, and I just absolutely love that thing. Yeah. Oh, Just yeah. You Wait is apparently a more accurate uh, conversion or translation than Wait and See. Well, whatever fucking oh. game I had get was poorly translated in that case. Oh, yeah, if Google's you're... notorious for being badly translated. I remember I was trying to translate stuff between a, a French friend of mine and I would show him something in French oh, and I'd be like, nah, God, that's completely God. wrong. Like, wow, Google's just I straight just up lying to me. me. Everybody knows Tiger games are awful. Even oh. though I enjoyed the Star Wars when I got. I was doing so good. That was a pretty good streak you had going there, Sand. So, uh, I'm guessing Can you don't do get anything way, for like doing that well, but you know, it's kind of funny. There's like a Go rabbit yelling at me. You don't get an achievement or something? Oh, that's, you know what, yeah, you probably do get an achievement for something. A hundred cents, it's, it's actually like fairly... It, it actually fucks with your mind because um, the last one is the egg in the air. So like, just, you feel like, you feel like you have to go before it's in the air, but you don't. Have you yeah. ever seen a duck? Yeah. Uh, in real life, because yes. Ducks don't exist. Movie. Oh, they're a conspiracy by the government. That's right. They're like drones watching us. Birds yeah. aren't real. <laughs> they're starting to emulate those in MAME. Tiger, why? Why would you ever bring those back? <laughs> yeah. right? Let them die <laughs> off. Tiger is so, like, as the angry video game nerd said, <laughs> it's so outdated it was never in dated. I mean, this was, this was probably the best video game. Well, I guess they didn't really have much in the... Maybe you have a Pong machine. I don't know what they had in like I mean, Easter Europe at the time. This was probably the best you got for a while, I guess. This is not really tight. This is more to be the nerd. This is really more like Game & Watch, the original thing that Tiger ripped off, essentially. Yeah. And, right. uh, back then, though, when Game & Watch was still current, it was like pretty, you know, they didn't have much else to work with. Uh, when Tiger was doing it, it's strictly because it was cheap. <laughs> Dark Paul says because <laughs> preservation doesn't care about elite Canuck snobbery. Well, yeah, like I, oh, I'm geez. a preservationist to some degree as well, but I don't need to preserve every like cheeseburger wrapper I've ever thrown out. You know what I mean? Why not? <laughs> Can That's I elitist. have them then? 
Yeah, it's kind of like for Zuri ancient Japanese. There's probably game that, some like, poor. There's, there's probably letters. some sad prick out there who preserves Tiger Game. <laughs> I, they're talking about it. Um, no, well, like, so like Tiger was cool, and like if you didn't, no, it if, wasn't. No, no, if you like never played another video game before, you're just like, oh shit. Um, but also, they were po- if you didn't have access to any other portable game system, it was the best you had, and it was pretty cool. There's a couple that worked okay. Like this one, for example, that we're looking at is not too bad. Like, you know, if you're on the bus or something, it's a good way to kill five minutes. Yeah. Some of them were okay Or taking that. a shit. I mean, <laughs> why did you bring it into the fucking toilet? But anyway. The, what do you the, mean? The... People take their phones in the toilet. Hello? <laughs> Yeah, well, that's a phone. You, someone can call you with an emergency. <laughs> Please don't call. I would not answer a call. <laughs> it, it, it only receives. People it, it used to read the paper. People used to read the paper when taking this shit. Now they read it on a Kindle. That's no. a. I don't. Uh, what if someone else. You wants shouldn't to be read shitting so long that you need to sit down and read the paper, honestly. <laughs> I, re- I just remember hearing so many stories of people accidentally dropping their phones in the toilet. After I've the- done that before. <laughs> I've I got my phone on my face. There before. you go. Never, never in the to- you to know what? Fair, the toilet was I empty, can... and I instinctively reached in and just pulled it out as soon as it fell in. Oh, well, of course. Well, that's you okay then. Did the but phone like, still work? The- yeah. I, I've had a I wasn't you I had a phone fall in the toilet once too, but it's because it was in my pocket and I stood up like too quickly I think and my phone just fell out and happened That's what to, happened to me away. too. I hate that shit so much. Yeah. But yeah. It's so fucking if, intense, guys. If you turn off your phone immediately and then just leave it off until it completely dries, it can be okay. Yeah, you gotta like sure. I've heard putting it with rice helps, but I'm, I haven't tested that. Just make sure it's off because. The discharge electricity short circuiting it destroys everything. Shut up! Yeah. No, you're gonna get it, San. I'm gonna keep talking so you can get it. You're, no, you need you're... my moral support. Oh my Ooh, god. It's eggs. Just call it already. It's fucking stupid. It's eggs. But sandwich. No! <laughs> no, shut no. up! You were hey. one shy. Oh, jeez. This is why, like, I don't play arcade games because. Why did you, you fuck I'm... me up? It's all your no, fault. Can't wait. It's all, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's Come not. On. It's not. Shut up. I can't concentrate now. Come on, get back on the saddle. Get back on the goat. No, yeah, not the they goat. Were the horse. Goat Pommel horse. <laughs> oh fuck off. Oh, the, the fucking right chick comes BS, out yeah. of the egg and just walks away. <laughs> what the fuck? I doesn't surprised. want to be near you, you loser. That's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's just... Um, oh, I actually got an extra life, I think. Huh. Extreme rice. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't even know. Oh, yes, I swear that it, uh-huh, it looked like you were going to catch that one. I, uh... That was don't know what one. the achievement is. Maybe it's... If it's a hundred oh in a there row, I'm going to be pissed. Things gonna be extremely pissed if I almost got that. Uh let me, are worth sure anyway. be in a row. That would Don't be worry about cool. Uh is it I wonder if it shows up on the steam or if it's like hidden. I think you can unhide them. There's a bunch of achievements I haven't gotten here. Run over ten monsters? Oh I guess in the thing. Discover a secret of Visserod Castle. Uh, oh, okay, I got this one. Uh, achieve a score of 200 points on a handheld game. Okay, that's actually 200. quite a bit. You were at 130 or something. I mean, so. it wasn't really a hard game. But... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not that hard. It's a little tricky, though. Uh, well, yeah, I think that's going to do it for the stream. Um hey, God. Why are you here, Lee? It was fun. Jesus. It was fun. I had a really good time playing just a whole bunch of fun shooters. Uh, yeah, I guess it was. Did. You got told Santa Claus is fake when you were five, and that's why you had no sense of humor. You kept making fun of my jokes and saying they were a pad. 
I played uh, Ion Fury, uh, Dusk, and Hrot, and unfortunately had a stupid issue with Duke, so hopefully I can fix that, but I'll have to see how I proceed from here if I want to focus on one of these games for a stream or something. Um, sort of, uh, I think Hrot Episode 2 would be fun to do for something, but I'm not sure for a stream or for a, my own videos, maybe. Can you play KTITD? The episode of Doom? Uh, uh, Jesus Christ. What's that? Knee tall in the dead? But what, is it actually, what is it actually? <laughs> <laughs> it's me typoing on Doom World. That's what oh, it is. Oh, I see. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, Turok 1. Uh, I played through Turok 1. I'm not hey. actually a big fan. I wouldn't, I wouldn't play that again. It's all... It, yeah. I okay. used to play yeah. Turok 2 a lot. I, I used to own a copy of it on, on the 64. Loved it. No one asked. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, My goodness. <laughs> Snax is in a good mood, everybody. Uh, I am yeah, so tired. I... Then go to bed, you bitch! A medieval? Oh. Yeah, I mean, I beat a medieval. Oh. I, you know, um, I think next time part. I'm either going to main one of these games that I played and try to beat, what, uh, beat it, or... Um, Duke 3D, Blood, Shadow Warrior, uh, possibly uh, maybe Redneck Rampage uh, Route 66 because that's supposed to be actually good. Um, that's the expansion or the sequel? I don't know. Expansion, um, I think. Uh, supposed to be actually like, you know, designed as like actual FPS levels and not whatever Redneck Rampage is. Route 66? Uh, yeah. It's too Sucking bad. grits All on Route 66. Um, I definitely want to try a Hrot episode two, but I might I might just play that on my own to be honest, just so I can really absorb it and enjoy it uh, myself. But maybe yeah, I'll do a video you after. You that. don't want us here. You don't want us being rude and shit. Even though we're just trying to keep things lively, but you are just a stick in the mud. No sense. Yeah, either. I'm just a real stick in the sand, and, everybody. And you uh, are, yeah, look at that. You're, did you just say a real wedge in the, in the sand, sand, right? You know? <laughs> Quit being such a stick in the sand rather than the dirt, <laughs> you know what I mean? Alrighty, uh, thanks everybody in the chat for uh, sticking around and having fun here. I hope you uh, enjoyed and maybe uh, maybe yeah. you saw a game I here that you'd it. like to maybe try out if you have. Most of them don't matter. No, they could, they could screw up. I enjoyed it. That's good enough, okay? Ah, uh, everybody enjoyed it. If they didn't, they wouldn't be here. So, yeah. GG. Shout GG. out to the wedgies. Shout out to the all the Hulkamaniacs out there. All the wedge wedge maniacs. <laughs> uh, good night. Hey. There we go.